Alright, Shalom, we the Hebrew Israelites. We come here week in and week out to prophesy the downfall of this wicked, sinful kingdom called America, which is AKA Babylon the Great, AKA Sodom and Gomorrah, AKA Egypt, AKA Rome. Okay, before we move forward, we want to give all praises, honor, and glory to the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son, Yahweh, Bashim, Yahushai, Bashim, Rakapadash. Double honors to the apostles and the elders, the great millstone for teaching us the 100% truth according to the Bible and who will well. Double shalom to all you Akim and you Akwa, those in the old elect that are seeking for salvation. Like we always do, we want to introduce the real 12 tribes of Israel. You can see here, a little bootleg today, Salakia. Okay, come on, come on, you got them back. I appreciate it, bro. You got Judah, the so-called Negroes, Benjamin, the so-called West Indians, Levi, the so-called Haitians, Simeon, the so-called Dominicans, uh, Zebulon, the so-called Guatemalans to Panamanians, Ephraim, the so-called Puerto Ricans, Manasseh, the so-called Cubans, Gad, the so-called North American Indian tribes, Reuben, the so-called Seminole Indians, Nephtali, the so-called Argentinians to Chileans, Asher, the so-called Colombians to Uruguayans, and last but not least, Issachar, the so-called Mexicans. If you see yourself on a sign, according to the seed of your father, repent before it's too late because Yahweh Shah, who the world ignorantly calls Jesus, is about to return. Yep, yep, yep. That's right, that's right. You know, we're the prophesy, man. You know, and as the, the hot topic, you know what I'm saying, in the news mm -hmm. lately, you know, World War III, you know, is uh, pretty much growing up, man, more and more. You know, and according to the scriptures, that's prophecy, man. Okay? Yep. The book of Habakkuk. <clears throat> no. See, because that's the, that's the spirit of the Ahab is putting out here, man. The spirit of destruction. All right? The MOTV, which is the, uh, the, the, the CHIP. All right? That's right around the corner. You know? We got the wars, the rumors of wars going on right now. Oh, this is prophecy, which is the spirit of Lord Yahweh Shah. Right. Habakkuk 2 and 3. Habakkuk. Start at 1. Habakkuk 2 and 1. I will stand upon my watch and set me upon the tower and will watch to see what he will say unto me and what I shall answer when I am reproved. Right, because uh, Habakkuk was a prophet. Okay? And Yahweh Bashim Shah put him on the, the highest uh, point of the tower to be a watchman, man. Right. Unto the house of Israel, which consists of the so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native American Indians. Right. Now we're doing the same thing spiritually, man. Right. And what we're watching out for, we're watching out for the prophecies, man. You know, that's how we're able to uh, see the signs and the times that Lord Yahweh Shah told us to look forward to before, before he returns. Right. It says, and we'll watch to see what he will say unto me and what I shall answer when I am reproved. Mm -hmm. Verse two says, and the Lord answered me and said, write the vision and make it plain upon tables. Now the vision is talking about the prophecies, man. You know, it says make it plain upon table, no in the book. And that's what he did, man. You know, write it down, write down what you see, you know, and what you're prophesying about. That they may what? <laughs> that they may run that readeth it. Right, that they may run that readeth it, meaning to understand it, man. Yeah. And in these times that we're living in now, we're able to understand the last day's prophecies that the prophets saw back in the ancient times, man. Right. Okay? And we're prophesying about the prophecies before they happen, like Isaiah 42 and 9 said, man. Mm -hmm. Verse 3 says, For the vision is yet for an appointed time. Right, for the vision, which is the prophecies, is set. All right, time, time, time. All right, so let me read that again. Um, sure. Habakkuk 2 and 3. For the vision is yet for an appointed time. And once again, the vision is referring to the prophecies, man. 
is for, and it's for an appointed time. As a matter of fact, the definition of the word appoint, it means to arrange a date or time when a meeting or other event will happen. Yep. And who is going to orchestrate that? Yeah, how about Shimmy our shot, man? Because the Lord is the one that's putting the spirit on these uh these uh troops and these people to prepare for war, man. All right, the water in our wars, World War Three, you know. But of course, before that happens, you got the uh, the mandate of the MOTB, which is the CHIP, man. Okay, according to Revelation that three and ten, you know, yep. the hour temptation. Yep. Let me bring this right quick. You just you just uh -huh. said something through the spirit. Mm -hmm. You said that the Lord is putting on the leaders, putting on these leaders' minds, these spirit to yep. to go get ready for war, right? Yep. Proverbs twenty one and one, the king's heart. It's in the hand of the Lord. Right, the king's heart is in the hands of the Lord, man. Mm -hmm. These different leaders, man. Okay? Yahweh by Shimon Shah is the one that's mustering the host of this battle, man. You know? And as you can see, you know, it's increasing. All right? It says, Proverbs 21 and 1, the king's heart is in the hand of the Lord. Right, so that proves that there's no free will either. Right. Okay? Just like Pharaoh. Yahweh by Shimon Shah is controlling the mind of Pharaoh, man. Mm -hmm. That's what the word heart was back to your mind. Okay? The Lord was the one that hardened Pharaoh's heart, just like he's hardening these, these wicked elites' hearts, man. That's right. Because yep. all these, these leaders in these different nations, like Putin and, you know, like yep. you mentioned, the elites and yep. all these other nations, like um, the, the leader for North Korea, yep. Kim Jong Un, all, all the, they're basically kings. Yep. You know? Yep. AKA leaders. Yep. It says, as the rivers of water, he turneth it whithersoever he will. Yep, so the Lord is turning them to do exactly what he wants them to do. Like the brother mentioned through the spirit, yep. there's no such thing as free will. So the Lord is putting on the spirit of uh, these uh, these leaders, uh, speaking of Putin specifically, he's putting on the spirit of Putin to have that ancient war spirit, man, that Cold War spirit, yep. you know? So that's why you see all these uh, <clears throat> things happening over in Ukraine, okay? The Lord is, is, rising, is, is making these, these leaders think this way. So going back to Habakkuk 2 and 3, yep. for the vision is yet for an appointed time, yep. but at the end it shall speak. Right, at the end it shall speak, and we in those times now of it uh, speaking, it means it coming to pass, man. You know, now uh, what the elder apostles, the elder bishops have been preaching for 30 plus years, back then it was far-fetched for this to happen. Hell yeah. Now it's happening, man. Mm -hmm. You ain't got so much scoffers and scorners yeah. no more. Now I read the scoffer, it was a, a scoffer on Elder Apostle Kahar's uh, comment for it. He was like, yeah, I can tell that you don't got no faith. How can the man that been preaching this word for 30 right. plus years, there's been uh, prophesying about this day, now he's seen it, now he ain't got no faith. Right. That's like saying Michael Jordan don't, don't like basketball. Yeah. Oh, man. All, all the effort he put in, he put towards all that, you know, he been doing it for years. Yeah. All the accolades, all the things he's done, man. Yeah. You know? Because, you, you know, you, you, your faith is measured by, you know, by your works. works. That's right. By your works, That's you know. Right. So going back to Habakkuk 2 and 3, yep. it says, but at the end it shall speak and not lie. Right, yeah, and they ain't lying now because you see it's right in front of your face. It's on mainstream media, man. Mainstream news, okay? Mm -hmm. The thing that we've been telling you for years, starting off with the head of apostles, the elder bishops on down, now you're starting to see it, man. That's right. But the end ain't yet, though. That's right. It's only going to intensify okay that's right it says reading on though it tarry wait for it mm -hmm. because it will surely come it will not tarry it ain't tarrying no more it ain't the land no more it's right around the corner oh yeah the end of esau even's rulership which is the so-called white people there their rulership is about to come to an end very very soon man because now we're seeing the signs that like lo yahweh shah said more and more man okay it's right in front of your face now. You can't hide from it. That's right. You can't deny it. You yep. got the so-called UFOs, the chariots, their sight, their sight is increasing. You gotta go to the bathroom, bro? You know? You can't hide this no more. Hey, bro. You know? You gotta go to the bathroom? Oh, okay, okay. Done, done, done. So, yeah, you know? It's right in front of your face. You can't hide it, okay? You can't deny it no more. It ain't no conspiracy theory no more. It's in your face. That's right. I'm going to read the uh, NOT of uh, Africa oh, 2 and 3. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it says, this vision is for a future time. Uh-oh. The time that we're living in now. Yep. You know, because this was written during the time of Habakkuk. Man. Yep. Habakkuk was seeing the, the last days prophecy that's going to happen in this generation. 
Quran. It says, it describes the end. It says, and it will be fulfilled. And it will be fulfilled, man. Because the Lord is not a man that he should lie. And he said that this place was going to go down by destruction of this third war as well. So what's going to happen, man? That's right. And also the return of William Howard Shah with the uh, the chariots. So if our UFOs, the shoe laser beams on this place, man. That's right. It says, if it seems slow in coming, mm -hmm. wait patiently, mm -hmm. for it will surely take place. Yep. It will not be delayed. Right, yeah. It, yeah. Starting off with the head apostles and other bishops, man. That's been pushing this for 30 plus years. They've been patiently waiting. On down to the symposium that came in in 2007, 2008, you know, on down to us. Mm. We've been patiently waiting for these, these prophecies to come to pass right. faster and faster. Now they're happening, man. That's right. And it's only increasing our faith, our faith much, much more, man. That's right. Like I was watching the, uh, the elder bishop, and the elder bishop to Zion was like, uh, uh, I think like uh, uh, it was somebody. It was one of the elders. It was like one of his exes. Yeah. Called him because it was the LC in World War, uh, the LC in Ukraine and Russia. Yeah. It was like, oh, what was that scripture about? Uh, what word did you just talk about years ago? Wow. Uh, now you want to call now, man. Wow. You know? Yep. That's going to happen more and more, yep, man. more and more. You know, hey, big head, long time no hear. Right. You know, trying to get back in good. You know, all the stuff that, that the Lord has put on our spirit to warn our people about, they thought we were crazy. Mm -hmm. We were starting with our apostles, our teachers, yep. our elders. Yep. And now you're seeing everything coming to pass. Now it's not far-fetched yep. that this is going to be a cashless society. Yeah. Now it's not far-fetched that America will be destroyed by thermonuclear destruction. It's evident. Okay, it's evident. It's evident. I want to bring this priest up here, if, if I may. Ezekiel 12 and 25 says, For I am the Lord, Yahweh Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai. I will speak, and the word that I shall speak shall come to pass. Right, and the Lord speaks through his servants and prophets, man. Who's going to declare you the, uh, the actions of the Lord before they happen, man. Yep. And that's what we're doing now. Starting off for the elder apostles, the elder bishops on down, we've been telling you that it was going to uh, uh, be uh, more intensified, man. Uh -huh. That this was going to be the war to end all wars, man. Yes, sir. Okay? Now it's uh, slowly but surely happening now. That's right. We happy about it, bro. It sure is. <laughs> it says, it shall be no more prolonged, mm -hmm. for in your days, O rebellious house, yep. will I say the word and will perform it. Say of the Lord, Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai. Right, see, because when the Lord says something's going to happen, it's going to happen. It's just His time, man. Yep. We're on the Lord's time, you know? So now the Lord is like, all right, now it's time for me to, 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 to intensify and turn it up. Right. The year 2022. Going by Elder Apostle of the Heart, the Spirit, General Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai, the Dean this year, the year to turn up, man. That's right. And things are turning up. Right. Okay? You know, the false prophets, the, the uh -huh. true prophets, the, the wars. Mm -hmm. You know, everything's intensifying, oh, man. Yeah. <laughs> Prolong, I'm gonna bring definition. Prolong says, continuing for, for a long time or longer than usual, mm. lengthy. Mm. So Lord's not gonna uh, prolong it. He's not gonna, uh, you know, have us suffering through this hell any longer, you know? Cause really, you know, the Lord's speeding up time, you know, Lord willing, we're part of that number for the elect's sake, you know? And to bring back his heritage, his people. Um, Ezekiel 12 and 25 says, It shall be no more prolonged, for in your days, O rebellious house, yep. will I say the word and will perform it, said the Lord Yahweh Shemiah Shai. Those days are the days that we're living in now, man. The last days of the last days, man. Okay? Which is this generation, this time right here. All right. Okay? And Yahweh Shemiah Shai is going to turn it up even more, man. You know? More uh, rumors of wars, yep. more trash talks, yep. you know, more uh, of them getting caught on with each other. Uh -huh. All right? Yep. More division. Yep. More division, yep. Verse 26 says, again, the word of the Lord came to me saying, verse 27, son of man, behold, they of the house of Israel say, the vision that he seeth is for many days to come. Right, yeah, yeah, that's what they used to say, man. Okay? Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, my grandma been talking about that. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? For generations and generations. You know, that, that's going to happen a thousand or a hundred years from now, man. Right. That ain't going to happen in our generation. <laughs> but now, as you see, you know, hey, it ain't going to be no more. Right. All right? Everybody getting all these shit getting spooked out. Yeah, like, like, like the elder apostle said, man, now everybody's a prophet. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Now everybody want to dig into the scriptures now. Yep. 
Now everybody want to know who God can make. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm, yeah, y'all. It says, uh, reading on verse 27, says, the vision that he seeth is for many days to come. Right, the vision, once again, represents the prophecy. So the prophecies, they say that the prophecies that we talk about, it, that ain't going to happen no time soon, man. Yeah. Just to go and live your life, stop wasting your time. That's what they used to say. It reads on, and he prophesied for the days that are far off. Verse 28, therefore say unto them, thus says the Lord, Yahweh by Shem, Yahweh Shai, there shall none of my words be prolonged anymore. Right, and we're seeing it. You see? Now the Lord, now the Lord is bringing these uh, prophecies to pass now, right. man. You know, slowly but surely. You know, it's a gradual thing. Yeah. You know, it's only going to get worse, man. You know? It says, but the word which I have spoken shall be done, says the Lord, Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai. Right, see, so when the Lord says something is going to happen, it's going to happen, man. All right? No matter if the people that believe it or not. What if they don't believe? So the unbelief make the faith of Yahweh by Shem, Yahweh Shai without a faith. The Lord forbid, man. Yeah. So, no. It's happening, ain't it? You know, all them years that the elder apostles, the elder bishops been prophesying, how many people disagreed and, and didn't believe him, you know? Trickling down to us. Now, obviously, just still coming, popping off like popcorn, man. Mm -hmm. You got anything I got St. Matthew and Matthew that guy? St. Yep. Yep. Matthew 24 <clears throat> and 3. Yep, yep. exactly where I want to start. It says, And as he sat upon the Mount of Olives, the disciples came unto him privately, saying, Tell us when shall these things be, and what shall be the sign of thy coming? And the end of the world. Right, so they was inquiring about when is this man gonna get out of rulership, man? This Edomite, the so-called white people. Alright? When is it gonna be uh when you return and, and uh and take him out of rulership, man? They was inquiring. They was hasting the day of William Howard Shah's return. Just like mm -hmm. we are. Right. Well the scripture said be occupied in prophecy. The disciples were occupied in prophecy, you know? Yep. It says verse 4, and, and by the way, that, uh, that word world there is Aeon, which yep. means the age, which is uh, the rulership, man. So when is it going to be the end of this man's rulership? All right? Well, Yahweh Shai is about to say it. Verse 4 says, And Yahweh Shai answered and said unto them, Take heed that no man deceive you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because there's a lot of false prophets out here, man. You know, they say that the MOTB ain't the, the CHIP. They say it's uh, sleeping with white women. They say that you can have sex on the Sabbath. They're teaching all. They teaching things. They're adding and taking away from the scriptures, man. Right. And they're deceiving many. Right. The hearts of the simple. That's right. It says, verse five, for many shall come in my name, saying, I am Hamashiach. Right. It said, Lord, Yahushua said, many, man. Many shall come in my name, saying, I am the, 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 the anointed. I'm the savior, man. You see, you had guys that actually said that. And you got people that they claim that they come in the name of the Lord and say that, man. Mm -hmm. You know, but they're a bunch of false prophets and leaders, man. Yep. It says, saying, I am Hamashiach yep. and shall deceive many. And shall deceive many. And the word deceive pretty much means to lie or to seduce, okay? To lure them away from the truth, okay? How do they do that? By saying that the scriptures, when we say something means something according to the scriptures, they say it don't mean that. Right. It means something else, all right? Reading on, there's a consequence for that too. Verse six says, "And ye, and ye shall hear of wars and rumors of wars." Oh, we're hearing that now. Uh -huh. We in no times, man. You know, we're hearing wars and rumors of wars, man. It's getting hot over there. Uh -huh. Okay, Middle Eastern areas as well, man. That's not that's the hot zone. Uh -huh. You know. It says, "See that ye be not troubled." Right, we're not troubled, man. We're happy about this, man. This is, this is what Lord Yahweh Shah, who the word we call Jesus Christ, told us to look out for, man. So he said, when you see these, don't be, don't worry about it. They got to happen. It says, for all these things must come to pass, but the end is not yet. Yeah, all these things, which is the prophecies, must come to pass, man. So what's going to happen, whether people believe it or not? Right. But it says, but the end ain't yet, though. It's only the beginning, okay? It's only the beginning. Yahweh Bashi Mashiach is about to turn things up even more. All right, more, 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 more uh, deletions going on. Okay, more division, like the brother Ron said earlier. All right, more famines, more all that, man. All right. Verse seven says, "For nation 
shall rise against nations. It's going through those different riots, those race riots, all right? Civil on war, civil wars and all that. You know, that's gonna happen, okay? Yep. Very, very soon as well. That's blowing up. Yep. It says, reading on, and kingdom against kingdom. Right, that's going into World War Three. You see? That war to end all wars, man. Okay? We in them times now, man. Yep. And there shall be famines. There shall be famines, a lack of food, a lack of water, mm -hmm. a lack of resources. It also means the, the lack of the, uh, hearing the words of the Lord. Man. That's right. I'm going to Amos 8 and 11. That's going to be a famine of the word, man. Mm -hmm. not, the Lord is going to take his prophets from off of the streets. And I'm here today. All right. It says, and pestilences. And pestilences. You know, I read an article the other day that they said, uh, they got to do Windows 19 version 2, okay? That's uh, spreading rapidly fast. They, yeah. they make it up stuff, man. Right. But hey, 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 you see it, man. Yep. You know, it's the, 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 the pestilence is our increasing to crucify, man. It says it's earthquakes in diverse places. Yeah, earthquakes in diverse places, many in many places, man. All right? And everywhere is getting hit with earthquakes. The Lord is uh, deleting people out the program just by swallowing them up by the earth, man. Okay? Get, uh, smishing them with buildings and letting the house fall on top of them. Mm -hmm. Well, yeah, I was I said, these are the signs to watch out for before he returns. Verse 8 says, All these are the beginning of sorrows. All these are the beginning of sorrows. And they're sorrowful right now. Yep. I saw it on the news uh, while I was at the gym. There was like, uh, you had to uh, pray for Ukraine. You know, this is a sorrowful day. You know, they don't deserve to go through this. But they didn't say it about our people when we get into captivity. Right, so, right. They was like, oh, well, what would what, 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 what happen if you, if you was mistreated? You got your heritage taken away and taken over by another nation. I was like, this guy's in right. trouble, man. Well, the scripture said they hissed and clapped at us mm -hmm. when, when we were taken down. Yeah. And, and you know, they're Edomites, man. We want to see, we want to see this place get destroyed. We yes. want to see more war. We want to see more division. We want to see more death and destruction in this place, man, because we hate this place, man. You know, in order for that to happen, these things must come to pass. We're not praying for, for, for no, just gonna say, pray not down for this people, speaking about our people, but then also these heathens, man. We give a damn about these heathens. Um, let me bring out a precept card, maybe, unless you want something. You got anything? You got something? Bring it out. This is uh, Revelation. This is Revelations 11, chapter 14. It says, the second war is past. Right. Yep, which is going into World War II. Because war means the death and destruction. Okay? So the second war, that passed already. That already happened. That already been fulfilled. And behold, the third war cometh quickly. Right, and the third war, which is World War III, mm -hmm. cometh quickly, man. Right. And, and, and as you see, you know, it's near, it's getting near and near, man. Okay? The mandate of the MOTD is getting nearer and nearer as World War III is getting nearer and nearer. Okay? Because they're uh they put the money in manufacturing these uh these CHIPs, man. Yep. Okay? They're about to do away with the FRNs and the dollar, you know. Alright. I'm gonna bring this one right here. Uh second Ezra's nine and one. It says, matter of fact, I started 63. Second Ezra 8 and 63. Or 62. These things have I not shown unto all men, but unto thee. Right, because Ezra was a prophet. Alright? So he said, I haven't shown these things to all men. Alright, but I showed it unto you. Just like Lord Yahweh Shah said uh, to his disciples. You know? Uh, 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 pretty much, uh, he only gave them the mysteries to get in the kingdom of heaven, uh -huh. but unto them it ain't given, man. Yep, which that's represents right. the many, which is our people. That's right. It says, um, reading on Second Ezra eight and sixty-two, yep. these things have I not showed unto all men, but unto thee, and a few like thee, and a few like thee. See, it ain't all about uh, quantity; it's all about quality. Right. So the Lord said, if you like me, huh. who would that be? The service of the prophets. Start right. off with the head of apostles, the elder bishops on down, man. Who's coming in the spirit of Yahweh by Shadon Shah and breaking down the scriptures the right way. I was supposed to be broken down. Since you said that, 
bring this out right quick. The book of Amos, chapter 3, verse 7. Surely the Lord, Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, will do nothing. I mean it before he does something, what the Lord's going to do. But he revealed his secret unto the servants, the prophets. So before Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, bring these prophecies to pass that we're speaking and reading about right now out of the scriptures, you know, he's going to show his them to the service of the prophets and they're going to tell you about it they'll prophesy before it happens man mm -hmm. but the word prophesy means to say before and that's what we're doing right now mm -hmm. you know and brothers like us the elder apostles the elder bishop the brothers in the four corners of the earth doing what we're doing right now time second Ezra's 8 and 62 reading on and a few like thee then answered i and said verse 63 behold O lord now hast thou showed me the multitude of the wonders. Which is the signs, all right? Because he received a uh, uh, great many of uh, the prophecies, man, uh -huh. of the signs, uh -huh. you know, that lawyer Howard Shaw spoke about. Right. It says, <clears throat> which thou shalt begin to do in the last times. Which is these times that we're living in now, mm -hmm. in the last days of the last days, yep. okay? Whether people want to believe it or not, it says, but at what time thou has not showed me? And if I could just say too, going back to St. Matthew, when the disciples asked you how it shot, they basically asked you how it shot in a different way. Yeah. You know, how, how are you gonna know when is the end of this world? You know, they basically asked a different way. So these men, these these men, the disciples, the believers of Yahweh Shai, they're gonna be occupied in prophecy. They're gonna be wondering like, what's next? How can we tell when you're getting ready to return? You know what I mean? So that, that, that spirit of uh, being occupied in prophecy is very important, man. Verse uh, 2 Ezra 9 and 1 says, He answered me then and said, Measure thou the time diligently in itself. What's the measuring tool? The scriptures. It's Bible, man. And the spirit of Yahweh by Shema Shah got to be on you in order for you to filter it through the scriptures. Right. Okay? So the times that we're living in now, we know what times that we're living in because they're measuring by what the scriptures say. It says, And... When thou seest part of the signs past, which I have told thee before, Shalom. You know, which is by the service of the prophet. But that's who the Lord speaks to, you know, speaks through. You know, he tells you about these prophecies through the men that he set up to tell you. That's right. Okay? The same ones in Jeremiah 3 and 15 that's going to feed you for knowledge, wisdom, and understanding of the Bible. Verse 2 says, Then shalt thou understand that it is the very same time where when the highest will begin to visit the world which he made. Right, and where vision goes is to punish or to judge, man. You know, and that's the times that we're living in right now, man. We're living in a time when Yahweh Bashi Mao Shah sent a judgment out here, man. Hey, did y'all hear about that chick, no saying, that got um, that dog, no saying, um. Oh, that, uh, yeah, they got sap. Yeah. The, the dog bit off a of Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Pull that picture I'm fucking brazen everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Fearful. That was gruesome right there. Yeah, that's the judgment of the Lord right there. Yahweh Bashim al Shah is putting uh, judgment out here, man. You know? Teeth of wild beasts, that's yep. according to the Bible yep. right there. You know, that's going to be mauling these yep. people down. And you can see her brain. Like, when the brother sent the picture, you can see, like, pieces of her, 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 her brain. Brain, yeah. yeah. It's a fearful thing to fall into the hands of oh, living yeah. And yep. I know this guy, you know what I'm saying? I, I, not, I ain't grew up with him, but you know what I'm saying? We kicked it for a couple of years. He had, like, a brain injury. Shit, man, it, it never really heals. You know what I'm saying? It's yeah. your fucking brain, bro. Damn. You know what I'm saying? The top of your fucking head, yo. That shit don't never heal. You know what I'm right, saying? Right. It, it, it constantly bleeds, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And, it, and, it, and it has a fucking odor. It smells like death, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. mm. It smells like death, bro. Mm. The judgment of the Lord. Yep. Mm -hmm. But thou shalt not steal, right? Thou shalt mm -hmm. not steal. Yep. It's in the commandments. Foundation commandment that's right there. Thou Remember, all the unfaithful shall die in unfaithful. unfaithful. Yep. Right. That's just the judgment of the Lord. You know what I'm saying? Yep. So, so if any brother was ever thinking about stealing anything, you <laughs> oh, know what I'm saying? Right. Lord, like. Right, right. Ooh, uh, a proper is uh, the Lord beholding the evil and the good. Right. Yep. You got the eyes, uh, got the eyes watch for you. You know? Right. And, that, and that's evil right there. Anybody man. need any of these? Oh, good. Good. That's, that's evil right there, man. Yep. So that goes to that's, that's, that's sin. Sin. Thou shalt not steal, man. Nope. The Lord sent that judgment on it. Nope. All right. It says, uh, 2 Ezra 9 and 2. Then shalt thou understand that it is the very same time wherein the highest will begin to visit the world which he made. 
give them another shot now, man. Okay? Once again, that word uh, physical is used to punish you or to judge me, man. You know? And that's the spirit that Yahweh Bashimashah got out here, man. Okay? For all our people disobedient, they don't want to repent. Okay? They don't want to come back to who they are and serving Yahweh Bashimashah. So now we live in a time of the Lord, like, all right, I had enough of y'all. I'm sending uh, destruction out here, man. I'm sending people back to the spirit world. If I may get his definition here, please. Mm -hmm. The definition, time, okay, it says, the word time says the indefinite continued progress of existence. She want five minutes of fame, five right? Fame. Everybody want their five minutes of fame if you only knew, though. If you only knew. If you only knew. Everybody want, that's the folly of a woman, though. Yep. You can't blame him. Yeah. You can't blame yeah. him, though. They want some attention. They see right, something. Right, right. You know what I'm saying? It's a spiritual yeah. thing. You know what I mean? Yeah. The word time. Choosing. <laughs> choosing. <laughs> no, that, that, was, that, was, that was choosing right there. Right. Yeah. I didn't even see her come up. I was, I was like, I seen her come. I thought she was trying to get by. Or something. I thought it was too hard too. She was trying to do more than get by. Choosing. She was trying to do more than get by. Right. Even now, my dad. You know what I mean? Yeah. She was trying to get in. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. I can smell that bear. She was that close. Right. The word. The word time. The word time says. Yeah. A point of oh, time yeah. as measured in hours and minutes, it says past midnight or noon, and you can look at that spiritually, right? Because that's why it's supposed to be measuring the time. We've been we've been reading these these scriptures, and you've been seeing the key word time, time, time. You know, the indefinite continued progress of existence and events in the past, present, and future, as regarded as a whole. It says, um, yeah, I'm just. It says plan, schedule, or arrange when something should happen or be done. That's why it's so important to measure the times. Getting in these scriptures, being occupied in prophecy, being prepared for what the, the will of the Lord is. You know, which is to destroy Babylon the Great, aka America, and usher in the everlasting kingdom. Going back to um, Second Ezra's nine and three. It says, therefore, when there shall be seen earthquakes. Wait, as we read in Matthew the 24th chapter, that's one of the major signs that Lord Yahweh Shah said to watch out for, man. To look for. Earthquakes are in diverse places, man. Okay? And it's, it's, and it's more earthquakes uh being as coming to pass by the day, man. Right. And it gets stronger, 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 stronger multitude, you know. It says, read it on, verse 3. And uproars of the people in the world. Right, yeah. And you look around like international news, it's, it's uproars everywhere, man. Over this window 19, over the spider juice, mm -hmm. you know. Uh, you know, you still got the yellow vest going on, that uh -huh. protest still going on. You got Haiti, which is the so called uh, uh the so called Haitians, which are the tribe of Levi. Mm -hmm. They're uproaring right now. Yep. These are the signs that the Lord told us to watch for, man. <laughs> okay? That's how we're measuring the times by reading and being in the scriptures, like the brother said before. And if I can say too, they're, they're uproaring in um in Russia. Well, they have a little protest going on in Russia. Mm -hmm. The only reason Putin, <laughs> Putin, <laughs> he, those are his people. So he's like, man, I ain't gonna take them out. I got I got right. something bigger to be worried about, which is taking over Ukraine. You know, but they're they're rioting and or they're protesting because they don't support him taking over Ukraine. But it just goes oh, yeah, to show you right. that you know upwards of people's happening. The spirit of division, man. Right. I thought you were supposed to be fighting for Mother Russia. Why are you going against the president? It says, verse 4, Then shalt thou well understand that the Most High spoke of those things from the days that were before thee, even from the beginning. Right, and the Lord speak through his servants the prophets, man. All right? And they declared the prophecies of the Lord before they happened, according to Isaiah 42 and 9. Before we, they spring forth, we're going to tell you about it and warn you about it, you know? They're telling it's going to come down the pipeline whether you believe it or not. All right, we'll bro. <laughs> Verse 5, For like as all that is made in the world hath a beginning and an end, and the end is manifest. Right, so the, the rulership of the Edomites, the so-called white people, you know, it, it's going, it's circling down the drain, man. Okay? And it's evident. We see it. Okay? 
Second Ezra's nine and five. For like as all that is made in the world have a beginning mm -hmm. and an end. Right, yeah, so this place had a, a, a start, okay? During the Renaissance period. Hell yeah, yeah, it had a start, okay? Been pressing our people for over 500 years. We've been catching hell. But now, the end, you know, we're seeing it now, right? You know? Like Big Bro uh, did that, uh, the, the CT, uh, was it CTD? Circling the, the drain, drain, man. Right. This place is about to be out of here soon. Yep. It reads on. <clears throat> and the end is manifest. Mm -hmm. It's being revealed, man. Yep. Okay. This place is just crumbling from the, from, from, the, uh, from, the, from the debt, the debt clock, from his uh, economic structure, you know, from the people. You know, <laughs> oh, ooh, I watched his, uh, it was a video that the uh, brother shared where uh, this guy got kicked out of his classroom for saying that it's too gentle. Yeah, yep. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Man, come on, man. Yep. You know, uh -huh. this bullshit was, you saw his bullshit was almost out of here, though. Yep. You know? Uh -huh. Well, the scripture say wickedness has exceedingly polluted the, the whole, whole earth. earth. That's a sign right there. That's it. When, you, when you're telling the truth, you, 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 you're part of that council culture now. What do you mean there's only two genders? Well, according to the Bible, yeah. Get out of my class. You know, that, that just goes to show wickedness has exceedingly polluted the whole earth. Right. So the end is manifest. It's made known that this place is getting ready to go out. Um, um, Sirach 39 and 1. But he that giveth his mind to the law of the Most High and is occupied in the meditation thereof. Right, occupied. Yeah. Which means pretty much to stay busy. All right, meaning your, your mind is focused on, on, on something, man. And our minds are focused on the scriptures, man. You know, and the prophecies that's coming to pass as we're seeing. It says, and is occupied in the meditation thereof, will seek out the wisdom of all the ancients. Which is by the service of the prophets. So right. they're gonna tell you uh, what you need to do, or what you don't need to do according to the scriptures. That's right. And, be occupied in prophecy. See, because that's the spirit of Lord Yahweh Shah, man. Okay, the spirit of prophecy. And, that, and that's what we're doing, man. As we read in half the second chapter. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're watching for the, for the prophecies and signs and the times of Lord Yahweh Shah told us to watch for, man. Right. To the best of our abilities. Starting off with the head apostles, you know, the bishops on down, of course. You know, we're bringing it out for the spirit. Right. Book of Revelation, because I'm, I'm mm -hmm. Revelation 19 and 10. And I fell at his feet to worship him. This is the Apostle John when he saw the angel, man, on the alley of Patmos. Uh -huh. Right? And you know, when you see them angels, man, when they made they made a fast, it's a fearful sight. So when he seen the angel, he dropped down to his knees, man. Mm -hmm. And he said unto me. See thou do it not. The angel's like, nah, don't don't do that. You know? Don't do that. I'm only uh, uh doing the orders of Yahweh by Shimmy Hour Shah. I am thy fellow servant mm -hmm. and of thy brethren. Which takes orders from the Yahweh by Shimmy Hour Shah, like we do. Okay? It says That's why you can't let everybody ride with you. People tell you shit up, man. We are yeah. 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 they do it, do it, man. Yeah. yeah. Man, you slam my door, come on that other side of the car, punch, <laughs> punch your fucking head off, man. No, you slam my car door, my house door, I anything of right. mine. You gonna respect everything of mine. Right. I won't right. give a damn, y'all. I won't give if, I won't give a fuck if my door is already hanging off the hinges. Right. Already. That's that right, door bro. old as fuck. That's great. You know, respecting this place, man. That's why this place got another reason why this place gotta be destroyed, man. Yep. Damn, son like that man fucking door about to come off the hand. Boom! Right, that man, man, I'll beat your ass, man. Yeah. And we, don't even, we ain't even promoting no violence, right. man. And that's another sign, the love of many shall wax cold. Oh, that's I'm a cold spear you. right there, right there. You wanna do that to no brother, man. <laughs> your brother do that shit, he get shit quick. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Don't do that shit. Right. right. With a straight face. Right, right, right. Like boys in the hood, when they, uh, he got in the car. Oh, yeah. He slammed right. his yeah, car, yeah, he said. Yeah, yeah. He said, my car like it's a uh, football field. Like it's a grill on the football field. field. You know, it's like, what the hell's wrong with you? He's like, what's up, man? <laughs> <laughs> he gave me that car. Ricky, man. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> that was funny. Hell yeah. Revelation 19 and 10. See thou do it not. 
I am thy fellow servant and of thy brethren. So the angels are our brethren, man. You know, they're just our spiritual brethren. You know, that we can't see with our physical eyes. All right? But they're there, and they're beholding the evil and the good, as, as it's written in the scriptures. And of thy brethren that have the testimony of Yahawashai. Worship Yahweh. See, he reiterated, he said, Worship Yahweh by Shem Yahushai. Because at first he said, See, don't do or not, meaning don't do that, don't bow to him. Then he said, Worship Yahweh by Shem Yahweh. What else? It said, Worship Yahweh by Shem Yahweh for the testimony of Yahawashai is the spirit, spirit of, of prophecy. prophecy. That's the spirit that we're in, man. Starting off for the head of prophecy, the elder bishops on down. You know, we're teaching prophecies, man. You know, and now the prophecies are coming to pass, man. Faster and faster. Mm -hmm. You know, like older apostle of a college, you say pop is not like pop, man. They say mainstream news, mainstream media. You know, you people can't hide from this no more. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's it on there. I got yeah, What y'all going into? Uh, uh, prophecies. World War three. Yeah, World Isaiah 55 and 11. Isaiah 55 and 11. It reads, bear with me. So shall my word be that go forth out of my mouth. Right, and who's gonna uh, who's the mouthpiece Lord. of the Lord, the servant of the prophets, man? As we read in Amos the third chapter, before the Lord speaks something, before he makes a move. He's going to reveal it for secrets to a service of prophets. Right. And they're going to tell you about it before it happens. Okay? They're going to tell you about the prophecies that's coming out of the pipeline before they come to pass. Right. It says, It shall not return unto me void. Right. It's meaning uh, the Lord, when the Lord says something's going to happen, it's going to happen, man. The Lord ain't going to change his mind. According to Malachi 3 and 6, right. and Hebrews 13 and 8. Uh -huh. All right? Read it on Isaiah 55 and 11, but it shall accomplish that which I please, mm -hmm. and it shall prosper in the thing whereto I sent it. I mean, it's gonna come to pass, man. Okay? It's gonna come to pass. When the Lord says it's gonna happen, something's gonna happen, it's gonna happen, man. Right. Regardless of people's emotions, feelings, what they think, that don't matter. Okay? Mm -hmm. Your unbelief is not gonna stop the prophecies from happening, and it's clearly evident. Okay? Some did not believe. Right, which is the majority of the people. All right. Start off with a head of policy, the other bishops on down. that has been pushing these prophecies for 30 plus years. You know, they had the majority of the people had, uh, had their unbelief, man. But so what, though? It says Romans 3 and 3. For well, what if some did not believe? Shall their unbelief make the faith of the Most High without effect? So you think just because you're assaulting us and saying that, oh, that ain't going to happen? Oh, my grandma, my grandparents were teaching that for years, you know? You think it's because you don't believe that the prophecies ain't gonna come to pass, you know? It says, uh, can I read NLT right quick? Yeah. Romans 3 and 3, NLT says, true, some of them were unfaithful, yeah. but just because they were unfaithful, mm -hmm. does that mean the Most High would not be, it's like it, does that mean the Most High will be unfaithful? Verse yeah, and we know that according to the second Edges 15 and 4, that they're going to die for their unfaithfulness, man. Right second yeah. Edges chapter 15, verse 4. Yeah. For all the unfaithful shall yeah. die in the unfaithfulness. Wait a minute, wait a minute. You say some? For all. Majority. All. What about half? All. Maybe a little bit? All. Uh-huh. All. Uh-huh. All. Yep. All. <laughs> all. 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 All, all the unfaithful shall die in their unfaithfulness. That's right, right man. For, for your unbelief, if you don't repent, you hear the light. You know, you got all about your shots and believe you for the program. You're out of here, and you're seeing it. You big brothers uh, reminded us about that, uh, what happened 
the, uh, that woman, that, 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 that beat the wild beast, that beat, that beat the wild beast, and they got to her, man. Mm -hmm. Spirit of vengeance. Right. Yeah, the Lord hates sticky fingers, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Yeah. The Lord hates them Israelites with them sticky fingers, man. Mm -hmm. See, our people that took on the characteristic, aka the spirit of Sleaze and E. Yep. Mm -hmm. Sleaze and E was created to be the thief. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. The, the robber, the, the murderer. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Yep. The sleaziest. You know what I'm saying? But Jake, like, nah, I, I want to be. Remember, um, yeah, them false Israelites grew so much, so we need to tap into to sleazy E's blessing. All right, you tap into his blessings. You tap into his blessings, then you're going to tap into his curses, too. Yep. Right. You see? Mm. Right. 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 Yeah, I, I want to just get that Thessalonians right quick. Because the Lord gave our people over, over to strong delusions. Yep. So they believe in a lie now, you know what I'm saying? Yep. I want to get that right quick. Mm -hmm. um, this is um. If I can find it, let's see. Yeah, it's down at the bottom. Right? Yeah. No, you sure? So this is the day. How about she not shot? She left off that judgment. Man. Yeah. No. Yeah. yeah. Um. You want to run you? Everybody wondering why, you no know, saying the majority of our people don't believe in the Bible. This is why. Yep. Second Thessalonians chapter two verse eleven. And for this cause, Yahweh, by Hashem Yahweh Shai shall send them strong delusions. Right, the Lord is doing that, man. Ezekiel nine and four. I mean, it's fourteen and nine all day. You know, Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai is the one that's blind in the minds of our people not to understand to get these scriptures, man. Yeah, the Lord preserving them for a, a, a particular purpose, man. Which is that destruction. Remember King David prayed, you no know, saying that his word would become a snare unto him. Even to this day. So two thirds would yeah. never get the word on the right. side. Never. Right. You know what I mean? Yeah, right. Make me believe it, make me believe it, make me believe it. You're not gonna get it, because the Lord don't want you to get it. You know what I mean? The Lord says he's gonna send them strong delusions. Yeah. So what they're gonna believe something that ain't real. They're gonna believe something that's a lie, man. And that's the majority of our people. That's why they believe any anybody that come up reading the Bible, whether they're breaking out the scriptures, they're, they're well, they're going to be breaking out the scriptures the wrong way. Our people are going to be believing it. Uh -huh. But you got these false prophets, you can have sex on the Sabbath. Yeah, That's a strong a delusion, delusion right there. Uh -huh. The Lord yeah. said to deceive and deceive are his. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah you can, um, whatever. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I, don't, I, don't I don't mean, this is so I can't even think of all of that, man. <laughs> all this madness, man. Oh, yeah, you can call the Lord anything. That's a strong delusion oh, right there. You know what I'm saying? Right. You know? Oh, yeah, the law done away with. Strong delusion. Right? Oh yeah, the, um, we ain't gonna mention that one, but um, boy, it's a whole, it's a whole lot of things. Oh, yeah. say that, man. It's a whole lot of things, right? Uh, Strong yeah. delusions, right? Uh, oh yeah, oh yeah, the, um, the earth is flat. Oh, yeah. Strong oh, yeah. delusion, oh, yeah. man. Yeah. All right? It says for this cause the Most High Yahweh, by Hashem Yahweh Shai, shall send them. Oh yeah, um, the, um perfect. I'm perfect. Yeah, 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 I'm perfect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Strong delusion right there, man. Right. You see? It says, and for this cause, the Most High shall send them strong delusions mm -hmm. that they shall believe in lie. And a lie is the opposite from the truth, man. Right. Meaning they're going to uh, believe in something that is totally contrary to what the scriptures say, man. Right. And that's, and that's a fearful thing right there, right. man. Right. After y'all bugged out and believing in that nonsense, man, why do y'all buy shooting out a shot for us, man? Yep. That they, that they all might be damned who believe not the truth. Right, and damn goes into condemn, man. You know, calm meaning with, fear meaning do. You know, destruction. And that's exactly where, they, where, they, where they're headed, man. Oh, damn. The Israelites that don't believe this truth, you're, you're damned. You're condemned already. Yeah. Right. You're condemned already, man. You, you haven't been condemned before the, the earth was even created. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So you came out your mama wound, you know what I'm saying? You was already condemned already. Didn't even know. Then you died, you know what I'm saying? Then you came back, condemned again, died, came back, condemned again, died, came back, condemned again, died, came back, condemned again. Then you want to see right now, don't even know it, that you condemned already again. That's right. So so what's the end result of being condemned? Die. Yep. You're going to die this time, man. It says um, straight up deleted. Yeah, deleted, right? It says, um... <laughs> That they all look all they go to work all again. All again they go all again. Yep. Remember all the unfaithful shall yeah, die in right, the unfaithfulness. Yeah, yeah. Look, look, they look, that they, they all. Yep. All non-believers. That's right. Yep. All non-believers, that they, they all might be damned mm -hmm. who believe not the truth. And the truth that we, it's bringing out is starting off with the head of Apostle other bitches going down, man. Right. right. Oh, oh yeah, oh yeah, strong now I'm just gonna say another strong delusion just to add on is um the, the M A R K, you know what I'm saying? Uh -oh. And sleeping with a white woman. Yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, look, look, look. Or, or the M A R K is money. Right. 
Right. What? No saying, um, yeah, an embargo. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, the M A R K of John three sixteen. That's a strong delusion right there, man. Oh yeah, it's sin. Tell me something. It's sin. Tell me it's sex. <laughs> oh yeah, there, there, one dude, you know what I'm saying, came on Elder Manasseh's out by, you saying, um, pay someone, so, um, the M-A-R-K is a man. Huh? So they're so they gonna put a man, they're gonna put a man inside your arm now? Right, right, right. A full grown man is gonna get put in your arm, right? right, right, right. A full grown man yeah. gonna get put in your forehead, right? Oh, Come on now. <laughs> without, a, without having a full grown oh, man on part of your body, right. you can be able to buy a sale, right? Come on now. Come on now. It says that they all might be damned who but and somebody get that in the in the NLT. You got it. See that? See that? See that? See that? See that? See that? And that they all might be damned who believe not the truth but have pleasure in unrighteousness. They have pleasure in unrighteousness, man. I mean they love it. Alright? They desire it, man. All their righteousness are things that are contrary to the scripture. So they love having sex on the Sabbath. Right. You know, and that's unrighteousness right there. Right. Because that, that's working. Yeah. Now I'm just gonna say sex is working. That's right. You know what I'm saying? The scripture says on the yeah. Sabbath. We're supposed, I mean, you gotta go to your regular job, of course. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But the Sabbath yeah. means rest. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. If you're jiggy jiggy you know what I'm saying, on the Sabbath, yeah. you're not resting. You know what I'm saying? You're actively working. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Come on now. Yeah. And plus, you're, you're, you're pleasing yourself. Yeah. On the, on the yeah. Sabbath, you're supposed to deny yourself. That's right. You see? Yeah. Of course, guys came out. Oh, yeah, you can call the Lord anything. Oh, that's yeah. a strong delusion. Yeah. There's many other things, man. You know what I mean? Oh yeah, oh, look, 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 you can't eat fish no more. Huh? God told you can't eat fish no more. There's certain fish that you can't eat, and there's certain fish that you can't eat, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But you got dudes, no say to you can't eat chicken. <laughs> oh, you can't eat turkey anymore. I know y'all didn't heard it all, man. Yeah, yeah, but it depends on how long you've been around, you know what I'm saying? You got guys, you know what I'm saying, teaching that you couldn't eat turkey, you couldn't yeah, eat that. chicken, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you know. Jacob brushed your head, you say you can eat chicken now. <laughs> Straight up, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whether they believe in the Bible or not, you know what I right, mean? Right. Cause talk about you wanna bring that out right now. That'd be well deserved too. Right. <laughs> One that's, of those, lawful, that's a lawful food. Two so sides your head. <laughs> Go ahead, bro. Can I bring a quick definition of lie? Yeah. The definition of lie says to make an untrue statement with intent to deceive. With intent. So you're so you're uh, willingly doing it, man. Yeah. And you know that you're doing it, man. Right. Like make with the name. Yeah. You, know, you know, you know, you know the name of the Lord ain't no Christ, man. Oh yeah, remember uh, General uh, Gahana said you gonna do it in the butt. Right. You know what oh, I'm saying yeah. that's a strong delusion <laughs> right, right there, right, man. Yeah. Right. That's sick. That's sick right that's there, sick. man. Uh -huh. so like, I know y'all gonna be mad at me. <laughs> I know y'all gonna be mad at them. <laughs> but yes, <laughs> yes. He said it with compassion. Yeah. He said it with conviction, right? Yep. Which was a lie, man. Uh, yeah. You see what is a lie again, bro? Yep. He uh, said, about to say something on that. He did. He said it with pleasure. Yep. Yeah. Pleasure, you know, right? Yeah. Uh, it says lie yep. to make an untrue statement with intent to mm. deceive. Mm. They got it all sold out, man. Many of them took that back. So they teach them things that they know that it is wrong, man. Right. That dude, you know what I'm saying, basically just going back to that point that I made, that dude basically pushes sodomy yep. on our yeah, people's yeah, sodomy. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. When you um, go up in a woman's rectum, that's you committing sodomy. Yep. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Which is punishable by death. Mm. You know what I'm saying? You know, oh yes. man, who want to do that nasty shit anyway, know, man? Right? It's a freaky dinky world, right. though. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? She's a very freaky girl. Right, 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 right. And, that dude, and both of them need to be outed. You know what I'm right. saying? Yep. Straight up deleted. And I got a couple scripts. She ain't all right, though. Right. Um. <laughs> is it I got the scripture. Listen to verse 10. And I don't know, teens is a second Thessalonians 2 and 10. It says, this man will come to do the work of Satan with counterfeit power and signs and miracles. Right, and as we saw, man, you see what he with his witchcraft. Right. Right, because he does that on the left. The Lord controls him on the left hand side, uh -huh. man. All right? Straight. Like you say, you got the Israelites trying to tap into the hell. Yep. Oh, boy. You are the father, the father of the devil. That's right. It says, verse 10. You know, you know, you know, you know. It says, verse 10. It says he will use every kind of evil deception to fool those mm. on their way to destruction mm. because they Man. refuse to the, love. The, fool those on their way to destruction. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Mm -hmm. he, he helped forward this shit. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Mm -hmm. This guy's going to help afford your, your death. You know yep. what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. yep. Your destruction. Uh -huh. He's helping you out with it. You know what I right. mean? That's right. Yep. If I can hey. say, it's counterfeit salvation. 
he that 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 M M A R K the Karagma, he he trying to make it seem like it's salvation. It's the way to life and continuation when reality is counterfeit right. to your right. destruction. It's right. leading you to the path of death. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. It says I got I gotta preach. I gotta read it. I gotta I gotta be allowed to read this. This is Ezekiel 13, 22. Because with lies ye have made the heart of the righteous sad. Mm. Through lies, man. These false Israelite groups, you know what I'm saying? They have made our people hearts me in their minds sad, you know what I'm saying? Through the lies, man. Gave them false hope. America's crumbling as we speak, you know what I'm saying? But you got these false pastors and prophets telling our people to invest all their time and energy into the nonsense, man. Right. You know? Yep. We're not going to invest our time in the words, right? And getting built up on, in the spirit, you know what I'm saying? Building our faith up. Um, Building a personal relationship with your house, we just going to lie to you. These are these false pastors, man, prophets, right? It says, because with lies ye have made the heart of the righteous sad. Who's the righteous? The Israelites, right? That's right. Whom, whom I have not made sad. Man. See, you know what I'm saying? The scripture told us to come with the word to comfort our people. Right. You know what I'm saying? Yep. To give them hope, yep. true hope, yep. real hope, right. salvation, things of that nature. But they, but they pushing a false doctrine, a false narrative. Um, look, what, what are y'all? Why are y'all so worried about the release date? Mm. Remember these false prophets yeah. said that? Yeah. Why y'all so worried about the release date? Y'all, it's just like a man that's in prison. Why the hell he gonna be worried about his release date? Which didn't make no sense. Cause a man that's in prison most definitely gonna worry about his release date. He, wanna, he, he gonna wanna know when the hell I'm getting out. You know what I'm saying? Cause he wanna be free. Right. You see? Oh yeah, it says the captive um, hasten. Yeah, hasten to be looser, man. You know why they're not worried about the release date? Cause they got the test it. Yeah. Yeah, oh, plus yeah. they plus they, um, they took that bag too, yep. so they live in yep. custom. If you rich yep. as hell in America, you you got a couple of mills, which ain't really nothing to the elite, but right. it is something to somebody that's been poor all their life. You got probably about 10, 20, 30 mil, you know what I'm saying? That means something. You don't want this place to be destroyed. You right. live in your best life, you got a whole groupie, lots of women somewhere, you know what I'm saying? You jet setting, you eating the finest food, you comfortable right about now. We ain't got shit, we ready to get up out of here. Right. And if we did have something, we still want to get out of here. Right. We're yeah, still absolutely. being ruled over by a wicked nation, right? That's right, my brother. It says, um, whom I have not made sad and strengthened the hands of the wicked. These false prophets, they're strengthening the hands of the wicked. Sleaze and eat. They're trying to help forward the, um, the wicked's agenda, man. Right. You got these false prophets, some of them told us to drink the juice, man. Yep. Um, General Gahana said, drink the juice, right? right. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Right. So and look, look, and now people are sad from take, taking that step, man. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Yep. You know, talking about peace, peace when there was no the peace. Yeah. And then they say they say there ain't gonna be no famine in the land. It's always gonna be food. Remember the scriptures went into yeah. that. Yeah. By by famine, that's what said these shall these false prophets be consumed. Yeah. Yeah. Just roughly paraphrasing. Yeah, that wicked uh, false prophet uh, Hananiah, man. It's yeah. The time of Jeremiah. Yeah. He was teaching that. And he back now. Yep. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Yeah. You know. Could, could be could be um, general um, yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Right. Could be general doing it in the bus, right? Yeah. It says, um, and strengthen the hands of the wicked. Look, got our people voting and all that. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah. know, yeah. got yeah. our people. Yeah. Um, yeah. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah, you strengthen the hands of the wicked, too, when you're making a covenant with them. Yep. You know yep. what I'm saying? Uh, when you join hands in hand with this uh -huh. devil, you strengthen the hands of the wicked. Yep. Yep. You're, trying, you're really trying to uphold this man's system when a new system is coming in. Yep. A righteous system. Yeah, that's you know right. what I'm saying? Yeah. But our people are like, nah, we don't want to do people don't want to, do, don't want to be righteous. They don't want to live a righteous life anytime you're breaking up the scriptures the wrong way. That's right. It says, um, that ye that he should not return from his wicked way. They ain't telling our people to repent. They push a madness on our people. Yeah. You don't see none of these false Israelite groups telling our people to repent, yo. You know what I'm saying? These guys, you know what I'm saying, help forward in the ways of the wicked, they're throwing up gang signs. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Come on, they throwing up gang signs, smoking blunts. You know what I'm saying? Pushing, pushing sleaze and ease. You know what I'm saying? Nonsense. Still on our people, man. They pushing, uh, they pushing um, gang life. They pushing um, two thirdness on yeah. our people, man. Yeah. But it's supposed to be in the truth, though, right? They, they, they giving our people that Babylon. You yeah. know our people need this word. You know what I'm saying? But you pushing some madness Ooh, on them. Yeah. The Lord, the Lord brung them out the fire. You trying to throw them right back into right. the fight. Right. Cause look, cause you remember they say uh, the scripture said they're gonna stop, try to stop them from entering in, cause right. they know they ain't entering right. in. Right. Right. They know they ain't gonna be able to enter in, cause they, they know already. Right. So they're like, yo, I'm gonna stop them from entering in, and then right. they make you too full um, of hell, as the scripture say. Too child of uh, yeah. Too child of hell. Yeah. Yep. Yep. They, they they become way worse than he is, man. Yep. Yep. And it says um right. that he should not return from his wicked way by promising him life. Mm. 
So these these wicked uh, false prophets are promising our people life, man. You know what I'm saying? When they when they really uh, promoting death. You know what I'm saying? But it's wrapped up. You know what I'm saying? Death is wrapped up, you know what I'm saying, in a, uh, in a nice box, so to speak, you know what I'm saying, with a bow on it. That's right. But it leads to death. That's why the scripture say there's a way that seems right into a man, right. but the end thereof are the ways of death. death. So our people are actually leading our people to death, man. Right. Um, because they leading our people down the um the, um, the wide gate, right? Right. And you know what it says that the wide gate leads right to death and destruction. That's right. We come in with a message of the straight gate. You know what I'm saying? Right. Which is um, a path of difficulty, right. but at the end of that path, at least. Look at this shit. This, this, he got that car painted like that, man. Yeah, yeah. Know what I'm saying? He got that car painted like that, man. These people threw away. Slaughter, slaughter. It look like that car got slaughtered, too. He got slaughtered. But but, but yeah, somebody, that's somebody that's gonna, yeah, that's what I'm saying, man. But somebody gonna like that, though, right? right. Oh, yeah. That dude probably spent a couple of racks on that, on that car looking ugly like that, man. That's probably a Jake. That's a Jake right there. You know what I mean? You can live your best life. Follow me. You know what I'm saying? Just want to make a covenant with the heathen to get these racks. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna uh, we're gonna um what's that, what's that shit everybody doing on? We're gonna monetize oh, our yeah, videos, yeah. yeah. We're gonna go um, uh, um what's that other shit? Uh, yeah. Patreon? Yeah, we're gonna Patreon, Patreon our page. You yeah. know what I'm saying? So if anybody do want the truth, you got to pay for it. You yep. know what I'm saying? You ain't healing our people. I feel yeah. broke, man. I feel better pay rent this month, man. Right. I thought you got Israel said they ain't paid rent yet. It's the 25th. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. On the verge of getting kicked out, but you lying to them. Right. So, so let me get your money, though. And I know what I'm saying. Say a prayer for you. Yeah. It says, therefore, shall, therefore, shall, shall see, so like it, therefore ye shall see no more vanity, nor divine divination, for I will deliver my people out of your hand. See, the elect are going to get delivered out of That's these false right. prophets' hands. Out of these uh, false Israelite groups, the elect of the nation of Israel, the Lord's going to deliver them out of that. He's right. going to put some fire up under their ass first, though, of course, you know what I'm saying? But he's going to eventually deliver them out of those false groups, man. You see? It says, um, my people are out of your hand, and ye shall know that I am the Lord. And you got you got um Israelites, you know what I'm saying, being delivered, you know what I'm saying? You got the whole elect being delivered from these false Israelite groups. Yep. One here, one there, yep. one here, two there. Yep. That's people though, right? Yep. Yep. Nonetheless, that's people, right? Uh -huh. That's right. That's right. Right. Mm -hmm. it, it, you made a beautiful point, but I can just say, because when when you have some of the whole elect come from out of these one of these false prophets, they're not gonna make a video about it. They're just gonna, you know, they're gonna come into the right under the right teaching. Sometimes they're, they're gonna make a some, video sometimes, about it. Yeah, sometimes, yeah, yeah. but they're not gonna make an announcement. So it's like we we we're not gonna we're not trying to keep count right. of, of all the hopeful elect. We Hell know the Lord yeah. is making moves. Yep. And all the things that these false prophets are doing is playing it right into the Lord's hands. That's right. Of drawing out the elect from under those false prophets. Lie to our people, man. Uh -huh. Teaching them lies just to um he put to them disciples, man. You know what I'm saying? The Lord like, nah, yo. The, the, my elect, you know what I'm saying? This is among those groups. I'm, I'm gonna bring them up out of there, man. Right, and, right. You, and you're starting to see that now. Come on, bro. You're starting to see that now. It's, it's a beautiful thing. That's right. Because, like, like a Rob made a beautiful point, we don't see all of the um, the men that separate from those false Israelite groups, but we do see one or two. Yep, and they right. make videos, know, right. man. Yep. Exposing right. them. Right. Exposing yeah. them for everything that's going on up in them <laughs> wicked houses, man. Yep. Everything that's wicked is going on up in them wicked churches. You know what I'm saying? It's being exposed, man. Bringing it out, they come. They say yelling, bring it out, right? That's they right. say bring it out. You know, it's you being brought out. They come, 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 come. They come, come, come in. Yeah. Yeah. You know, yeah. that's right. That's right. That's right. All oh, that is coming out. Right. You know, how they stealing from people? How they passing women around? Yeah, you know? man. Yep. You ain't on a level, brother. Uh -huh. She mine. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> nah, I want her. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. All this wicked nonsense, man. <laughs> And the Lord said he's going to visit these false wicked prophets, you know what I'm saying, for the evil that they're doing, man. Yep. Matter of fact, somebody get the NIT of Jeremiah yep. 23 right quick, uh -huh. Bob Kashaw, uh -huh. and we're going to get what you got. Let's talk uh, about this. Hold on, get what you got. Yep. Yeah, get that Jeremiah, hold on, right quick. Uh, yeah, mm -hmm. let's just get that right quick, bro. Yeah. That's going to go into it. Yeah, it's one of my favorites yeah, yeah, yeah. now. <laughs> that's, that's pretty much my go-to now, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go through it, man. Yeah, yeah. The Lord is opening up this thing, man. And we're very excited to be out here on this Saturday doing the work of the Lord, that's man. Right. Right. We want to be nowhere else, man. Right. Straight up, man. Yeah, you know? Couldn't wait to get off, man, so I could put on my stuff, grab my bag, yeah, load yeah. it up, and come on out here, man. That's right. Yeah. Shit. Um, yeah, shit, NLT. Jeremiah 23 and 1. This is in the NLT. 
It, 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 get more, it goes more into detail. You know, know what I'm saying? Right. Go ahead. It says, what sorrow awaits the leaders of my people? What sorrow? You know what I'm saying? Pain, yep. torture. Get sorrow. Yeah, yeah, get that, get that definition. Yeah. The Lord said, what sorrows? And I'm going to get it right back to you, Nikon. Uh -huh. The Lord said, what sorrows await these teachers, these false teachers, man? Great sorrow, man. Yeah, it's yeah. all lovey dovey right about now. Right. They're living their best life right about now. They're jet setting and everything. Right. They got all the women. Husband loves their wives. Right, you know what right, I'm saying? Right. Babies crying in the background. They're doing it big right about now, but not really. Right. But not right. really. Yep. So the scripture say, give me neither poverty nor riches. Just give me um, something that's convenient for them, no, man. We, right. we content with what we got, man. That's right. That's you right. see? That's right. Matter of fact, uh, we read all these at the beginning of sorrows earlier. Yeah, yep. And my sword for uh, sorrow for that particular precept, it was birth pain. Because it's like how a woman uh, catch all types of hell, right. giving uh, birth to a child. One thing after another. You know, yep. hey, that's how you see third. One through. thing after right. another. <laughs> so they're going to, and then the Lord said, um, he have cursed your blessings already. And say, you ain't in the scripture too. All these, all these so-called blessings that Sleazy E has given two-thirds of our people, these yep. false prophets, the Lord said he's cursed those blessings already, yep. man. Yep. See? Yep. I, I forgot where it said, but it's in there. Um, um, I have cursed your blessings already. Type that in, somebody. Right. One of you brothers, type that in. Because, yeah, these false prophets, they, they've, they've been blessed uh -huh. by Sleazy E. You know what I'm saying? They just said they got, who, they got houses all over the world. You know what I'm saying? You know, get get notoriety, get fame. They, they want to have fame before the Lord. The Lord said, "Those blessings that you have been receiving, I curse them already." It says blessings, which is a consolation. You know what I'm saying? You receive your consolation already, but this one goes into blessings. You found it, Malachi. Read it right quick. This is Malachi two, verse two. It says, "If you, if you will not hear." And if ye will not lay it to heart right. to give glory unto my name. See? Our people ain't giving glory to the name of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shah. They ain't they ain't laying this stuff in their mind. We're supposed, to, we're supposed to meditate on on the name of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shah. And these words, man. But the name comes first though. You know what I'm saying? If you ain't got a name, it ain't backed by nothing. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. The name, you know what I'm saying, is backed by power. That's yeah. right. The Lord said, you know, you gotta lay these things to your heart, to your mind, man. That's right. Go ahead. Say of the Lord of hosts. Lord of armies, man. Our, our people really don't even know. The Lord get, the Lord get down, man. Yeah. Did y'all see that video, that World Star video? I ain't gonna really get into it, you no know saying, but it was a World Star video, you no know saying, either, I think the brothers put it in the chat, you no know saying, today or last night, you no know saying, or this Jake, you no know saying, this woman yeah, had a yeah. conversation or whatever. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yo, man, yeah, the yeah, spirit's yeah, creative yeah. event is real, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't wanna fall into the hands of, yeah. when, it, when the spirit says a fearful thing to fall into the hands of the living power, he won't play. Yeah, right. He ain't playing, man. Yeah, you brother. see? Oh, he ain't yeah, playing. Yeah, only thing you heard, only thing you, you heard, you yeah. know what I'm saying, was, um, was skull and pipe. This is this is the only thing, only thing you heard was skull and pipe. You know what I'm saying? Get get with that. You know what I'm saying? Skull and pipe. Sound, sound like he was hitting concrete, man. You know what I'm saying? That's all you heard constantly. And look, look, and look here. Where the thugs at? Who was the thugs at? And look, all these cars riding past and all that, and nobody get out. Wow. See, yeah. that, that old, uh, she's a lady. That, that, that old, uh, I'm going to fight tooth and nail, you know what I'm saying, for a woman that I don't know. I don't know. All that's, that's going out the window, y'all. Yeah. Yeah. You're going to get your ass out of that car, you know what I'm saying, and that, that spirit created with vengeance going to have like a thousand demons on them. It's going to beat you out of your clothes, you know what I'm saying, and, and run you up the street. Yeah. 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 It did catch you. Yeah. It did. It did might ravish you. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. All right. You know, Jay going to get enough trying to be Captain Save a Ho. Uh -huh. Right. <laughs> Yeah. Well, look, when, when we heard, you know what I'm saying, um, skull and pipe, you know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? Look, the other car was just passing on by, and everybody seen what was going on. You brother, check it out. But read that, though, bro. Mm -hmm. Said the Lord of hosts, mm -hmm. I will even send a curse upon you. See, the Lord said he's going to send a curse upon Jake. But not, um, first and foremost, glorifying the names of Yahweh by Shimei Shai, which the right. whole, uh, anybody that know about the Bible, the truth right about now, knows the true biblical names in the proper yep. Hebrew tongue of the Heavenly Father and the Son. Yes, you don't play around with that. You don't take the name of the Lord um, and, and the Son's name in vain, man. That's a dangerous game right there. That's a dangerous game. Go ahead, brother. It says, and I will curse your blessings. And he said he's going to curse your blessings, man. So these 501c3 charters, you know what I'm saying? These different accolades that our people are getting for promoting wickedness, really, breaking down the scriptures the wrong way, because you know Sleazy E is blessing these false prophets, man, for breaking down the scriptures the wrong way, man. That's why that's why so many of them are coming out of the cut now, man, because they're being paid off, man. The Lord said he, he cursed your blessings already, man. You see? Meaning, meaning the blessings that you did receive from Sleazy E, 
Let's get ready to get snatched from you, young man. You're you gonna be looking real ashamed out here, man. Straight up, man. And look, look, you're gonna be looking more ashamed than a two-thirds, you know what I'm saying? They didn't know nothing about the Bible and took bribes and gifts from this devil, man, and bent over and all that. Because you knew better. Let's go ahead. He says, Yay. I have cursed them already. Already Ooh. cursed them already. You know what I'm saying? You don't even know. Nope. Look, look, the Lord, look, the Lord gave them strong delusions. Illusions. Going right back to what we read earlier. The Lord gave them over to strong delusions for them to actually think, you know what I'm saying, that they're doing it big. Right. You know what I'm right, saying? Right, right. The Lord said, I curse your blessings already, right. man. And riches probably not in the day of wrath. Right. We dudes gonna do, man. Shit, that woman, you know what I'm saying, had a whole skull, uh, uh, um, brazen everything yanked off. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Right. A dog yanked a whole a scalp off, man. You got people, you got Israel playing around with the Lord, but he had that dog rip that whole woman scalp off, man. Mm. Scalped her. Yep. Right, right. You mm. know what I'm saying? Yep. What's in it with Gad did yep. to sleaze he? Right. Right. Cause Gad does not pretty much scalp the hair. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You know, the some of the skin or whatever. Yeah, yeah, but this dude, yeah. this dog ripped off everything. Mm. Did y'all see it? This dog ripped off everything. Yeah. Look, look, bloody, real blood, a bloody yeah. mess. Right, right, right. A bloody yeah. mess. Right. And one thing about a head injury, shit, man, it, it takes years sometimes to heal. Yeah. Yeah. Look, look, and you ain't got years. Yeah. The Lord on his way yeah. now, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Just imagine your, your, your head already to the path of white meat yeah. and Jacob trouble pop off. I know, right? Oh, and you yeah, trying to yeah, heal. Yeah, yeah. You're going to be in the bed, you're going to be bedridden for a long time. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Any more than that, bro? It says, because you do not lay it to heart. Because you don't lay the name of, of Yahweh by Shem you don't, you don't keep it in your mind. That's right. Now, now you're talking some um, Ahaya Shia. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. Um, all the Yah. Yeah, yeah. The Yah, the Yah Israelites. Yahushua. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yoshua, yeah. Yahshua, Yahweh. All this other nonsense. Yo play yogurt. Come on, man. Yeah, yeah. Come on. yeah those blessings that you got, you know what I'm saying? Then, um, you know a lot of them um, false prophets, you know what I'm saying, their leaders, you know what I'm saying, are masons too. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, the colors in the, in the, in the hand gestures, yeah. 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 Proverbs 10 and 2. Treasures of, treasures of wickedness profit nothing. Right. It ain't going to profit you nothing, man. Y'all about Shimon and Shai, and you still gonna put that, uh, that judgment on you. Alright? Like Proverbs 11 and 4 says, Get your prophet not in the day of the Lord's wrath, man. Eh? So that's not gonna deliver you. Hold on, let me just say this. What's how perverse people is? The Lord said, you know what I'm saying? He's gonna um, put a perverse uh, spirit in the earth, man. You got women hollering at other women talking to do fries come with that shape. <laughs> that was an embarrassment what? to that woman right there. Yeah, the people in that car right there ask that woman do fries come with that shape. The only thing she's trying to do is get off work and go home. It's how disrespect, a perverse spirit is in the midst of Egypt, man. Shit of sodomy, yo. You know this place is going to burn, man. You see? What, what, what the students call it? An ordinary affection? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Unnatural, man. Yeah. For, one, for a woman to be gawking out for another woman, y'all know that's out of order right there, man. But look, they look, that woman didn't have no shame, though, right? right. That woman didn't have no shame. See, beholding the evil and the good. Remember, it says the eyes of the Lord, which are the angels. Are in every place beholding the evil and the good. The word angel means messenger. Yep. Who's the who's out here giving the message? Who's out here giving the message right about now? Right. Us, right? Right. So we had to behold that. We had to look and hear that nonsense, right? Yep. You know what I'm saying? So now that, that was written down. You know what I'm saying? Yep. But you got the paper that want no shame in the game. Right. So, so can I get fried with that shake? That woman mind her damn business, yo. That wasn't cute at all. Go ahead, though, bro. Proverbs 10 and 2. Treasures of wickedness profit nothing, but righteousness delivereth from death. Right, see, because that, 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 that uh, riches that you got by wickedness, by selling out, you know, that's going to be your destruction. Right. right? Yeah. That's not going to deliver you. Right. But serving your whole body, shooting out shot to the best of your abilities, mm -hmm. fear and sincerity, you know, if you have the elect, it's going to deliver you, get you up out of here, man. Save you, uh, get this uh, race from that destruction that you're going to be breaking. Right, right. And if I could just say, too, you know, they, they probably looking at our, our teachers, our apostles, like, yeah, see, we took it to another level. We got, we got, we got rap videos. We got all these followers. We got schools. We, we got schools. As if, as if, um, the, the apostles probably weren't tempted with that either. I ain't gonna tell them, you know, because um, you, you know, uh, one of the, the I preach I choir was was uh, tempted with that. Right. But he, he took the he took the righteous path, man. Right. He, you know, give me neither riches nor poverty, and he went out as with integrity. You know. So, so yeah, it looks like it looks like we're at the bottom now because we took the righteous path, but it's gonna pay off for us. 
But in the meantime, they took treasure of wickedness, and it's not going to profit them anything but shame. I know years ago, some dude, you know, say, came up to me on a knock bar, you know, say, at first he was acting like he was a mark and a scoffer and all that, which he was a he was really an agent, you know what I'm saying? And soon we started walking out after we finished camp or whatever. I guess he went somewhere and parked. He, he left, so I guess he went somewhere and parked, you know what I'm saying, until we finished whatever. As soon as he seen us um, walking down the street, you know what I'm saying, going wherever we had to go, you know what I'm saying, to a disclosed, disclosed location or whatever, he was like, yo, let me invite y'all to dinner, man. You know what I'm saying? So we can discuss some things. You know what I'm saying? So, so that dude was trying to bribe us right. years ago, you know what I'm saying? Right. We told that dude, man, look, look, get the hell on, you know what I'm saying? Right. I, think, I think he was trying to um, follow us and shit, right? Trying to see where we going. We going straight to the hood, so right. come on, follow us on through the hood. <laughs> follow us on right. through the hood, right. you know what I'm saying? It was years ago, and it was a little bit more dangerous. Right. 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 Keep, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. come on, keep on. Yeah. So, um, so, so, um, I want to invite y'all to dinner, you know what I'm saying? You know, so y'all ain't got money like I do and all the other things. Right. You know what I'm saying? Trying to bribe, you know? You can walk through, bro. Or you listen. Go ahead. But that's it on that. Bring yours, um, bring that um, Jeremiah right quick. Oh, yeah, yeah, Jeremiah. That's 23. That that's yeah. yeah. Book of Jeremiah, chapter 23, verse 1. It says. In the NLT. In the NLT. It says, What sorrow awaits the leaders of my people, the shepherds of my sheep? Yep. Yeah, going into these false uh, teachers and leaders, man, prophets, man. You know, that's what you got to look forward to. You know, sorrows, uh, uh, anguish, you know, calamities. You know, because you out here teaching lies, man, and you know that you're doing it. You're doing it willfully. So you got a definition? Yeah. You got a definition of the word sorrow? Oh, yeah. The spirit one, brother, when we get it, it's sorrow is a noun. It says sorrow from the old English, grief. Grief. Regret. Damn. Trouble. Ooh. Pain. That's what Yahweh Bashim Rashad said. He's going to see these false teachers and leaders, man. All right? Like what Yahweh Shah said, these are the beginning of sorrows, man. You know? The Lord's about to send a whole bunch of more troubles and, and, and grief. Like 2022, the year to turn up. The Lord's about to turn things up out here. It's, it says, <laughs> it says, to be sick, sicknesses. What did, what did the grief say? Type on grief. Just talking about the leaders of our people too. They talking about these heathen leaders. No, 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 talking no, no, about no, no. our people. Yeah. Right. It says grief. It's a noun. Hardship. Mm -hmm. Suffering. Suffering, man. That's what you uh, false teachers and leaders. You know that there are Israelites. Like, that's what you gonna receive, man. You know from Yahweh by Shimei on Shaf, teaching our lies and selling out, man. That's right. It says from the early 13th century, bodily affliction. Bodily affliction, man. The Lord's about to send more, uh, uh, more, uh, what's the word? Uh, 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 what's the word? Like, what's the word? Like, ailments? Yeah. Ailments, you know? Y'all by Shemar, that's, that's judgment from the Lord right there, man. Right. So prepare for, for, for more body sicknesses, man. Mind and body. Yep. Severe headaches, yep. migraine yep. headaches, uh -huh. sicknesses, incurable diseases, right. you name it. Right. Yep. More, uh, spiritual bug outness, yep. you know? Spiritual when you say the name of the Lord, bring it down to the people that they never heard it. They know what you're talking about. It says, uh, grief, it says, it now says, intense sorrow. Intense sorrow. Mm -hmm. So you're all by Shemel Shah, who the world is going to God and Jesus, is going to intently uh, uh, make you sorrowful, man. You know? But it's the will of the Lord to do that for the two thirds of our people. Okay? Right. Starting off with the uh, the false teachers and leaders. So this teacher lies, man. It's spread. Right. It says intense sorrow caused by the loss of a loved one, especially by death. Right. right. Ooh, and that's one of the prophecies as well. Uh, widowhood, man. You know? A lot of y'all gonna uh, be deleted in that draft. You know? The one that got the court, the uh, court, uh, court brag. The Lord gonna start killing their sons and daughters. Yep. 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 And yep. new one, yep. babies and all that, man. Yep. They're gonna know why, too. Yep. And the Lord said he's going he to intensify. Intense yep. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. uh, it's a rumor of uh, an incident of which a uh, rap noose. Yeah. You know, not only did he perish, but then his son started yeah. to, yeah. Well, was, he just yeah. started to, you know, yeah. started getting sick and, you know, yeah. bleed through places. Yeah, 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 yeah. So the Lord can get you and your people. Yep. You know? And these are the things, you know, the Lord's going to bring sorrows upon these leaders. Mm -hmm. uh, that, uh, that was in the, on, you know, Psalm Going back to Jeremiah 23 and 1 in NLT, it says, read it on, it says, but they have destroyed 
and scattered the very ones they were expected to care for, says the Lord. Right, yeah, because they're teaching them lies, man. You know, they're, they're leading our people astray from the truth by them uh, uh, adding and taking away from the scriptures, man. You know, oh, saying that the scriptures uh, mean this when they don't mean that, man. Completely going off. Not speaking according to the words, man. Oh, yeah, because the scriptures are basically say, cover my people with the words. So when the Heavenly Father, through His only begotten Son, gave you the knowledge, wisdom, understanding of the scriptures, you're supposed to feed the people with. Right. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You see, he says you're supposed to give them the understanding of what the scriptures are saying because it says he set up men that were supposed to take care of the people through these words. Yep. You was expected, what is that again? Yep. That part? Yep, Jeremiah. You was expected to take care of the children of Israel through these words. Mm -hmm. right. But you was greedy of gain. That's right. You yeah. see? They was more worried about their belly, man. Right. They didn't mean in riches right. yeah. and things of that nature. Mm -hmm. right. So what no saying they accepted the bride. Yep. True men of the Lord, you can't bribe them off. No sake, we storing our treasures in heaven anyway. Yep. And America's about to be destroyed real soon in yep. your yep. lifetime. So why invest in this place? Why invest in a wicked, simple kingdom that was um, established off unrighteousness? You know what I'm saying? Wickedness, idolatry, witchcraft, and the Lord's going to destroy this place. Right. Why invest in this place? Know, it's right. going to be destroyed soon. Come, right. you see? Right. Oh yeah, enjoying uh, the pleasures of wickedness for a short season. Why do that? Right, right. When you can enjoy righteousness for all eternity for doing the right thing. Right. These false pastors aren't, aren't pushing the right thing upon our people. Come as you are. Right. You, oh, you ain't got to change. Yeah, yeah. You ain't got to repent. You just do whatever the hell you want to. You can just eat any kind of abominable food. You know right. what I'm saying? The right. laws are done away with. Right. The Lord said, I'm, I'm going to come and visit those guys for that, man. Right, right. right. I, I set you up, you know what I'm saying, to help the people out, man. That's right. The only right. thing you're doing is hurting the people. We read that earlier. That's right. Yep. By saying peace, peace, when there was no peace. Got them voting and all that, man. Right. Got them voting for nothing but a bunch of uh, deceivers, man. That's right. Well, you have a child who the word even called Jesus Christ for the head said himself. He said, you can't serve the Lord and mammon. Yep. And mammon is riches. Okay? You got these false prophets, you know what I'm saying, telling our people to drink the juice. Yep. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You got, you got, you got juice, you know what I'm saying, um, spots in the churches now. Yep. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, yeah, to where yeah. the church, the church pastor told us, um, it's, it's created by God, <laughs> so you know it's good. Nah, man, right, right. it's created by the devil, which the word devil means deceiver, yeah. aka slanderer, man. Your yeah. enemy, man. Yeah. Your yeah. enemy yeah. created the juice, man. Yeah. That's, That's your right. friend. That juice ain't help nobody out, man. Right. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. Like, it, like it made you feel good. Come on, man. Right. Don't say you're going to visit him for that. What is that again, bro? Yep. Jeremiah 23 and 1, yep. the NLT, it says, wait. What sorrows awaits the leaders of my people, the shepherds of my sheep? Just like the insane, we're going to name some of the leaders. T.D. Snakes, right. y'all call them Jakes, Al, Sharp Tongue, Jesse, Jackass, Jackson. Right. Whether, whether, whether it's a so-called Negro, Latin, or Native American Indian, all these false prophets are going to be destroyed. That's so right. come, man. That's right. You know? That's right. The Lord said great sorrows is going to come upon them, man. Yeah, they're living a lavish life right about now, uh -huh. jet setting. Yep. Jetting all around the world, you know what I'm saying? Doing these different sem yep. seminars, lying like hell, all to right. our people. You yep, know what I'm right. saying? Yep. Cut, um, got our people, pouring all on our people's head, then, then they hit them with the cross. Or, um, across their chest, right? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, across yeah, their yeah, head, yeah. right? All this nonsense, man. Yeah, right. it's, it's, it's almost over now, man. Yeah. Those false prophets got killed off over 2,000 years ago, and they coming back now. Because yep. there's a such thing called reincarnation. They're they back now doing the same thing, yeah, man. That's right. You see? That's right. That's right. What did the scripture say? Um, a good tree can't bring forth corrupt, corrupt fruit. fruit right? Neither can a corrupt right. tree bring forth good fruit. So then the yep. same corrupt trees bringing forth corrupt fruit, the, the whole congregation through. You know? Yep. Go ahead, bro. It says freedom on. But oh yeah, we the crazy ones, though, right? That's why they, that's why the church pastors always tell their congregation, don't 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 stop and talk to those crazy guys on the streets that's out there with no Bibles. But well, the scriptures command the men of the Lord to be out here in the streets. Yep. Then they got women pastors. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Women up there hollering and screaming yeah. on yeah. their period, trying to teach men the Bible. Well, that's, that's off, man. Yeah. Right. That's off. That's right, bro. It's good to say a woman shouldn't have served 30 over a man. And if she learned anything, let her learn at home. Yeah. You got one of buyers and all that, yeah, all up in church, right. shaking up funky ass. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Did the Lord fed up with it, man. Fed Why do you think we out here? That's right. We ain't out here to play no games with yeah. nobody, man. That's right. right. The Lord said, go to the chief place of concourse and cry aloud and spare not. Lift up your voice like a trumpet and tell my people what I'm going to do to them before I even do it, man. That's right. That's right. That's right. 
Everybody shocked, dog. Everybody shocked. Why is Russia and Ukraine doing what they're doing? It's this prophecy. It's right. The pastors ain't prophesying. And if they are prophesying, they're telling you what's going to happen before you happen. Lies. Like a rock said, they're prophesying lies, prophesying deceit. Yep. And I got a script, and I'm holding, I'm holding Ezekiel the 14th chapter on that. But let's read on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's read on, though, bro. Uh, keep reading on verse 1. And the scriptures that we bring out, you're not going to hear them in church. You're going to believe that. You're not, the pastor will bring out one scripture, read half of it, break it down wrong, and next thing you know, they just dance all day. Yeah. You see that video I put up on my page where the pastor just going around whipping each other with the belt? Where's that at? Where's that in the scriptures, bro? You know what I'm saying? You had the pastors rubbing everybody, ass, rubbing the women's asses in the church. Where's that at in the scriptures? Right. You see? Right, right. Feeding them pork and all that, man. Where's that in the scriptures, man? Right, right. right. Feeding them pepperoni, pizza, and all that. Where's that in the scriptures? Right. You got your, oh yeah, you got pastors in the church pushing on um, trick or treat. Yep. Where's oh, that yeah, in the yeah, scriptures, yeah, yeah, yeah. man? Yep. Pushing yep. Christmas. Yep. Where's yep. that in the right. scriptures? Right. Right. But oh yeah, we're the crazy ones though, right? <laughs> well, we'd be crazy, all right? You better, you better check out the definition for the word crazy. Uh -huh. <laughs> Let them read this right quick, and then you'll get that, man. Uh, finishing off Jeremiah 23 and 1, NLT, it says, But they have destroyed and scattered the very ones they were expected to care for. Right, so the Lord made you an overseer right. over the flock. He's supposed to be feeding them with the knowledge of wisdom and understanding of the Bible, but instead these false teachers and leaders prophesy out of their own heart, right. yeah. out of their own mind. Right. Man. And we know according to the Bible, it says the mind's deceitful and desperately wicked. Right. Yep. Who can know it? Right. You know? And there's a judgment for that, man. That's right. It says, it says the Lord. Oh, yeah. And they, and, and they ain't been telling our people who they are according to the Bible. That's they right, still yeah. pushing yeah. African-American, black, Latino, Native American, when all those are proverbs and bywords given to you by your slave master. Right. When we the children of Israel, the greatest people on the face of the earth. That's you right. see? Yeah. They're going to be held accountable for that, man. Yep. Go ahead, bro. You want verse 2 or you want to do it? Yeah. How you want to do it, bro? Uh, Jeremiah 23 and 2. Therefore, this is what the Lord, the power of Israel, says to these shepherds. Right, this is not stuff the Lord said in the Bible, man. This is what the Lord said. We're not speaking out of our own heart. Right. We're speaking thus said the Lord does said the Bible. Right. It says, says to these shepherds. To these shepherds, these, uh, these false teachers and leaders, man. Of, your, of our people, all right? Wolves and sheep clothing. Yep. yep. Wolves and sheep's clothing. Yep. That's all they are, man. Yep. It says, instead of caring for my flock. Instead of caring for the flock. Dang. They don't care. Oh, they teach our people lies, man. You don't really care about the flock, man. The NLT be going kind of hard, though, right? right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, 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 yeah. Instead, of, instead of caring for the flock of Yasha Allah, right. you know what I'm saying? The flock of Yahweh Bashim Shai, the sheep, the lost sheep. Our people lost like hell out here, man. Right. And you got these false pastors, you know what I'm saying, getting it in. They know our people don't know nothing. Right. They using and abusing them, man. Right. You know what I'm saying? They going the wrong way, and he's still leaving them the yeah. wrong way. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's that way. Man. Yeah. It's right. the wrong way, though. Right. the wrong way. Yeah. And then a thought coming in here like, don't we're going that way. No, right. no, you this nah, way. This I way. said that way, you go that way. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and our people don't do no reading. Our people are rude too, though. Go ahead. <laughs> he reads on. But you can't blame them because they don't, they don't, ain't don't no, know. Yeah, they ain't they nothing up there. Yeah. Ain't nothing up there. Acorn with nothing in it. You know what I'm right. saying? Ain't nothing with an acorn with nothing in it. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Just a shell. That's all. Yep. <laughs> but go ahead, though, bro. Yep. It reads on. You know, or, bunch of idiots. Right. <laughs> <laughs> right. Verse, verse 2, it says, instead of caring for my flock yep. and leading them to safety. Man. Leading them to safety by the scriptures, by giving them the wisdom, knowledge, and feeding them with the truth. Man, all right? Bro. You're supposed to feed them wholesome doctrine. Yeah. All right? You have deserted them. Damn. You have deserted them. Left them for dead. Yep. Right. Yep. Okay. Hey, listen, you that GMO doctrine by the lies, man. You didn't visit them with the truth. Damn. You didn't tell them who they are. You didn't tell them to come back and repent and to come back to y'all by Shino Shah. Oh, yeah, Bubble Eyes did not try to cut you off. Bubble Eye Blackfish Face did that too. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Oh, he, he, um, yeah, he pushed yeah. a um, doctrine, a flea doctrine. Yep. Uh, he broke down Michael 2 and 10 the wrong way. And he pushed a flea doctrine to where our people actually left America and went to Egypt, man. Damn. You know what I'm saying? He took their passports and everything. He took their passports and IDs and everything, man. <laughs> Bubble Eye Blackfish Face, man. The leader of the Gok. Know what I'm saying? Yeah. The leader of the yeah. cock. Yeah. Know what I'm saying? Right. Cock. Know what I'm saying? Right. Let, our, let our people win the Egypt, man. Let them for dead. Look, that could have been us, man. Yeah. 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 
the water you have by Shimon was shot, man. Yep. Yep. And look at that man, that man yep. know the yep. truth. You know what I'm saying? Yep. He was set up to feed our people, he was set up to, to take care of our people. Yep. But for that damn money. That yep. money. For the love of money. Yep. You know what I'm saying? He was still in the to and everything. The scripture said, don't let money, well, song said, don't let money change. Yep. That's right. Yep. But the scripture do also say, rich is probably not in the day of wrath. Yeah. So yeah, you got the money, but now he's gonna wrap. What you gonna do now? Right. Put, let, let Israel over there to Egypt, bro. You know what I'm saying? Took the passport, took the IDs, took their damn money, and left them over there for dead. And you know, um, Jake can't speak uh, um, liquor, um, whatever um, yeah, whatever language they is, yeah. whatever their language they speak yeah, over yeah. there. Jake, Jake just not coming from America. The only thing Jake know is slang. Right, yeah. And it was a couple, it was a couple, it was mainly um, well-to-do Israelites. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah, yeah. You know the false prophets, I'm saying, they ain't trying to get no bums in the hood type Israelites. Right. No, they going to the colleges, because that's what yeah. IUIC do. Oh, they yeah. recruit, oh, recruit yeah. guys from colleges and oh, all yeah. that, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And this dude, this dude wants your real name. Yeah. This dude wants your real name. He wants your bank um, account, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. He wants your um, yeah. social security yeah. number. Yeah. And, then, and then on top of that, this dude, this dude wants you to change your name. Damn. To such and such, Ben Israel. Ben now, not Bun. Yeah. Not Bun, Yashallah, but Ben. Been there with an E. Yeah. This dude through, man. Get a show all day, man. Yeah. And the Lord said he's gonna visit our people for that, man. That's right. Put that last part say rock. Yep. It says Jeremiah 23 and 2, the last part. It says uh fucking cock. You know what I'm saying, bro? Yeah. Which stand which stands for G-O-C-C -C, cock. Right. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Right. Cock. <laughs> Come on, man. Isn't that the same guy that's the bleeding mermaid? Yeah. Oh, yeah. The same dude that's pushing the mermaid doctrine, same dude that's pushing the hell doctrine, the same dude that's pushing sleazy Esau Edom can make it in them. Yep. Uh, years ago, I broke down the scriptures wrong. I had a misunderstanding of what the scriptures were saying. Well, Obadiah didn't have a misunderstanding right, right. of what the scriptures were saying. Isaiah didn't have a misunderstanding. Yep. Jeremiah, Jeremiah didn't have a misunderstanding. Right. King David. See, King David, the, the, all the men of the Lord, they didn't have a, so, so you must not be a man of the Lord then. Right. Yeah, man of the Lord. Gawk. Gawk? <laughs> Fucking gawk? You got it, bro. It says, uh, verse 2, instead of caring for my flock and leading them to safety, you have deserted them Damn, and driven bro. them to destruction. And you think, you think, you know what you're going to say, bro? You think the Lord ain't pissed off about that? Yeah, he's pissed off. You think off. the Lord ain't pissed off about yeah. that? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Just, just take some... Basically, you know what I'm saying? Take Israel somewhere and just leave their ass there. Yep. Israel don't know where the hell they ain't going. You know what I'm saying? Right. Israel don't know where they at. Where they and where they going, and you just leave them. That's how you know you gone somewhere. Yep. Yeah. 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 <laughs> and he did that first and foremost spiritually. Yep. And then he did it physically. You know yep. what I'm saying? Right. And look, 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 the thing about it, you know what I'm saying? It's cold that the Lord didn't put the spirit on nobody to take his head off. That's how you know serious judgment, harsh judgment is coming, man. Yep. You, leave, leave me, leave me in uh, Virginia. You know what I'm saying? Leave me in Virginia. Take me to Virginia and leave me in Virginia. I'm coming off your head next time I see you. Right. I'm calling somebody. Come get me. We're going to get you. We're going to get that man. Right. They just think somebody take you to Egypt. Right. This ain't no game. Right. Right. Go take me somewhere and leave me, yo. Take me to Fruitway. Take me to Fruitway and leave me and watch what happens. They ain't trying to be carnal. It's just being a man. Right. Another right. man take you somewhere and just leave you for dead. You don't know no damn body. Right. You just look around right. like this and then it start right. getting dark. And he, he on a jet already with your damn money. You know what I'm saying? With your IDs and your passport. Yep. That's a demon right there. Right. Yep. Yep. Drinking water, eating peanuts. Drinking water, <laughs> thinking about his new hit single. You know right. what I'm saying? You know he wanna, you know he wanna oh, be yeah, Ralph yeah, Tresman yeah, yeah. and Bobby Brown. Oh, yeah. That's what he all on stage, oh, yeah, hollering, yeah, yeah. throwing hats up in the damn air, catching the hat with his damn head and all that, man. <laughs> trying to be cute for women, man. All it is trying to be cute for women. Yep. He got everybody screaming like this man, fucking um, like this man James Brown or something. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like this man Mike spinning all around and all that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Up there hollering, hooping and hollering, uh, trying to sing. Right. Well, we out here singing. You know what I'm saying? We singing a this true song. song. That's right. right here. That's right. You got it, bro. That's right. Uh, finishing off, verse 2, Jeremiah 23 and 2, NLT. It says, Now I will pour out my judgment on you for the evil you have done to them. Damn. Ezra the Wolf, what you did, man. You see, you're doing all this wickedness. You're feeding our people lies. There's a judgment for that, man. You know? Y'all about to my shot about to uh, uh, send more harsh judgments very, very soon, man. You already see that one dude shriveling the hell up already. 
Y'all see that one dude already shriveling up already. You know what I'm saying? Um, 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 Barney. You know what I'm saying? Barney. You know what I'm saying? We just say Barney. You know what I'm saying? You know, Barney wears purple. You know what I'm saying? So we just say Barney. You know what I'm saying? Ain't that Barney? Yeah. Ain't that Barney? Yeah. That's somebody pointing to right? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, the Lord. The Lord? Yeah, the Lord. This is what happened, man. That, that's why, man, I'm trying to tell you, man, either, either either teach the right thing or shut your freaking mouth. Yep. That's right. The Lord said, if you ain't got the answers, hold your tongue. Yeah, right. right. You know what I'm saying? You know, just saying the spirit. We just read it. It says, sorrow is when that word sorrow went into sickness. Yep, see? Damn. Yep. The word sorrow went into sicknesses, man. I teach yep. the false doctrine. The Lord will give you over to the different sicknesses. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Damn, man. Ezekiel 7 and 25, it says destruction coming. It says destruction coming. Destruction coming. It says destruction coming. And they shall seek peace, and there shall be none. There's going to be a whole bunch of judgment going on, man. That's right. Our people are seeking some type of refuge, but they seeking it in the wrong places, man. Here it is. Uh, the scripture says uh, the righteous are going to run into the name of the Lord, but it's a strong tower, and they're going to be safe. But what is this false teaching these pastors and leaders doing? They're leading our people to the uh, path of destruction. Man. That's right. Okay? And then them themselves, they're going to be deleted out the program very, very soon, too. That's right. For doing that. Anything else? Yeah. Yeah. Did you have something? Did you order something? Yeah. I got something. Yep. yep. Bring it up for me right quick. Yeah, I, got, I got one more for you there, Jimmy. Uh, um, Jeremiah 8 and 11 for they have healed the hurt of the daughter of my people slightly saying peace peace when there is no peace yeah, this guy uh, Barney said that there's no Jacob's trouble right that's when there ain't no tribulation coming. like come on man right. that picture might cut them all up man all right. All up. And these dudes really act like ain't nothing coming on, man. Anytime you on stage trying to act like you boys the men spin around and shit, catch your fucking hats <laughs> with your fucking head and all that, man. Right, right, right. Y'all, the scriptures, um, Ecclesiastes 7, right. verse 2 oh. and verse 4 says, Lord, it's better to go to the house in the morning. But every time you turn around, these dudes party and feasting, cooking out. Yeah, there ain't nothing yeah. wrong with cooking out, but you, you ain't got to put it on, on camera yeah, and right. all that. That's right, bro. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like if we get together one day, you know what I'm saying? We have a little, little cookout or whatever, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Look, you know me, young, young, and all that. But we ain't recording it. Right. You know I mean, we might take a little picture and put it on our WhatsApp app for brethren to see that we all got up or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Shalom, shalom. That's it, man. No, but it's going to be the brethren, man. You know what I'm saying? Not us in a, um, a room full of women, too, man. Nah, man. You know what I'm saying? That leads to wickedness right there, man. Right. You know what I'm saying? It's going to be the brethren. You got it, bro. Plus, when you tell people there's peace coming, it, it uh, helps further your, your agenda. Right. Mm -hmm. profit more because you can yeah. have more cookouts, have more yeah. gatherings. People spend more money. Yeah. You know, like like they're entering they're entering into their little Passover gathering. That costs. Yeah. When you tell people that, that destruction's coming, people gonna run for cover. Yeah. They ain't coming out much, they're not spending much money. Right. You know, so it, it hurts your agenda, man, when you're a wicked uh, false prophet pushing that agenda of peace. Right. Us. People not keeping the sick when they yeah. keep them at ease, man. Yeah. All right. And we're not supposed to be at ease because these places are captive. Oh, that's it on that. Let me read it. Jeremiah um, 8 and 11. Matter of fact, I'll get the NLT. Let me read it again. Yeah. Jeremiah 8 and 11, NLT. They offer superficial treatments mm. for my people's Ooh. mortal wounds. They give assurances of peace when there is no peace. Hey, right. You're teaching them lies, man. All right? You're trying to keep my people in a, in a dead state of mind instead of healing them with the word, man. It's the scripture say, um, he, they healed our people slightly. You yep. know what I'm saying? The wound's still open, though. Yep. Ain't do nothing but put a, um, a band aid on the wound. You yep. know what I'm saying? When you when you um, teach lies, our people are already wounded already, but yep. then you come and teach lies. The only thing you're doing is putting a band aid on the on the, um, when you, right. somebody slit your throat open, yeah. you come with a nail, little ass band aid. You come with a band aid that can fit around your pinky. That ain't gonna help, man. That band aid ain't soaking nothing up, man. Right. But I got a preset right your yeah, because all they're doing is telling you that there is a light. Right. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. You don't go no beyond yeah. that. Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's an Israelite party. Right. You know what I'm saying? Man. It's one sleazy E can make it out of all people. 
Come on, man. When it's good, when, when Hebrews, uh, what is it? Hebrews, the 13th chapter? Yeah. There's no, uh, but look, he, he can't repent. You know what I'm saying? Even though he started carefully with tears. But I'll bring this out for you, though, right quick. This is Amos chapter 6. And these Edomites ain't thinking about the Lord. Jeremiah, uh, not Jeremiah, but um, Psalms tell you that. The 14th chapter tells you that. And many other scriptures, man. The, the Most High is not in all his thoughts, man. This is um, Amos 6 and 1. Woe unto them that are at ease in Zion. The Zion represents you Israelites, man. Starting off with these false teachers and leaders, man. Right? They're at ease, man. You know, because Esau is giving them that benefits, that bribe. You know? But the scripture says, woe, which be the death and destruction for you for that, though. And, um, the Lord said, this is not our rest, so anytime you're at ease, that means you're comfortable. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You're laid back. You look up the definition for the word ease, it's pretty much to be lazy, to be laid back. You know what I'm saying? Laxy yeah. days. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's right. When it's supposed to be a sense of urgency right about yeah. them. Right. You got wars, rumors of wars. Yep. Mm -hmm. and, and they get ready to make it mandatory that you take that M-A-R-K. You yep. know what I'm saying? Yep. Shit. You don't even want to go to the grocery store. Oh, yeah. You don't even want to go to the grocery store. Remember, remember when Jay used to be having said to go to the grocery store? Yep. Yo, I'm getting ready to go to the grocery store. Everybody load up in the car. I'm getting ready to go to the grocery store. Mama don't even tell you they're going to the grocery store no more. You just sit there contemplating. Damn, man, right. should I go to the grocery store? We do need some groceries, man, but damn, should I go to the grocery store? That's what Jake in the house doing now. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? They're not excited about going to the grocery store. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Shit, expensive as hell at the grocery store, man. Right. Yep. But then you got a woman who wants you to uh, take her out every day. What? Damn. Nah. Every week you always see the people just gathering up abroad, going to these expensive ass restaurants, man. When gas go up, everything go up. That's right. Everything, right. everything, yep. everything. Yep. You know? Yeah, right. So Amos 6 and 1. Woe to them that are ease in Zion. Once you get that word, woe mean the death and destruction. Alright, that are comfortable, that are lazy here, that are not thinking about the Lord in these times, man. See, that's how time to wake out of sleep. Because right. the end is near to where we believe. Right, right. But Jake, like not nah, Jake, you know what I'm saying, um, hear the alarm going up, they um Throw the alarm against the wall, put their head back yeah. on the cup, yeah. yeah. knowing it's time to get yeah. up. Yeah, you got the, uh, the smartphone when your alarm go off, you got snooze or dismiss. Yeah, they don't even snooze, they're just dismiss. Hell yeah, see, they don't see? even want to come back home. That's right. But the snooze, you know, it'll constantly uh, repeat itself. Yeah, you know, but if you dismiss it, like a minute home. later, yeah. it'll go off again. Yeah. This is um, and hey, look, and trust in the mountain of Samaria. And the mountain represents uh, government, man. Right. And the modern day Samaria is America, right? Right. right. See, they trusting in this government, man. That's why they still vote. Right. They right. um, they voting er early voting. Right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah they got this. Early voting. They drinking that spider juice. Yeah, they drinking that spider juice. Trusting in this man, yo. Yep. And they trusting in them because of the leaders. They they set up the Israelite leaders that are set up to feed them lies, man. Because right. Jake ain't doing no research, man. Jake ain't reading no book. That's why it's a term out there. If you want to hide anything from a ninja, put it in a book. My yeah, people ain't reading, man. That's right. Shit, right. I people ain't even reading the ingredients when they when they buy some food and get yeah. ready to cook it. Right. They just throw, they throw the damn ingredients away, yo, and wing it. I people all about winging it, yo. Yeah. Yeah. Buy something with it. ingredients right there, man. Right, right. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you buy a lawnmower, you got the um, instructions yeah. right there. Jake throw the damn instructions out, you know what I'm saying, right, right. and yeah. wing it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Then they pour the damn oil where the gas supposed to be, right. and the gas where the oil is supposed right. to be. Right. Then, a, then a lawnmower through. That's Jake, though. It says, I'm going to trust in the mountain of Samaria, which are named chief of the nations. Mm -hmm. Then you know it's talking about America. Yeah. So who's the chief of the nations? America, man. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Our people trust in America. They trust in Babylon, man. America. The land of confusion at that. You trust in a land that was established off of confusion. You right. know what I'm saying? That's how you know Jake gone, man. They trust in a land that's named the bitter. Yeah, bitter, yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying? The word sister means pit. Yeah. Ain't never, it was set up to trap you up, man. Get you all entangled in the web. You know what I'm saying? Right. <laughs> no saying pit of bitterness. You know what I'm saying? Right. Hell. Hell, really? That's right. Yeah. America's hell yeah. for us, man. Right. We're just looking to play it on the earth, captivity, yeah. slavery. It says um to whom the house of Israel came. Right. They want to be a uh, servant of Esau, man. Yeah. Then you know it's talking about America. Yeah. Yeah. Where did the house of Israel come to serve punishment? America, America. man. America. And through that, and through that, uh they, they develop uh stocks on the Oh yeah. You know they want to even be a bigger slave than they was when uh, we was physically. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Right. You know. I got a precept, and then college also helps promote oh, that yeah. even more. Yeah. They include yeah. feminism with it, and all yeah. that, and all these other doctrines. That Jake come out of four year college, man. You, you, it's like you don't even know him. Right. Even when he, before he left high school, or whatever. You yeah. know, he got a suit and tie on and all that. Got right, uh, skinny leg jeans and everything. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. You don't even know the dude no more, man. 
Like, yo, that, that Leroy, yo? <laughs> no, Damn. You know, I couldn't say that's how you know this place is Rome all over again. Right. Because uh, in, in Rome, when they would take the, uh, they would take the, uh, the young men from whatever villages and stuff, they would take them yeah. to, uh, to Rome, teach them the Roman way, right. and send them back as yep. diplomatic people. They're like, yeah. yep. what the hell you got right. here, yo? Right. 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 Come in with a bald ass yeah. head, you right. know what I'm saying? Right. Clothes Come all different. Clothes yeah. all yeah. funny, you know what I'm saying? Walking all, walking all yeah. stiff. You <laughs> know what I'm saying? Speaking of different languages. Yeah. Look, 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 eating all kind of abominable foods. Right. Yeah. Come back with a um, bag full of scrimps. <laughs> They don't call it shrimp, y'all. Scrimp. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think we're going. Come back with a um a net full of catfish. Yeah. Yeah. I think we're going, yo, eating the head and everything, man. Yeah, right. You know what I'm saying? So Jake gone right about yeah. now, man. Yeah. Only yeah. thing that can correct Jake, you no know saying, is the Lord, man. Yeah. I mean, if the Lord don't want you to get it, you ain't gonna get it, man. That's right. Anything else in the form? Lamentations 4 and 17. As for us. Our eyes as yet failed for our vain help. Right, yeah, because by our people believing in Egypt, which is America, all right, this is vain help, man. It's vain meaning it or work. And it's mainly two thirds, you know what I'm saying, pushing that on our people even more, though. Because yeah. Jake, like, man, I don't trust this devil, you know what I'm saying? But then you got other Jake's on some, man, come on, man, give him one more chance, man. You know what I'm saying? Right. And then they put a, um, a, a fake Jake one, you know what I'm saying, as our. Uh, that's all right. right. A new Mike judge. Right. A new judge. No, oh, a new judge. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. She's the new judge of the Supreme Court. Like that, like that means something to us. You know what I'm saying? Uh, uh, reading on, Lamentation the Court. Where our eyes goes into your mind, too. Your mind uh, uh, to seek pain and help, man. Yeah, you know? Yeah. You know? They're going to be spoiled the war, though. Yeah. Yeah, all these females walking through here, man. Yeah. When, that day, when that day come, man. <laughs> Y'all saw that, that y'all saw that goop lady, which that lady probably was a Jake though in New York. That dude followed her home and hid up on her bed. Like me and the brother Cabal was talking about in the car. How, how did someone sneak in your house? I know, right? How did somebody how did somebody sneak in your goofy ass house? Yeah. This shit goofy, real yeah. goofy, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Well yeah. you ain't locked the door or something? Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm exactly saying? Just walked in the house talking yeah. on the phone. Yep. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. When it took a shower and everything, you know what I'm saying? When you went, yeah. well, I mean, how did this get dude get in your house without you seeing him? Yeah. What you do? Just walk in the house, look at your phone, go in your room. That's how you know you went straight to the shower, didn't check it. See, one thing about a man, we checking the door anyway. Yeah, yeah. When we walk in the door, you no, know, so we making sure the door yeah. locked. When we walk in the door. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's like you come out the shower, you know what I'm saying? That's how you know you've been in the shower for a long time. You come out the shower to do it, and you, he didn't eat a sandwich and every damn thing. Right, right, he didn't right. pull the um, he didn't pull the um, brother man, he didn't pull the brother man. You know what I'm saying? He didn't pull the he didn't pull the brother man from the fifth from the fifth floor on you, y'all. Know what I'm saying? Then ate and everything, put on your robe and everything. You know what I'm saying? Sat watch TV with his leg crossed and everything. Pop the popcorn. You come out, you come outside the shower, you. It smells like popcorn in here. Damn right, dude. Somebody over there just cooked it already. Right, but she right. paid. She don't pay that no money. Oh, 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 maybe it's coming from upstairs. Maybe it's coming from upstairs. That's how you know, dude is stuck up in that room. Yep. And you can see it, brother. You know. But you can picture it, right? Yeah. Dude, he, you don't even, you even finish the sandwich. She walk in. She's like, I don't remember eating the sandwich. I know, right? <laughs> Look, dude, don't even finish eating the sandwich. He got half the sandwich still on the on the um, coffee table. You know what I'm saying? Ooh. With some hot cocoa <laughs> and, the, and the cocoa and the, and the steam is still. Right. You know what I'm saying? No, well, she probably got marshmallows in her shit. Yeah. I'm gonna say, well, no marshmallows, but the cocoa still steaming. You know what I'm saying? And she, I don't remember fixing hot cocoa. <laughs> Where did that sandwich come from? Deal do it. Look, look. Oh well. Oh well. Maybe I had, maybe I had that yesterday. What? Right. What? <laughs> You know what I'm saying? That's how you know she go and get in the bed. You know what I'm saying? Dude up under the bed. You know what I'm saying? And she probably in there sewing like hell. You know what I'm saying? Right. No, she probably in there talking her ass off while the dude up under the bed. Like, I can't wait. I can't wait till you shut your fucking mouth. You know what I'm saying? And get off that phone. Right. Dude, dude probably up under the bed like this. Right. this is can't wait you Like, that bitch talk a lot. Don't yeah. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. But look, these, look, these are this is what happens when you trust in Samaria, man. Right. You're comfortable, you at ease when it's somebody up under your bed. Right. You got it, bro. It's chilling, man. <laughs> yeah. Going back. That reminds me of that movie with Michael uh, Eaton, man. You know what I'm saying? Remember when uh, he was he was stalking? Uh, it was a movie where he was pretty much like a stalker. You know what I'm saying? And it was like a scene where he met more chestnut. 
So they went to the bed. Oh, I think I didn't talk about yeah. He was listening and yeah. talking, you know, doing what they were yeah, doing. Yeah, they were talking about. You know what I'm saying? They pretty much treated him like a serial killer. Uh -huh. You know? That's what Smith's created for Venice, too. Yep. Like, Shona came from up under that bed and, and went there, Jason Myers on. Yep. You know what I'm saying? I said Jason Myers. Michael Myers. Both of them, right, bro? That's the spirit, right? That's the spirit, right? That's the spirit of the Lord that said that, man. Both of them. You know what I'm saying? Jason Myers, bro. Both of them. That's a video title, right, bro? I, got, I, got, I, got, I might have to copyright that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, 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 right. You know, Sleazy right. always trying to copyright right. something, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Now, the Lord knows something. We just started the earth, so we always going to say something flavorful. You know what I'm saying? With some season, y'all. Make it work. Yeah, make it work. Chad, you got it, bro. In Lamentation 4 and 17, as for us, our eyes as yet failed for our vain help. In our watching, we have watched for a nation that could not save us. Right, so our people were lying on this on Esau's system, man. Instead of allowing your whole body shooting out a shot, you the one that the only one that can save you and deliver you, you know, that's gonna lead you down this church, man. You know, putting that church in this system, yeah. you know what I'm saying? You know, uh, doing spend all that time and effort and energy to, to, to build it up some more. It's gonna come to God. It's all gonna pass away anyway. Right. Yeah. I got something for you because I'm okay. This is, um, and, and, and the, the message that we teach, the message of truth that we teach, the average Israelite is not going to believe. It. You know what I'm saying? Some going to believe, some not, right? Sure. This is um, Acts chapter 28, verse 24. And some believe the things which were spoken, and some believe not. And so, just like when people walk by, and you, know, you have some brothers that walk by and they, they heard and like, damn, that's right. Yeah, that is right. You know, they're in the believer. Yeah. Judgment. Judgment always happening at that more at that, uh, that, uh, that square down there, don't it though? Right. What's coming up this place? Hmm. Judgment on somebody though. It's all good though. It's a good thing though. Yeah, good. Yeah, but, hey, just because somebody walked by and doesn't believe, that's not me that's in the end of the day. So you can say something believe or something did. So you know, we just have to believe Lord, the Lord, you know, vessels the Lord had to believe, and Lord's gonna endure it to the end. And then you got some vessels that just walk on by and yep. that's, the, that's their luck. That's you know? right. It made, me, it made me think, it made me think in the spirit also that what, you know, because um, Esau was a uh, vessel slotted for uh, destruction at the end of the day, you know, but then our people, you know, because he can't repent. Mm -hmm. Esau can't repent, but our people take on that same spirit, because as an Israelite, you can repent, but the Lord fed that, that spirit on these um, false prophets to where they can't repent, you know? They, like, they won't repent, because the Lord won't allow them, so they well, can I got a bad, I got a precept, and I come right back. Oh, yeah. You want that again, right? Yeah, yeah. I got a precept for you, though. Only unless you want that. No, no, yeah, whatever. This is on um, Hebrews chapter 3, verse 18, and it reads, To whom swear he that they should not enter into his rest, but to them that believe not. Okay. This is on um, Hebrews chapter 3, verse 18. To whom swear he that they should not enter into his rest. Um. Hebrews chapter 3, verse 17. But with whom was he grieved 40 years? Was it not with them that had sinned? And so it's the same people back. Yeah. You, know, the, the, you already pissed the Lord off back right. in the wilderness. Right. And stuff. Those are the same ones back now. Man. Right. You know, same, the same ones back when Lord Yahweh Shine, you know, was on the scene. Uh, the same generation. Yep. You know, and now it's the same, same people back, man. That's right. The ones that got uh, killed off in the wilderness. Because America, the wilderness. That's right. You know what I'm saying? All America is the wilderness all over again, yeah, man. Right. Now people just wandering around looking stupid as hell. You know what I'm saying? Right, right, right. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So the one, Dad. So the one, so the one. Just like on Deja Pay when that dude was like, Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that, that's two yeah, thousand yeah, yeah. people all over again, man. Through, man. That's right, that's right. You know what's called? Because in the spirit, what? In the, in the wilderness, then the Lord will have what? Have, have Moses and his set of leaders. Yeah. Back in the wilderness now, the Lord is setting up what had the king. Yeah. He was setting up leaders after that, man. Yeah. So you see the leaders are being set up again, man. Yeah. Going you know? right back to one of your favorites and my favorites too. Yeah, yeah, Second Chronicles 20, 20, 20, 20. Yeah. 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 So it reads once again, Hebrews chapter 3, verse 17. It says, um, <clears throat> matter of fact, I'm gonna start at 16. God, God. 16, 3 and 16. For some when they had heard, 
did provoke. Mm -hmm. How be it, not all that came out of Egypt by Moses. So they provoked the Holy One of Israel, yeah. of Israel to anger. Right. You know? You know? They provoked Yahweh by Shema Shai, the one who God in Jesus Christ, to anger. Right. You know? Doing, look, another thing, that's what the, um, the Spirit, that's what the Elder Yashua was saying. You had a whole angel there, man. Yeah. Yep. The whole time. Yeah. Because we know the Spirit was the Lord Yahweh Shai. Yeah. You know? He had him right there the whole time, and Jacob's still like, you know, I'm building this damn calf, bro. That's why this thing is all about faith for real, for real. Now, the Lord has to give you the gift of faith for you to believe now. That's right. That's right. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Because our people saw. Right. Our people saw the miracles happen right in front of their face and still decided to worship idols. Right? Yep. yep. That, that's it, madness. It, it was and it was going to um, thrust um, Aaron through yep. if he didn't create. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Yep. They, they pressed him, that's man. That's right. That's right. No, Jake is. Yeah, you better. You know what I'm saying? So read on, Hebrews 3 and 17. But with whom was he grieved 40 years? Mm -hmm. Was it not with them that had sin? That's right. Whose caucuses fell in the wilderness? Mm -hmm. what? What whose caucuses fell, fell, fell in the wilderness? <laughs> the skeletons, man. You know, the, the remains, man. The Lord, with that generation, that 40 years, man, he got rid of them. And, 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 and replenish them with the next generation, man. And, and it was a, um, a number amount of Israelites that died in the wilderness, man. That's right. You see what I'm saying? And, and man, I say in the spirit, and guess what? Who, the, who, who made, out of all those people, how many people made it into the promised land? Any brothers know? Holy, holy ground. <laughs> holy ground. <laughs> no, I'm safe to say that. No, no, so as, as action brothers in the spirit, out of all that generation, how many people made it into the promised land? The brothers know. True. Let's, say, see, say let's see that read of now. Yeah. You say who, brother? Yeah, was Kay, Kay was one of them, brother, but who else? Joshua. Josh, yep. So what, Just what, two, yeah. Yep. Original. Yep. Right. Yep. Joshua yep. and Caleb, man. Yep. You know, out of that generation. Out of all them Israelites, man. So we, there's a number of amount of Israelites that died off, man, in the wilderness, man. And a number of amount of Israelites going to die off here in the wilderness, man. That's right. AKA America, man. That's right. That's right. Hey, brother, brother, you gotta, you gotta read the history, man. <laughs> you know, it, it shows, man, the Lord is only gonna a remnant to enter in, man. You know? Yeah, know. And, and, and one scripture that comes to my mind, Hebrews 10 to 31. Right. It's a fearful thing to fall into the hands of living power, power, man. Yeah. You see, the Lord say, oh, whether well, man or woman, you ain't seeking me, whether well, man or woman shall die a horrible death. Yeah. There's no respect to a person. Right. You can't bribe the Lord off. Right. It says 40 years, read that 40 years. Mm -hmm. Um, it says, um, 17, but with them was he grieved 40 years. The Lord was angry with our people 40 years to a point that he established a new generation that didn't remember Egypt. Yeah. Yeah. Because that, that was the main thing that this generation was doing. They were remembering Egypt, yeah. man. So they were looking back. They kept looking back. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. That's right. That's right. It has that life in the twice yeah. spirit, right. man. Look, like, man, Egypt, we had this Egypt, right. we had that. No, man, and that's the same thing these, these uh, Jakes are doing now, man. Well, in America, we got this, we can establish this in America. Man, forget America, man. The spirit, I said earlier that America has been circling the dream, man. It's fully about to go out. This is the holy ground, I guess. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Everybody's scared to walk through. You know what I'm saying? Right. We're going to read on, though. <laughs> Was it not with them that has sinned, mm -hmm. whose caucuses fell in the wilderness? And so the Lord is going to do the same thing here, man. Yeah. Are those that don't want to get right with them, those were back then? Back when Lord Yahweh Shah was on the scene, they're back now, okay? Hey man, their car is gonna uh, lay here in America being burnt up, man. Right. Mm -hmm. You know? So this is this is the same thing. The Lord's gonna be a part of that with the, <laughs> the generation that walks into the promise yeah, land. I know, you know? Right. I know, right? The Lord's gonna be a part of that number, man. You know what I'm saying? You know? It's gonna be beautiful, ain't it, brothers? That's right. The we of that number is gonna be beautiful though, right? Yes. You know what I'm saying? To, to, to finally see our homeland once again, no, right. it's been okay. thousands of years, I, man. Right. We ain't seen the homeland since 70 AD, man. Right. 70 AD, brothers. That's right. We've been home since 70 AD. The Lord was pissed the hell off with us, man. That's right. Kicked us out, out of the land, man. And the land's still mourning, man, because the right people ain't there. Right. We got right. scattered Israelites over there, you know what I'm saying? Right. But as a buck, the whole nation, yeah. it's not over there. And you know, it's funny part, even that, it's like with the 70 AD for the, uh, for the southern kingdom, even longer for the northern people, yeah. because they was over here. Yep. You know, so they haven't seen the, the Holy Land in a, in a good minute yep. now, man. Right. You know? So, hey, Lord's will be part of your left. He's about to go home, man. I know that's right. You know? That's more than that Yeah. It says on um, verse 18, Hebrews 3 and 18. That's right. It says, um, And to whom swear he that they should not enter 
and to his rest. Because there's remembering Egypt, man. Right. It, man, the Lord's like, I got some new for you. Right. Some way better than you. Know? Egypt for you. My people like, man, Egypt, but Lord, Egypt has got Because they trust in oppression. That's right. You know? That's right. My people trusting on pressure. pressure. They, they had Stockholm Syndrome back then. They got it now. Yeah, you right, know right. what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. right. Right. They yeah, loved yeah. themselves on Pharaoh, didn't it all? Yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying? When that small renter was like, Because hey, the same things that you see here. I can't wait till I get to Pharaoh. Right. Let, me get, let me just get close to him, man. Let me just get close to him. Because they were putting hell on our people, right? Because right? the things that we see that uh, are normal here in Babylon the Great, we were doing, they, Jake was doing it in Egypt, you know? Certain things that you know it's called that uh, you see that, that is known to us here. Jake was doing it back in Egypt. Those are Egyptian customs. Yeah, right? yeah. You know, but this shit. No, I was just gonna say Jake loved the bald head back then. Yeah, yeah. Jake yeah, loved yeah. those a smooth face. Mm -hmm. yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. 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 And, and, you know, and, you know, um, Sodom. You know what I'm saying? Came out of Egypt. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. With the Babylonians. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Hamites. That's right. You know what I'm saying? And the Egyptians, they was Hamites. So, so, so you know, Jake was doing all kind of wicked shit. Man. It was all into that. He was there you know for Jake, Jake won't circumcise on each other, yep. you know what I'm saying, in Egypt. You know what I'm saying? Right. They was learning the ways of the heathen, man. Mm -hmm. So you got a whole lot of Jake's, you know what I'm saying? On this side, you know what I'm saying? The, um, the, the daddy probably got up out the house and the mama had him and didn't even circumcise. There's a whole lot of Jake's walking around uncircumcised, man. Yep. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Gentiles, man. That's right. But the Lord, is, the Lord, you know what I'm saying, doing away with all that now. That's right. You know what I'm saying? First you get circumcised, no saying the spirit now. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And then physical, you know? Right. Um, it says, um, so we see, I'm gonna read that last part again. Sure, sure. And to whom swear he that they should not enter into his rest, sure. but to them that believe not. So the, Is that so the Israelites that didn't believe, they didn't enter into right. that rest. They died off right. in the wilderness, man. Just died off, man. Died off. It was some rebellious Israelites in the wilderness yeah, back yeah. then too, man. <laughs> they was talking crap, you know what I'm saying, to Moses yeah. Yeah. and the authority that Yahweh Bashim set up. Right. Those guys back now. It was false prophets in the wilderness. You know what I'm saying? They back now. Pointing them. <laughs> you know, I always say verse, you know, that it gives certain um the scriptures always give certain names and certain men. They, they slick, right? We see that phone. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Right, yeah. But look though, whatever whatever you recorded, you better take heed to it. Yeah. That's right. You know what I'm saying? Don't be like Sleazy and just come on trying to get a five minute or five times right. fame. Last verse. Right. It says, um, so so we see that they could not enter in because of unbelief. Because of unbelief. And even with our people in the promised land, they couldn't they didn't believe. And they and they had the miracles happening in front of the manna from heaven, you know, the water out of the rock. Like some of the things they like, damn, how can you how can you not believe in something happening right in front of you? It's like brothers. Uh, it's like uh, Jake out here, and they see a chariot, and this guy is like, ah. yeah. Come on, man. Like that, but that's why you I heard that there. dude, alien, alien. It's coming to the earth. It's coming to the earth. That's salvation right there, man. See, the Jakes that ain't right, no saying. When they see the chariots, no saying, they are gonna bug out anyway. That's right. You know what I'm saying, right. you know. Yep. When you see the Lord got the spirit on us, when we see the chariot, we start rejoicing, man. Yeah, happy as hell. We're trying to do the best that we can down here, man. That's right. We ain't down here bullshit. That's right. See, we, they, that's fleshly right there. They, they fleshly. You got your fleshly moments, of course, you know what I'm saying? You just walk around, you know what I'm saying? Um, 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 100%, you know what I'm saying? Every damn day, you know what I'm saying? Just want to go every day. Nah, you got your fleshly moments and when you listen to music and might be with your woman, things of that nature. You know what I'm saying? You might go to the mall and all that. But 24-7, though, these people are all like, these people are like that 24-7. Foolish. They turned up 24-7 in wickedness, right? Foolish. So I'm going to go right back to that, um, that Acts. Yeah, come, come. Acts chapter 28, verse uh, 24. And some believe the things which were spoken, and some believe not. So you're going to have those that believe and those that don't believe, man. Everything's coming back and doing it uh, back in the circle again, the reincarnation. And you have those that didn't believe and those that believe. Man. The Lord going to have these people look out for us too, though, man. You can feel it, though, man. Yep. These different heathens, man, Jake's, you know what I'm saying? They've seen us on videos and things of that nature. We might be coming through their neighborhood or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Somebody might be out or whatever, and that's saying, no, they see us like, yo, come in here, come in here. The Lord gonna make moves for us, man. The Lord's will, we up that number, man. It happened before. It happened before. It's gonna happen again. Look at Daniel and the king. <laughs> hey, after, after the king saw, he said, look, man, I know you, the Lord will deliver you anyway. But I think I'm about to chop my head off, so I gotta put you in his den. It's, it's, it's not me, though. You know? <laughs> you know? But he did, made him president over 
No, so the heathen, they go see men of the Lord, like, it's not healthy. The Lord might say. Pretty much men of God. Yeah, yeah. 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 People like Rick Flair in that car. <laughs> Romans 3 and 3. Um, you finish yours one? Yeah. It says, For what if some did not believe? It said, For what if some did not believe? We just read earlier that all the unfaithfuls are dying in the unfaithful. So what? So what if somebody throws up here and they're like, ah, bro, that's not for me. That's okay, man. Okay? You know? It, it shouldn't bother brothers when people come over and don't believe, man. That's a part of the story. Yeah. You know? It says, Shall their unbelief make the faith of the Most High without effect? So their unbelief... Y'all come on through. Come on through. Now, come on through. Yeah. Yep. It says, verse 3. The end of verse 3 says, Shall their Nobody unbelief... Coming through. Just reading the Bible, no saying everybody's scared to come through, just it can't come through. What's what's uh price is right, come on down. You know what I'm saying? Walk through. And you gonna you might yeah, you might learn some. I mean you might there's something you might not want to learn. But you're gonna learn something, you're gonna learn, we say you're gonna learn today. You got it, bro. Reading the end of Romans 3 and 3. Shall their unbelief make the faith of the Most High without effect? Just because somebody doesn't believe in the Bible, is it going to make Russia not uh, shoot missiles on America? Right. right. All right. Is it not going to make uh, China shoot missiles on America? Right. Okay. You know, is it going to make martial law never happen? Right. You know, the Karagma never be implemented. Right. You know, ma mandated. You know, is that going to stop? That, that, is that unbelief going to stop the spirit spread of Ephesians from right. from doing their thing? Nah, man. I don't think so. Everything that's written over the scriptures is going to come to pass. That's right. What else Verse 4. The Most High forbid. Hell no. The Lord going to do what he said he's going to do. You know? So everything written in these scriptures is going to happen. It's going to happen, man. If it already has to happen, it's going to happen, man. Right. You know? Remember what I was saying? Both past, present, and future. You know? Things are happening in the scriptures right now is going to speak. You know? A vengeance happening. Uh, judgment happens. All these things are prophecies that are happening right now as we speak and going to happen in the future, man. If it didn't happen yet. Right. You know? It says, Yeah, let the Most High, Yahweh, Yahweh, Shimmy Shai, be true. And let the Lord be true. Right. The Lord, because God is His grace, Yahweh, Shimmy Shai. Let His words be true. And every man a liar, man. Yeah. You know? Because what a man might say he might do tomorrow, he ain't going to do it. That's why the only thing that can justify us is the sayings in his book. That's right. You know what I'm saying? Because right. remember, the scripture say, by thy words thou shalt be justified, by and by thy words thou shalt be condemned. Yeah. So what justifies the men of the Lord? The sayings that we yep. bring out according to the Bible. Right. Right. Not our own words. Right. You can't be justified by your own sayings. That's foolishness. Right. You know what I'm saying? With the most high, you know? That's right. You got an umbrella people? Do anybody got umbrellas? I got an umbrella. I can take them. You might want to get them right quick. We're seeing, some, we're seeing some drops coming yeah, down. Yeah, I got one of them. I'm going to finish off my uh, uh, Romans 3 and 4 says, Let the Most High be true, but every man a liar. As it is written, that thou mightest be justified in thy sayings, right. and mightest overcome when thou art judged. Well, it's true. It's just right after that. Well, you be justified in your sayings, because our sayings are thus says the Lord, thus says the Bible. Said, our sayings are thus said the Lord, just thus said the Bible, everything the Lord said, man. But everything everybody else is saying is off their own mind, which is never going to come to pass. Yeah. I got some. Isaiah 34 and 16. Seek ye out of the book of the Lord. Mm -hmm. Seek ye out of the what, brother? Seek ye out of the book of the Lord. The book of the Lord. Wait, is that the crown, brother? Seek ye out of the book of the Lord. And maybe, maybe it's the Buddhist book. Seek ye out of the book of the Lord. You know, negative, uh, 50 negative laws yeah, of the yeah. 42 <laughs> negative 42. laws of the yacht, right? Seek ye out of the book of the Lord. Which is the Bible, man. Right. Okay? You know, Jake has that book that you got in your house uh, collecting dust. That book right now is having, those words in that book are speaking and coming to life. Man. All right, that book that you have collecting in your house, dust. Yeah. Okay? Seek ye out of the book of the Lord and read. They said what, brother? And read. Oh, you keep it on your nice And read. Let it collect dust oh, yeah. and read. And read. Use it for a table stand and, and read. read. That's right. A cup yeah. stand, brother. And read. Come on, you Put it in the back of your car so the sun can burn it to death and read. That's right. 
supposed to read it, man. Right. All right. Not just have it, just to have it, man. Right. All right. Read this book, man. Right. All right. And ultimately, our word "read" means going to uh, comprehension, man. What do you say? But in them, you, you find eternal life. That's right. You know what I'm saying. That's right. It says, "No one of these shall fail." No one of these words in this Bible are gonna not come to pass. Right. Everything that's in this Bible, at the end of the day, will. If it hasn't already came to pass, will come to pass. Right. 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 You know, if right. it's not happening right now. That's right. None of, no one of these shall fail, meaning the prophecies. That's right. Whenever it's time. No one of these shall fail. None shall want her mate. That's right. You can't match this book with anything else. Yeah, brothers might use other books, you know, to, to make key points and stuff, yeah. but it's all but based off this, yep. man. Yep. You know, we don't need those other books. We got the scriptures, mm -hmm. right? But then we, of course, we have those other books just to prove, you know, to back up what the scriptures are saying, right? Yep. You know, to show you that the scriptures is proving itself, right? They, like we might bring out books on history, yep. you know what I'm saying, things of that right. nature, link it up with the scriptures and things of that nature. Images and all that, yeah. you know, country color, no, no, uh, they they know no, no, color, color. Yeah. you know, uh, 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 Timbuk, uh, Babylon, Timbuk too. Yep. you know, all these books that brothers have, they what, they all, in the, in the books they reference the scriptures, right? yep. you know? Oh yeah, about Esau, Edom, yes, who was Esau, yep. Edom, because yep. the book, uh, the Bible is the, uh, the reference point, yep. you know? It says, um, um, none of these shall fail, none shall want her mate, right. for my mouth it have commanded, and the spirit it have gathered them. It's like, what, the mouth has commanded, all right, and the spirit have gathered them. And that's what you see right now, man. All right, do the spirit of Yahweh Bashim uh, uh Isaiah uh, 13, I believe it's verse 3. You know, the Lord has uh, commanded his sanctified ones, who, who are the men of the Lord. Because the Lord said to Jeremiah, before, you know, you form the valley, I sanctified you. No? Yep. Uh, Isaiah 13 and 3. Yep. I have commanded my sanctified ones. My sanctified ones, those are what? Made holy, made separate, man. All right? Who are the men of the Lord, the prophets, man. Right. Okay? Because the Lord said to Jeremiah, I sanctified you, man. You know? And made you a prophet. Mm -hmm. You know? Same thing with uh, uh, Samuel. Was sanctified. Yep. Made a man of the Lord. Yeah, man. the Lord said, I ordained thee mm -hmm. and made thee a prophet. That's right. what I'm saying. King David, ordained king, but also King David was what? A prophet. You know, right. a man of the Lord. Yeah. You know? You see the same thing going on. He was a musician. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Right. Yeah. Many times. yeah. <laughs> you, know? you know? Hey man, the Lord, the Lord at the end of the day is the one that's a, a mighty warrior. You know what I'm saying? Mighty one. We get ready to be all that, man. Yeah, really? Ain't no telling who we was in, in, in our former life, man. Oh, right. Right. Could have been some of King David's mighty, mighty men. Man. I was just thinking who that knows, too, man? Yep. You know what I'm saying? Go, go, getting it in. You know what I'm right. saying? Right. You know, had, had our thousands upon thousands. You know what I'm saying? Right. You know, King David has tens of thousands. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. Who, who knows, man, how many bodies the Lord had us, right. you know what I'm saying, catch. You know what I mean? Right. right. Right about now, he just want us, you know what I'm saying, in, in, our, in our fishing mode. That's right. You know what I'm saying? That's right. But then the Lord said, look, yeah, you're fishing right about there, but soon come, you're going to be a hunter hunting. again. That's right. You're hunting all over again. That's right. We're going to make you a mighty hunter all over again. That's it. It says, uh, Isaiah 13 and 3, I have commanded my sanctified ones. The Lord commanded for his sanctified ones, the prophets, the men of the Lord, right. man. All right? And the Lord's going to be a part of that number. The elected nation of Israel signed off with 144,000 and is doing the commandments of Yahweh Bashim al Shai, man. You know? To come down here and teach our people, man. You know? That spirit had to come down, got an order from the heavens, birth in flesh, grow up, now he's, now he's uh, teaching. You right. know? It's all orchestrated by Yahweh Bashim al Shai. Yep, it reads on. I have also called my mighty ones my mighty one, anchor, which is the angels. All right, which are both of us are messengers, the angels, and then the brothers down here. We're just the, uh, what they call terrestrial uh, uh, messengers. Right? Like that, you know? Yeah, that's what I see. Yeah, yeah. yeah. man. You know? So what? The Lord is now, he, said, he, he commanded us, and then he got to what? Command for the angels to do what they do, man. You know? The Lord is commanding all things at all uh, at all time high, man. Yeah. You know, especially now, he had to turn up. He got the mighty ones to do what, bro? It says, even them that rejoice in my highness. Well, yeah, rejoice in the highness of the Aho Bashim al Shai, right? The mighty angels are actually the ones that are performing some of the things that we see on the earth. Working on the minds of these leaders, national leaders, uh, international leaders, okay? So you, you think of the order of uh, uh, Russia to Ukraine, guess what? The Lord had an angel working on the mind of Vladimir Putin. Right. You know? 
for uh, 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 Joe Biden to be like, oh, we're going to go to the uh, UN and just sanction him. That was an agent working on his mind, man. So, hey, we got the the, the, the sanctified ones, the prophets doing the commandment of the Lord coming out here too. We got the angels doing the commandment of the Lord of what? Making things happen in the earth, man. Right, you know? This is uh, Proverbs 21 and 1. Proverbs chapter 21, verse 1. The king's heart is in the hand of the Lord. It says, what? The king's heart is in the hand of the Lord. And he will rule heart is loud, which is the mind, man. So whatever a man thinks is all of you, how about Shema Oshai, man? The Lord put that in that man's mind, okay? He was like, all right, man, forget it. We going to Ukraine. The Lord had that angel working on that man's mind. Like, yeah, make that decision, man. No, yeah, it's about that time. You know? In fact, it was the scripture that uh, uh, Michael the Archangel and our Lord were working on the, uh, the mind of uh, Nebuchadnezzar, man. You know? Yep. Lord had, had working in men's minds, man. We never talk about this shit. I'm going to say the majority of these women walk around look like trannies, don't they, though? I know, right? Yeah. Like, 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 like who the hell is going to want them, man? man that's why I look away, man. Who the hell are going to win? And they walk around, ain't nothing up there. Like we said earlier, an acorn yep. with nothing in it. You know what I'm saying? Yep. An acorn without the nut. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nothing there, man. Just gone, man. Ain't nothing up there, man. You know what I'm saying? Just like, like, like bro said, that ain't no helium. You know what I'm saying? Oh, we helium. Yeah, helium. The only thing that's up there is helium, man. Air, man. Ain't nothing up there. Just... Right, right. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They got no purpose or nothing on, on, on life, you know what I'm saying? Uh, 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 crashing fucking cars, cars all dead yeah, up, know, beat right? up, you know what I'm saying? But just, just driving to Texas. <laughs> just driving to Texas like, like this. Look right, at the phone. Right. Just like right. this. Yeah. Damn, yep. you, you won't be looking that way. Yep. <laughs> trying to put on makeup. Yep. I see people trying to put on makeup with uh -huh. that, that's crazy. That's AKA fake up, uh -huh. you know what I'm saying? Let me get it back to this though, man. I just had to throw. No, we're gonna say it all right. You want to say something right quick? Oh, I, I, yeah, yeah, we're gonna say it. Yeah. Proverbs twenty-one. Maybe after I read the scripture to come back. <laughs> Proverbs twenty-one and one. The king's heart is in the hand of the Lord. Yahweh by Shimei was shy. Hey, if I could just say too, Apostle Har was going to a lesson. Um, I think it was yesterday or today that um, Putin been wanting to, you know, take over Ukraine for twenty years. Yeah. Yes. He had a twenty-year plan. I think it was Ukraine, and then eventually he wants to make a move on the U.S. Yeah. But the yeah. Lord has been. Having him make those necessary steps. Ukraine, to, Poland, all that, man, used to be a part of the yeah. Soviet Union. Uh -huh. They want that back now, man. Yeah. The Lord said, you're putting the jaws, you know what I'm saying, the hook back into the jaws. You know what I'm saying? Turn, right turn, turn these people back to how they used to be. Right. We're in a time of war. Right. You know what I'm saying? We're in a time of hate. We're in a time of love. Right. I can't believe this is happening. Right. America bombed the hell out of Libya. Mm -hmm. uh, 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 killed millions of people. Look, guess what? Oops, my fault. Right. My fault. I thought it was weapon. I got the wrong intel. They told me it was weapons of mass destruction over there. Stop lying, devil. You know what I'm right. saying? But then, as soon as another devil do what you yep. just did, yep. that's a problem. Because both of them devils, yeah, right. deceivers, yep. Edomites. Right, you know what I'm saying? But then, as soon as an Edomite do something that you ain't order, you know what I'm saying? It's right. a problem. Then you know who the chief of the nations are. Sleazy right. Eve. Yep. That's right. He, he, he just he deceived his spirit. Like I said, the, the, the Lord's angels is working on the minds yep. of these men. We don't. Proverbs 21, it's all good, bro. Proverbs 21 and 1. The king's heart is in the hand of the Lord. The king's heart, the king's mind, these leaders' minds are in the hands of the Lord. The yep. Lord's, they're pawns, right. man. Yep. They don't even realize it, but they're pawns of the Lord, man, right. to make things happen in the earth, man. The angels is over there working the mind. Uh -huh. I didn't even know that. It was a 20 year plan. Yep. So they put out, you know, in the spirit, I said it earlier, that this, you know, he's put, uh, putting the spirit back on these leaders to do certain yep. things. And you can see it in this man's face. Yep. That Vladimir Putin, man, he's a spirit created for vengeance, yeah. right? Yep. You know? Because yeah. um, I'm going to keep saying spirit. Uh, is that America's had his uh, uh, boot on uh, Russia's yep. neck, man, for the longest, yep. right? Yeah, the longest. You know, putting them, having their country look before. That's all because yeah. of America, man. Right. Yeah, this devil did everybody like that. Don't say he did, um... Um, uh, Haiti. Haiti, yeah, 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 yeah. Haiti yeah. like that. Yeah. Haiti, Haiti, the poorest, poorest country, you know what I'm saying, on the earth. You yep. know what I'm saying? All because, you know what I'm saying, this devil, you know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. Putting sanctions on them, making sure they can't trade. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? And you know, um, Haiti's one of, the, one of the richest countries yep. out there, too. Yep. They got all kind of um, natural resources, yep. man. Yep. But this devil, like, yo, you ain't going to be able to trade yep. none of them. You, you, you defeated me yep. years yep. ago. You know what I'm saying? But oh, but, oh yeah, I thought you were supposed to uh, forgive and forget. You know what I'm saying? Because that's what, that's what this devil tells us. That's what we bring up slavery. 
Oh, that was a long time ago. Y'all get over it. Let, let bygones be bygones. Why didn't you tell um, the Haitians that? Right. Like, this devil got a lot to pay for, man. Yeah. These devils gonna pay, man. A thousand long, drawn out years, yeah, I'm saying, yeah. of slavery, man. Yep. Yeah, you never know. This man, this man might be falling all yep. over again, man. Yep. Go his, he had that stern, yeah, stern look. That stern spirit, yep. man. You know, you know he, yeah, 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 that's right. You know that's right. Spirit, man, look, he, look, even look, look, he's a man of war. That's right. He give you the warning, you don't get the hell out of there. The man, we ain't going back and forth talking, right, doing all this right, talking. Right. I just said what I had to say. Next right. thing you know, so I cut the camera off, them things gonna fly. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> so I cut the camera off, them right. things gonna fly. That's right. the point, yeah, That's right. That's right. I gave you warning. Yep. I've, been, I've been talking. And look, and plus, you know how it is, man. <laughs> right. uh, a fight starts off, you know what I'm saying, with all the talks. Yep. Talks right. first. Right. So, so Putin, uh, America had like Putin, he just uh, all of a sudden turned the cameras off. Right. Boom, right. boom, 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 boom. <laughs> no, man. This man been talking for months, maybe years, man. Right. I want right. my land back. Right. Uh, that's my land, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, right. We're we, we going to talk about it. We're going to see what we can yeah, do. Yeah. Well, the, the talking time's over, man. <laughs> yep. You know what I'm saying? Yep. That's, that's how you know. Camera goes off. Boom, 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 boom. Look, look, look. With the brain splattered everywhere. Hell yeah. One video had this dude, you know, his brain over there. His brain over there, but his head over there. You know what I'm saying? Wide open. Head. Wide, Wide open. Head. Wide the damn wind started blowing, the damn skin was like, yep. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. So there's another video with the car going down the street regular, all of a sudden, a tank, tank, tank is coming out, an old, old ass Edomite. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Should have stayed his ass home. Look, you ain't even missed a war. Where you going to the grocery store? Right, right. We, we, we ain't going to get on some dog food. You got missiles flying everywhere. What the hell had your old ass doing out the house? You right. know what I'm saying? Trying to avoid a tank. You ain't a little ass beetle. You ain't a little ass beetle trying to avoid a tank. Hey, right there, and that tank went right over there and crushed his ass. That's how you know a couple of hours later they had to cut his ass out of it, yo. He stick his old ass head over there. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man, that's what's happening though. But hey, this is all orchestrated by the Lord. Right. You know, we're seeing these things happen. And I'm, I'm telling you, hey, man, you're going to see a lot more spirit spirited preventers out of these national, yeah. international countries, man. Yeah. Let's go. You had uh, King Jong un who made, a, who made a promise that he's gonna finish what his father started. Yeah, man. Uh, his father said that he's gonna destroy uh, America. Yeah. And when he when he passed, he's like, look, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do what my father said, man. Yeah, um, them other countries, you know what I'm saying, they call um, Sleaze the E, you know what I'm saying, Satan. Yeah. They yeah. call him Satan, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's right, that's right. The word me, Satan means adversary. Yeah, that's right. You know what I'm saying? But they call, him, they call this devil Satan, Satan. you know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> Wrote a song about him and everything, man. That's right. how they're going to destroy this place, man. I remember he said that. Yeah. yeah. I'm going to read the last part. And it says, um, he turneth it whithersoever he will. That's right. The Lord turned it wherever he, he wants, man. So he wants this man to, 20 years ago, I don't go on just yet. Right. So, you know, creep up there. Right. I know the Lord's like, creep up there because I got men on the other right. side that's going to prophesy about right. you. You know? Creep up there, then that time comes, when it's time to turn up, and it's time to go in. Yeah. You know? I said he, he was coming back in that the new S the uh, the new SSR is being built up. Yeah, the bear like spirit. Yep. That's right. Yep. You know you don't fuck with a bear now. You know what I'm saying? America been poking that bear for a while. That's you know what right. I'm saying? That's right. These people about to feel it though, man, because anytime, like we said earlier through the spirit, anytime the gas go up, everything go up. Oh, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So the last thing, Jake, a, a smart Israelite man, the last thing he's gonna be thinking about is going out and spending all his money on some hoes and some thoughts. Nah, yeah. man. Save that money, you know what I'm saying, for a rainy day, maybe some grocery. Maybe your rent might go up, uh -huh. maybe your lights might go up. You save your money for those troubling yep. times. That's yep. right. The Lord, the Lord will send you a bone now. Yep. Them bones gonna be coming through like I don't know what now, yep. man. Because yep. cause the majority of these women, they got expensive ass apartments, yep. expensive ass houses. Yep. Or either the government's taking care of them, and the government, you know what I'm saying, is gonna crash, you know what I'm saying? Yep. So look, they gotta get out of them houses, man. Yep. Okay. The dude's gonna, the dude's gonna start uh, squatters writing in them prayers, man. Yep. Straight up, yo. Just keep, just like, um, just like that, that fuck sneaking in the house. Right. They gonna, they, they, gonna really yeah, yeah. they gonna kick a dope. They gonna kick a dope, man. Right? They gonna kick a dope, man. They gonna tear it down, crib up. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? That's right. Then dog. Right. So don't worry about it. Just, just, just keep believing in the words of your how about you know what I'm saying? Everything right. gonna work itself out. That's right. 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 Blue, right? You know what I'm saying? You got it, though, bro. <laughs> I got one more bro, before you read that. This is Daniel. This. Uh, oh, it's working, man. Yeah, the Lord working, man. And you, know, and you got a whole lot of spirits and crazy mm -hmm. vengeance out here too, y'all. That, that damn should sure look like one. I know, right? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, he wanted to yeah, walk past. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. You know what I'm saying? He looked like that damn dude off the, um, what's that damn, uh, that damn TV show? Highlander. <laughs> no, not Highlander, but the other one that Chinese dude used to be walking around all the time with his little hat on. I know, you know what I'm saying? I know what you're talking about. Kung Fu, yeah. <laughs> that dude looked like Kung Fu. You saw how bright his face was, face -wise, though? Yeah. Bright, kind of like yellow. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That dude was yellow, like. You know what I'm saying? 
Yeah, he looked like he, he looked like he just came out the Holly Hill or something though. You know what I'm saying? He was walking around like this, like. You know what I'm saying? Look, walking slow as hell, peeping out the scene. You know what I'm saying? That, that's a person. Look, uh, look. You got, you got everybody scared of the dude to be. Come on, motherfucker! Come on, motherfucker! Right, right, come on, right, right. motherfucker! Let's do something! Come on, come on! No, look, look, look! Don't stand in front of me! Don't stand! Don't right, hold me right, back! Right, don't right. hold me back! Nah, you better be scared of the dude that ain't saying shit. Yep. Mm -hmm. The quiet dude. You know what I'm saying? You better watch out for the quiet guy. You know what I'm saying? For that quiet guy, you know what I'm saying? Sarah. <laughs> Sarah. Had <laughs> your ass in the basement somewhere tied the hell up. You know what I'm saying? You wake up, you have foot already going on, yeah, baby. Yeah. Here, here you go. So, so, you think it's for these? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And then, then he dropped him up in the damn pot like, this is dinner. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> look, and you're invited. You know what I'm saying? And he, your, your ass ain't ate like two weeks. This mother feed you your feet. You know what I'm saying? This dude feeds you your feet, yo. These are the times that we living in, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's up? Damn. You bring out this right quick, though, man. Yeah. Daniel chapter 4, verse 17. This matter is by the decree of the watchers. That's right. That the demand and the demand of the and the demand by the word of the holy ones. That's right. What? How about Shimei man? You know? He, he sends out a decree, man. It's going to be done uh, in the earth, man. That's right. right. Huh? That's right. And it reads, um, to the intent that the living may know. That the living, that people on the earth gonna know at the end of the day, that what was it? That the living may know that the most high, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, ruleth in the kingdom of men. Right. Ruleth in the kingdom of men. In the kingdom of men. Right. So when you think you big and bad, you making a shot, it's the Lord making you make those shots. <laughs> right. right. You know? So hey, you know, Vladimir, Vladimir Putin, all these Shooting other countries. Poop. Yeah, shooting shooting poop. Poop. I call him shooting yeah, boots. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, he ready to shoot the missile. He man. turned the camera off. He ain't playing no more. That's right. You know what I'm saying? You know. That's just like three hours later. Uh -huh. A man of free words. That's right. And then he, then he told um he told the um, different leaders of Ukraine, y'all some bitches. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. Y'all know this devil ain't right, you know what I'm right, saying? Right. We, we should be, you know what I'm saying, alliancing yep, together, you know what I'm saying? Look, right. you know this man gonna undermine you. Yep. Right. Excuse me, say, though, and though he pretended to help thee, yep. he gonna undermine you. Yep. Can't never trust Lee yep. to eat, man. Yep. He's gonna right. always undermine you, mm -hmm. right? right. And, and the Edomite don't trust another Edomite. Right. Uh, Edomite yep. knows the spirit of another Edomite. But, right. but if you had to plaster uh, the image of a mighty warrior of the Edomites, Putin would be right yeah. there, yeah, yeah, yeah. The front yeah. and center. This is the man, man. So yeah, I like I like him a little bit. I know, bit. I like him. You know, like, look at him. He, he's not yeah. with the, the BS. Yeah, with the BS. Uh, you know, that, that, he's not with that American. Yeah. Black. Yeah. I don't like that, man. Yeah. I'm looking at him like, see, the Lord got a Plus, Putin, Putin's a, a, a manly man. Yeah, yeah, right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. He ain't playing at all. Yeah, right, right, right. What Fred Seven say? <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Fred Seven say, Putin ain't playing at all. Yeah. 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 You know what I'm saying? Yeah. 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 That's right. That's a Fred Seven yeah. say. Fred, yeah. 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 Fred Seven don't even say that. He's, yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Putin don't play that old. Poop, yep. Shit, Putin over there practicing karate and everything. Yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Wrestling. This man all in the water. You know what I'm yep. saying? He yeah. in the water. Yep. Fish. In the water fish. Over yep. there wrestling bears and deers, lions, yep. tigers. Yep. You know what I mean? Yep. Swimming his ass yep. off. And what, what, what Biden doing? Right. right. <laughs> <laughs> hi, hi. hi. I'm, I'm, I'm Joe Biden's wife. <laughs> really? Really? Hi, I'm Joe Biden. Look. Right. <laughs> Trying to get up to the podium, right? Then he get up to the podium. He walk into a room stiff as hell. That man stiff as hell, yo. Like a, he's stiffer than a um an ironing board. <laughs> you know, an ironing can't get no stiffer than that. Right. That dude is stiffer than an ironing board, right? He walk up in this. He walk up in the damn scene like this, and I can't do it. And I can't do it, but I'll try. Put for the legs straight as hell. Knees ain't bent. <laughs> hey, you know, Jake, Jake walk up in the scene like this, yeah, like yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. This dude walk in the scene like this. <laughs> <laughs> Knees ain't been on nothing. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Knees ain't been on nothing. Uh, <laughs> so, so, um, hi, 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 my American uh, family. Uh, I'm Joe Biden's wife. He's <laughs> a <laughs> fucking idiot, man. A real deal, though, here, man. Yeah. And he, his, head, his head bald as hell, but it takes a little bit of head that he got, you know what I'm saying? And put it yeah. sideways, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Come on, man. Yeah. This man, all that damn makeup, that man really look dead though, man. Oh, I'm gonna read on though. Just throw a little joke in there every now and then, man. <laughs> Keep it live, you know? Yeah, it says, um, it says, that the living may know that the most high rule up in the kingdom of men uh -huh. and give it in to whosoever he, he will. will. That's right. So the Lord is the one controlling all these things, man. Yep. So we're seeing right now live and direct, you know, because we got, you know, they've shown the fees on, on News 24-7, yeah. man. 
because uh, they making moves over there in those countries, man. Yep. And it's all prophesied by you know by the men of the Lord through these scriptures. So these are the words of the Abba Shemesh that's coming to life, man. Yep. You know, brothers been talking about this for years, man. You know, starting off our apostle Elsa Greek Moonstone, we've yep. been talking about this. But now it's actually happening, and it's all just right. spreading. Yep. Right. And it ain't right. gonna stop. That's right. It ain't gonna stop, man. Right. And, and look, and everything that's going on over there across seas is coming over here, man. That's right. You see, you see right. people over there getting out of Dodge with their yep. dogs. Right. They're hauling ass. They're getting yeah, out of yeah. the city, man. Right. You see? And, they, look, and the thing about it, they got apartments and houses and all that full of shit, but they ain't able to grab nothing. Yep. Grab your jacket, grab your pocketbook, grab your wallet, your dog, and let's get the hell out of here. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. These houses are being bombed over uh -huh. there. It's coming over here, man. That's why the scripture say, woe to them that are eating Zion, yeah, man. Right, this right. place has a date with death, man. That's, that's right. right. That's right. That's right. Okay, I could have really Ezekiel 7 and 26. Uh -huh. It, it set up up over it the basis of men. It set it, he set up over the basis of men. So right now, Esau's ruling, man. All right? That's going to show you the power of Yahweh. You know, he, he put the most lowest, stupidest yeah. man oh, on Barbie. the top. Oh, Barbie. Lower than all, every, every creature on earth yeah. is, is above this man. Lower than some dog shit. Yep. That's right. Yep. You know, but, you know what I'm saying? Lower than a rat. Lower than some dog shit. Everything on the earth hates this man, uh, yeah. but now he's on top. Yep. That shows you the power of the Lord, man. Yep. Mm -hmm. So it's all of the how about you that all this is happening, and brothers is excited. Because we know, you know, things not going to exactly pop off here because scriptures say what? Boy, how should I say? You know, rumors of word, all these things have oh, yeah, to happen. Right. The, the end is not yet, you know? We know the end is not yet, but these things have to come to pass. Yeah. Yeah, I, got Damn, I, forgot. I was getting ready to say something. I forgot what I was going to say. Man. Damn, I forgot what I was going to say, man. Oh yeah, yeah. The Lord, the Lord took a knuckle dragger out of the caves. I'm saying, and gave him the rulership over the earth, man. You see? That is your know how power. Thank you, Jesus. All eight, eight, all killing. It looked like um, Hey, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? In a deal, in a deal, do here type of way. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, you know what I'm saying? The Lord, you know what I'm saying, took this um, cave, man, you know what I'm saying, out of the Caucasus Mountains, man. These knuckle dragons, man, and gave him the rulership over the whole earth, man. They had to create all this stuff, you know what I'm saying, to destroy the earth. Because everything this devil creates destroys the earth, man. Right. Them, fluor them fluorescent light bulbs, they destroy your eyesight too, yeah, man. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna make the room brighter for you and fuck my vision up right, at the same time. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna make right. this car better for you and, and, and intoxicate the whole earth, you know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. Devil, man. Yeah. I'm gonna make food better and destroy your inside. Right. Yeah. Everything this devil do, I'm gonna create um, five such and such. Yep. You know you start talking yeah. too much. Yeah. You put your video down. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Five helpers. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? And your computer going to run fast, faster and better. Everything this devil breaks harms the earth, man. Yeah. All his technology is harming the earth, man. And, and we in the earth. Right. Or it's giving you cancer like bro said. Yeah. You got it, bro. Psalm 75 and 7. <clears throat> but the Most High is the judge. Mm. He put it down one and set it up another. Hey. What, bro? He put it down one and set it up another. In the dark ages, we were actually ruling, man. Yep. You know? The Lord had his rule take over the uh, Roman Empire. Uh -huh. You know, because we went from the pagan Roman Empire. Yep. It was in the spirit because yep. the Esau's rule. And it became the oh, holy Roman Empire. Yeah. You know, when we was ruling, you know, all the way into the dark ages, the Lord, you know, had us up. Then what? Lord had us go down and put yep. Esau back up. Yep. You know? So it's all just because the Lord's the one that paid up and, and bring it down. Man. You know? uh -huh. He's the one to make it rich and make it poor. Yep. Yep. Lord's bring those things about all the time, man. But we're, not, we're seeing it come out in real life, man. The Lord is controlling the story of ours, man. You know? Yeah. We hope and pray that we need the winners of the story. You know? Ezekiel 26. Oh, uh, yeah, 26. Yeah. Ezekiel 7 and 26. Mm -hmm. Mischief shall come upon. Mischief. You know, our people don't even realize that there were in some evil, mischievous times. You know, mischief means evil. Yeah, mischief means evil and, and, and yeah. wickedness at an all-time yeah. high. You know, that's what mischief is. A uh, mischievous person is someone who's just a gremlin. Yep. You know, that's the type of energy that's out here, man. You know, yep. it says. Uh, <clears throat> and rumor shall be upon rumor. Rumor shall be upon rumor. 
things. Oh, I heard this is going on. I heard that's going on. This is how we're living in, man. The whole uh, incidents of uh, Ukraine and Russia was a rumor at one point. Yeah. You know? And now it's actually happening, man. Some rumors happen, some rumors don't. Yeah. You know? You heard that. Uh, uh, the rumor ain't nothing but talks of war. That's right. That's right. Talk. Like you said, everything starts off with talk. You know, but th certain things actually play out. Putin's been saying for years that he's going to do what he got to do. And now the Lord's having this man actually, you know, make that rumor actually action come to, you know, come to pass. It says, then shall they seek a vision of the prophet. Then, when all these things happen, the president not just talking about this, but that war going, that war being started up, you know, World War Three, the third world being started up, things over here in America are going to ramp up, you know? Look at the pattern of what happened uh, during World War One, World War Two. The World War One, the Great Depression was happening. World War Two, you know, you know, industrial things started happening, but we, we didn't. Well, we weren't in the war right away. Yep. You know, some things had to happen overseas first. Yep. Then we got in. Okay. So it's the same thing now. Uh, history repeats itself, man. Seeing that happen all over again. What foreign things are going on across uh, across the seas? And guess what? Uh, it's going to assume that what well, America's going to have to jump in, man. Yep. You know. The Lord is having things happen like that, man. It's all through the spirit of fire. How old about you with God, man? And his men are out here teaching you and showing you these things so you can get right with them, man. You know, because it's all for the elect to see and get right with the Lord, man. You know? Good. It says, then shall they seek a vision of the prophet. But then our people are going to seek a vision of the prophet. Gas prices are too high for right. you to pay. You know, going to grocery store, a bag of bread is $50. Yeah. You know? You know, if you can, if you can find that, man. Yeah. You know? You know? You know, if, well, if, you know what I'm saying, because right about now, you know what I'm saying, that wheat, you know what I'm saying, shit. Right. I know China just got, um, Russia has some wheat, you know what I'm saying, one of them um, big store and shit. Mm -hmm. yeah. But the wheat was like getting mowed on it, so nobody won't take it. Mm -hmm. But now, ever since this so called crisis or whatever, yeah. crisis or whatever, it is taking it. China, anything. like, yo, we'll take that shit. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. We'll take that, we'll take that molded bread. All mm -hmm. right. Molded bread is better than having no, no right. bread at all. That's yeah, right. You know what I'm saying? Because I think um, Ukraine, you know what I'm saying, is one of the. Um, Richest uh, countries when it deals with wheat. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. You know, um, Russia and Ukraine had some deals. Yep. You know what I'm saying? So from the song, ain't nothing but this devil, you know what I'm saying, trying to um, break them different treaties, yep. them different deals, you know what I'm saying? Because America won't want everybody to mess with them. Yep. And yep. anybody that don't mess with America, America uh -huh. like, no, don't mess with them. Right. They're, 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 yep. they're not my friend, so, right. so I don't want you to be their friend either. Right. But we're making moves over here. You know what I'm saying? We're making money over here. Right. I ain't gonna stop messing with them just because you don't want me to do the right. part of us. You're right. part of us. The hell with all of that. That's right. Yep. Because you made a good point. That Nord Stream 2 pipeline yeah. that Germany is doing with, with Russia. It, it started with Russia and Russia yeah. Germany. And, and, and Germany is looking forward to that. Now America's going to do it. They're going to pipeline. A pipeline. Too. Yeah, because Germany is going to be using that gas now for their citizens. Yeah. They need that. Yep. And, and, you know, Germany's part of NATO, but Germany's like, man, why the hell y'all getting involved right. in this? Right, right. And then they put the sanctions on it, and you know, because America really don't want to get busy with it. Which ain't really, ain't, which, it ain't, which ain't, it ain't hurting Russia. It ain't hurting Russia. Them sanctions that America put on Russia to help Russia. Yeah. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Well, because Russia got China to back them up, right? Yes. Russia stock went up when America put sanctions on it. That's right. Because Russia, you know what I'm saying, got the, uh, the majority of the leading oil that everybody getting. You know what I'm saying? That's right. They got like one of the biggest oil refineries that everybody pretty much over there across seas get their oil from. Mm -hmm. you ain't hurting, you ain't hurting yeah. Russia. Yeah. Devil, yeah. that's some freaking nerve, though, man. Yeah. Yeah. This is all prophecy. Yeah. Man. These, these things have to happen. Yeah. And that's why I said, look, and before you see that, uh, Matthew, uh, uh, Matthew 10 or Matthew 24? 24. 24? All right, Matthew 6. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. All these things must come to pass, but the end is not yet. These things have to happen. Say Matthew. And we'll get to 24. Say Matthew chapter 24, verse 6. And you shall hear wars and rumors of wars. We're hearing. Wars, rumors of wars, everything's being brewed up and starting up, man. The Lord's having it happen, man. Now, our Lord Yahushai uh, told us this uh, 2,000 years ago, man. You know? You know, wars, rumors of wars, what else? And, and they down there with all that madness. <laughs> Only thing they down there is pushing the law, 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 uh, law, yep, law. Yep. It, the Jeremiah 28, you forgot about that? Right. You forgot about the prophe prophesying of yep. evils, yep. war? Pestilence, diseases, yep. these dudes like the law, 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 law. That's the only thing they down there screaming and hollering, right. man. I'm glad the light was, was green when we passed by them, man. Because you don't want to sit there, man. This should give you a headache, man. Listen to these fucking Israelite groups, man. When you listen to Gok, they say it gives you a headache. Yeah, yeah, when you right. listen to um, IUIC, it gives you a freaking headache. When you listen to um, ISUPK, yep. well, we said them. Yeah. 
Uh, well, yeah, yeah you, this is the eyes you can't get you a freaky headache, man. Right. The men in black, Dark Vader, man. No one wants to listen to yeah. Dark Vader, man. Yeah. Get up, man. Shit. Yeah. Luke Skywalker. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? Son of all dark, you know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. You already looking dark with all that black on. My son. What's all computer sound like? My son. You know what I'm saying? Join the dark side. Right. You'll get jobs. Right, right. You'll get women. women. Yes. You, you, smoke you can smoke your weed. Join the dark side, the dark forces. And you, and you can call on Christ. Right, right. Christ. Right. It's an order. Christ. You know what I'm saying, bro? Son of the money, you know what I'm saying? Right. Now, over here, we're calling you Howard Shot. We're calling you Howard Shot. That's right. That's right. Who the hell is Christ, man? That's right. You see them dudes say Christ more than they say Yahweh shot. Yep. See? Yep. And then they say, You <laughs> know what I'm saying, bro? Yeah, yeah. Get more deal, though, yeah. <laughs> but go ahead, though, brother. Oh, you, you was oh yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> St. Matthew 24 and 6, and ye shall hear wars and rumors of wars. See that ye be not troubled. You're not troubled. People are freaking out. Yeah, ain't it all? Yeah, you, got, <laughs> you got the women, man. Phone oh, yeah. ringing like all the way, right? Yeah. You got the, uh, you, me too. Like, yeah. um, for, um, you got a text while we was going live, while right? We, going live, we, we was going live. We was going live the other night. The brother got a text from somebody that he know in the world. Uh -huh. So can, can you tell me what's going on? <laughs> <laughs> then you want to know. Then you want answers. Right. These people going to want answers, brothers. They are. Oh, look, 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 yeah. look. They got questions. We got the answers. Right. But a whole lot of people ain't going to get the answers. They, they, look, look. Back then, you didn't want them. Nope. Now I got nah. the message. Now y'all no, want them. Come on, man. Yeah. Nah, y'all ain't, ain't rolling like that. Right. You know what I'm saying? Okay. What you got now? What you got to trade right. now? Right. So the internet going to be off? That's mm -hmm. right. It's going to be a bartering system. That's yeah. right. And you know, in the spirit that I had a uh, woman I know, she uh, she texted me about it too. She was like, I knew it was going to happen, but I knew it was going to happen this quick. See? Yeah, because they was living their best yeah. life. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? These people living, mainly women, they're living their best life. Uh -huh. That shit popping off, they like, damn, yo, seem like my, my world's getting ready to end. Yep. You didn't shit, you ain't, you ain't had enough, you ain't had no enough fun yet. They've no, been right. around the world. I, I know, I know um, a couple of women, yo, they have been all around the world, yo. Yep. They have been in Germany, yep. they have been in everything. Well, I'm like, damn, y'all had it going on on this right. side. Shit. Right. Brothers yeah. probably been to D.C., you know what I'm saying? Probably been to Florida and that's it. You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. well, they'd have been in fucking Germany. Right. They'd have been to Australia. Yep. Uh -huh. They'd have been in France. They got that. You know what I'm saying? For real, for real, for real. Wee wee. Yep. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> they'd have been every damn well. So, of course, they don't want this place to end. Right? Because once this place ends, they got to sit there freaking down. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Yep. You know, no more gadding abroad. Right. You know what I'm saying? No more showing your camel toe. Right. You know what I'm saying? So, they're thanking them. Yep. So, I got, so, they got to get in there. They, they, that's why they're making all them TikTok videos. Yep. That's why they're making all these different Facebook um, right. things right about now. Because they know it's coming, circling the yep. drain. Yep, hey. what they're saying now, the man really is the prize. Yeah. They're trying to build up their case because they yeah. know some, some women know something about to pop off. Some of them faking it though, you yep. know what I'm saying? Yeah, some of them faking But they say women are um the private wisdom. Nah, that too, you know what I'm saying? But women, you know what I'm saying, they um opportunistic. Opportunistic, yeah. You yeah. 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 know what I'm saying? That's it, bro. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. And when Max. opportunity knocks, you know what I'm saying, they yeah. answer, you know what I'm saying? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> You know, it's weird because all the women like, you know what, the kitchen don't look right there, though, ain't it all? No. You know what I'm saying? That's, that's what America produces, right? Yep. That's what America produces, though, right? Yeah, come on, man. So, somebody gonna somebody gonna get that something to eat with all hell, break loose hell? No, man. Oh, they good, man. I ain't, I ain't leaving nothing to the imagination. Ruth. You know, it's, it's, it's scary because now the Lord's having these women be like, the kitchen ain't that bad. Right. <laughs> you know, hey, staying at home, it, it, it don't sound that bad. Nah, you want to use a pot, you better be on the front line right there. Uh -huh. And when Russia goes, conquers Ukraine and does whatever they do, you can be front line there, shaking in your boots like, no damn, I should I shouldn't have asked for this equality. Right. The Lord right. gonna give you what you ask for. You want to be equal, the Lord gonna give you equality then. Right. You see? <laughs> right. And up with that. They gonna get the, uh, these women are gonna get the wrong attention soon, come. Yep. You know what I'm saying? They're gonna get the wrong attention, man. You can see it though. Already feeble and scared. You know what I'm saying? Already feeble, nervous. You nervous? Why you walking around like that if you're nervous right. then? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, she's showing her ass. Her ass. Her whole ass is out. Yeah. Damn. Show. 
I guess the Lord gave us a show, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> she, she, she went to the wrong door, so we can see it again. Like, let's show up. Pull it down now. Y'all see that though, man. Exactly. Yeah, no. Yeah, um, what's the what's the what's the bother here? The hen. That hen sure enough had some feathers, didn't it? That hen right there was holding them, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mother Clay, Mother Clay, huh? Remember when we was out here, you know, saying a couple of weeks back, you know, saying the wind blew. <laughs> yeah. Uh, you saw that. Uh, the only thing I, I don't think I can say is the wind blew. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but let's, let's go back, though. St. Matthew 24. The world gave us a little excitement, but let's get back to work now. St. Matthew 24 and 6. And you should hear wars and rumors of wars. Mm -hmm. See that you be not troubled. Mm -hmm. That's right. See that you be troubled. Being scared, you know. Birds and calm. Hey, brother, what up? What up, do? Right. <laughs> no, man, we're like... That time, right? You know? Everybody else is panicking, but it's like, yep. prophecy's coming to pass. Right. You know? we, we happy because we know the kingdom of heaven is that much more closer. You get your phone, give it to start ringing for real, for real, man. Yeah. You know your phone right about now, probably dry. Brother's phone probably dry right about now. Yeah. Your phone, get ready to ring so much, you gonna get, you probably gonna throw that phone up against the wall, <laughs> or you, or you gonna get ready to throw it again, but you like, nah, I gotta keep, I gotta keep in contact, I gotta stay in contact with the brothers. Mm -hmm. But right. if it weren't for that, you just throw the phone up against the wall, like, damn, you phone. That thing gonna be ringing around. You gotta cut your phone off at night, man. Yeah, that thing yeah. gonna be. By the time you wake up, you gotta probably have about a hundred messages, man. Yeah, right. You know what I'm saying? Right. Probably a hundred from the same person, man. I'm trying to get in contact right. with you. Right. I'm scared. I'm scared. <laughs> I don't wanna be independent no more. Too late now. The brothers have moved on. Yeah, right. It says, um, for all these things must come to pass, mm -hmm. but the end is not yet. But the end is not yet. I mean, what? My Shakespeare voice. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> The end is not yet, you know? So what, all these things happening, but the end of the world is not yet, man. Right. Things that are still gonna happen, man. Yep. And with that war uh, starting, to pop, starting to pop off and brew up, things in America is about to ramp up. We're about to yep. see martial law, yep. you know, uh, insurrections. We're about to see more lives. stealing. We're about to see people more stealing. Uh, but shit, you know it got so bad, you know what I'm saying? They took the damn beef, you know what I'm saying? Wrapped it up in chicken yep. wire. Yep. You know what I'm yep. saying? With a metal detector on right. it, right? Yeah. Yeah. The, the damn beef got a metal, yeah. so people going to the store just, I know, right? Well, now they got to take it and use fire. Just yeah. can get to it. Yeah. got to take it home and Shit, man. All these, all these boosters out here, man. You yeah, have people going to the store boosting meat now. Yeah, yeah. That's what they've been doing. Yeah, they've been, they been, they been, been boosting they been meat. You know what I'm saying? But now they're they doing it. They, look, take the damn meat, take it to the bathroom yeah. right quick. Take the meat to the bathroom right quick. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Shit. And knock that thing out, that uh, sensor. Yeah. We're going out. Yeah. Shit, you got women to this day that walk up to you and say, what you want? Yeah. Just, just write me a list of anything you want. You know what I'm saying? I mean, when I was in the world, I knew a couple of ladies, you know what I'm saying? They come up to you, uh, what you want? I'm about to go to such and such store. What you want? Write a list down. What color you want? You know what I'm saying? Everything. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And they're going there and get it, man. Yep. So these people, the boosting ain't stopped. Yep. People ain't stopped boosting. All right. They'll be, they'll be even uh, all time high enough. Right. With war, with war comes crime. Yeah, yeah. More looting, more stealing, all that. More heads being busted. It's, it's war anyway. That's right. War that popped off anyway. I can bust me a head or two now. Right. And not to worry about it. Yeah, the police are running. Yeah. Police are either running or it might be some police over there on fire, burning like hell. Yeah. They ain't thinking about doing that pack of meat. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? That's right. Like a, like a, like a, like a police just getting shot and go worry about you and some right. chicken pranks. You know what I'm saying? A pack of chicken. Nah, right. man, man, trying right. to get the hell out of Dodge. That's right. It says, um, but the end is not yet. And the end is not yet. All these things have to happen. The end of the world is not yet. The end of the society is not yet until the Lord brings everything that he's written to right. pass. Right. Everything that's written for, the, for Babylon to go through has to come to pass right. first. You know, we're about to see a lot of crazy things. He had to turn up, man. Right. You know, y'all watching my shots about to turn things up. That's right. You know, brothers, hey, man, that's what brothers were saying, man. You better turn back to y'all about Shemel That's right. And, and, and fear you how about Shemel Shai, man, because the Lord to shake this place up. That's man. right. You know? And the Lord gonna have them troops come over here too, man. That's right. Oh, yeah. That's, 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 man, them, them troops gonna come over here, they gonna uh, ravage men and women. That's right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know, they gonna have no regard of life to of life. That's, you right. that's right. Cause look, you, you're already coming from a country where, where it's nothing but war each and every yeah. day. Shit, you come, look, everybody, everybody only thing, shit, the, uh, I mean, th these people are so docile right about now. These people go crazy over the little shit. Yep. They get a sprint in their hand. They'll say, ah, yeah, yeah, no, right. ah, right. 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 <laughs> <laughs> just a sprint in your hand. Man, grab grab right. a needle, you know what I'm saying? And take it out. That's some, uh, some peroxide. Yep. 
Over there, they seeing brains scattered everywhere. Hell you know what I'm yeah. saying? Brain mad on their jacket, they like. Hell yeah. Yep. Brr, brr, brr. Yep. Blood Damn. get on their face. Black. Yep. Hey. Damn. 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 Brr, brr. Yeah, the fucking um, hang there. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying, bro? So these people ain't seen that yet, man. That's Wait till right. it come over here, man. That's right. Right. Straight up, man. Because if you're bugging out over a hangnail, how much more do you see somebody's brain get splattered all over the floor, man? Yep. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Or, or how much more you see somebody on the ground eating somebody's chest wide open? You know what I'm saying? And take the heart, you know what I'm saying? Bring it up to the sky, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> and start eating, <laughs> man. Yeah. Because in the spirit, what the Lord said, all these things, so what the end is not yet, because things got to happen first, yeah. man. Things in between, like I said, before the, before the ending scenes of the movie, the big two scenes of the movie, there's stuff in between there, right. man. You know? Little, you know, there's little things that happen in between that you gotta pay yep. attention to. Like, oh, yeah. then you understand, okay, that's why it's gonna happen at yep. the right. you, gotta, you gotta pay attention to the movie, man. Yeah. You know? Th this movie is real it's full of suspense. Yep. You right. know what I'm saying? Yeah, you know? I, I didn't see that happening. Right. You know, but the Lord said it was gonna happen, we just don't know how it's gonna happen. Right. That's right. But it's gonna happen, man. That's right. You know? For nation shall rise against nation. Is that what, brother? For nation shall rise against nation. Nation shall rise against nation, man. International wars, man. Right. You know? I was talking to the brother on the way up here. Think about it. At no other point in history, that's the scripture, that's how the scriptures had to document it. So it said the first woe, the right. second woe, and the yep. third woe. And these are talking about world wars, man, right. where everybody on the planet was at war, man. Yep. You know? And before then, in history, that has never happened, man. You know, but until what the, that time, man? The end, the end, man. World War One, World War Two, and World War Three. This is the time where all everyone is have to choose a side right. to fight on, man. Yep. You know, each country. Damn, Joshua right. even said that. Yep. Yep. Choose you, this choose day. this day who you gonna serve, right. bro. Choose you this day who you gonna serve. Right. right. So everybody gotta pick a side. That's right. Yep. Eventually, mm -hmm. yep. shots fired. Mm -hmm. Everybody gotta pick a side. Yeah, you know, yeah. on a, in, a, in a physical sense, it could be. Uh, uh, the, you know, the allies versus the new axis, you know, whatever yep. they say. But on the spiritual level, it's going to be like the war against uh, Yahweh Bashim Al That's man. right. Yeah. What side are you going to pick, man? You know? And you better pick you better pick smart. Right. Because, hey, hey man, one side could be good, the other ain't, man. You know? Because right. your next move could be your last. That's right. Yeah. So, so read, oh yeah, you know what I'm saying? Nation against nation. You got class wars, civil wars, mm -hmm. race wars. That's right. You know, all these nations gonna be coming after Jake. Jake gonna be coming after each other. Mm -hmm. This shit gonna get real sci fi, man. That's Straight right. up, man. <laughs> you know. Yeah, that little brother said that's gonna get real sci fi. gonna get real sci fi, man. You gonna be having these different people gang rape each other out here, man, yep. broad daylight, man. You know what I'm saying? People fleeing down the street, running naked as hell, knees and legs, ashes as hell, trying to get out of Dodge, man. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Naked as hell, man. Mobs, mobs chasing him and everything, man. Yeah. I see it, brother. Remember, pulled the head. Yeah. Remember, pulled the head. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? People oh, yeah. watching, man. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, we've seen it already. The Lord's turned it up, man. Yep. You know? It, 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 ain't, it ain't been a dull moment yet. That's right. Since since so-called January the 1st, it ain't been a dull moment yet. Yeah, right. If you've been watching, it ain't been a dull moment yet, man. And we don't even see everything. That's right. That's right. That's we ain't right. even seen But everything that we have been seeing has been very exciting. That's right. Yeah. Very exciting, yeah. man. Right. You see? It's a, well, nation, what, it says, for nation shall rise against nation what? and kingdom against kingdom. Kingdom. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Hey man, hey, it's a passion in there, you know? That's right. Kingdom. That's right. You know what I'm saying? Hey, isn't America a kingdom? Yep. Right. Isn't Russia a kingdom? Isn't right. China a kingdom? Right. Uh, I was uh, listening to a, uh, one of the Jakes, he was talking to another uh, Jake. He was talking about this. Y'all don't even realize, you know, China, just with ground troops, got a billion people oh, yeah. on <laughs> raid. Right. <laughs> He's like, America don't got that. Right. You know, a billion. That's ground troops. And the half of the half of the um the ground truth that America do got you no know, sense A B C D E F G Yep. H I J K L and P. Q R S T U V W X Y and Z. What you gonna do, man? Come on, man. You know what I'm saying? Right. Walking around with your mama panties on. What the, with lipstick on. What the hell? Yeah. What do you think them um them foreign troops gonna do to you when they see that? Yeah, they go you know right what I'm saying? Like, right. Yeah. You gonna twerk eye? You gonna twerk eye with them? Yeah, yeah. Right. Twerk eye? About to go crazy. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? You, you gonna show no jerk in that day? That's right. That's right. It says um, and there should be famines. It, says, it should be what, bro? Famines. Lack of food and bread and water, man. And people gonna be shriveled up like raisins, man. 
you know? This is the time that we're living in, man. I mean, how about Shemel Shai is not going to have no pity upon those that don't want to turn back unto him, man. Right. If you don't want to turn back into the God of the Bible, then how about Shemel Shai, you're going to suffer these things, man. You know, it said famine, what up, brother? Famines and pestilences. And pestilences. There's going to be things or pestilences that we've never heard before, nope. yeah. never seen before, nope. that's going to destroy people, man. Because nope. you already know that the um, can't, brothers can't forget about the... Um, Bacteria, flesh eating disease. Oh, yeah. yeah. oh, yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's good. I was just about to say that. You got that going on. You got people actually walking around, you know what I'm saying, with this, um, with some um, um, infected skin, pretty oh, yeah. much. Yep. 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 And they rub it on you and then you got it. You know what I'm saying? You know what's called? Hey. Uh, you already got people in, um, in North Korea, that, that, that the government is so corrupt over there, they're hogging all the food, that you got people literally having uh, holes in their body. You can see their organs puffing. Yeah. yeah. And they got holes in the body, yep. and they're just walking around like that. Yep. You know? Hell yeah. Yep. yep. That's what's going to be happening. Like going on. You know, at night, rats look, you know, the organs and stuff. Yeah. Hey, man, that's going to be happening to you people that don't want to turn back and see all about you. Yep. I'm trying to tell you, it's like, you so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. Because when it hits America, it's going to be the worst, man. Yep. You know, the Lord's saving the best for last, yep. man. You know, it's going to be horrible here, man. We all read right? earlier that, I'm um, not trying to cut you off, no, 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 we no, read no. earlier Jeremiah 11 and 11. That's right. The Lord oh, said He's going to bring evil oh, upon oh, them, oh, man. Which they should not be able to escape. That's right. And though they cry or tune, he say he ain't gonna hear them, man. That's right. The Lord is gonna ignore a whole lot of people, man. That's right. You know what I'm saying? The God that you say is all about love is gonna ignore you soon, yep. come, man. Yep. Straight up, man. Yep. You know? That's right. All those talking against the truth, you're gonna see at the end of the day that you should have hearkened into this word. You know? Right? Like that woman that walked, that walked through, you know what I'm saying, with the um, green dress, she's gonna get ravaged like on yeah. the wet, man. That was outrageous, though, man. Coming out the house like that, man. That, 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 that lets you know who's ruling the earth. Yep. The wicked. That's right. right. They, don't, they ain't make no sense right there. <laughs> like, 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 somebody had to tell you, you know what I'm saying? Uh, to pull down your dress, you couldn't feel all that cold air right. going up your ass. Right. You couldn't feel that cold air going up your ass. I feel cold air on my feet. Right. My feet are some boots. <laughs> right. So if I have one of these boots, I most definitely be feeling that cold air. Right. The, the, that demon on them, though. Yep. Right. That demon on them, though. Y'all yep. both be careful. Be ready to back up. It says, um, and there shall be famines and pestilences mm -hmm. and earthquakes in diverse places. What you're seeing right now, brother, you bring out all the time, man. Earthquake at, you know, was, you know yep. going into all the earthquakes that was going on. Right. But now what, you know, that's still going on, but now we're talking about war. Yeah. Right. You know, we're talking about earthquakes. Yeah. Now we're talking about war. Right. Now we're talking about famine. Right. You know, these are the things that's happening in the earth that brothers is uh, are talking about. You know, doing in the news, this man. Yeah. You know, GMS newspapers. Right. You know, updates, all that, man. Yep. You know, the Lord is having things around the clock too. That's right, bro. That's right. It says, um, all these in diverse places, all these are the beginning of sorrow. All, all these are the what? Bro? The beginning of sorrow. Just at the beginning, man. Yep. And we're at the beginning, you know, man. The Lord about to do some yep. things, man. You know, it's already about to be the end of the second month. Okay. The Lord is really about to have some things. Over. What is it saying in the NLT, bro? Oh, yeah, I gotta see that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, 24 started on um, 6. Uh, Let's read down through there. Yeah, the spirit. What's your setup? Because I'm about. I was just saying the spirit that hey, things are about to happen. And the Lord, plus we got the uh, facade coming up too. Oh, yeah. yeah. You know, a lot of things. Uh, you know, last year we saw the. Uh, uh, we saw there was multiple things the year before that. Yeah. Right before the facade shut down. Yeah. And stuff. You know, yeah. and then you get last year right after the facade, you got what happened that was major. Uh, but it was something major that yeah, happened. Yeah, there's so much going yeah, on. Yeah. I can't remember. Okay, yeah, I can't remember either. So much, man. But you know, hey, but we better believe, man, that night, hey, some things is going to go down. The Lord will be working in the earth, man. Yeah. You know, a lot of judgment is going to be going throughout the uh, four corners of the earth, man. You better know? pray that you're covered by that blood. That's right. That's the only thing I can say. That's right. Because I know, I know I pray that brothers are covered. That's right. That's right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Including myself, Lord, That's man. Right. That's right. For real. I don't, I don't, I don't want no smoke. Right? No, no, no. I don't want no smoke with the Lord. No, 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 no. No, no, no. We get it. Right. Right. Shit, we get it. Right. So the Lord ain't playing nothing, you know what I'm saying? Like I said before, through the spirit you have by Shimon Shah, Shah, hole and skull. That's right. Hole and skull. Okay. Then you had that dog, you know what I'm saying, ripped that woman, brace, her whole skull cap came off. Yep. Whole skull cap. Yep. <laughs> can't wear a wig so, no so you know, so it can't even wear a wig, can't even put on a wig. Mm -hmm. Can't put nothing on, man. Can't right. even barely get put some damn bandages on that thing. Right. Yeah. But that's what that's what I look 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 at that pride went before destruction on you know, then. That's, that's right. That's right. Yeah. Oh, proud ass, whatever you want to call it. Yeah. What should we call it? You know what I'm saying? 
<laughs> St. Matthew 24 and 6, the NLT. And you will hear of wars and threats of wars. Is that wars and threats of wars? Yeah. Aren't these countries threatening each other? Hell yeah. Move here if you want to. Right. That's what America did to Russia. Do it again and we'll put sanctions on you. Yep. I don't care what you say, <laughs> right. man. I'm going to do yeah. what I got to do. Your words don't mean nothing to me no more. That's right. Right. Yep. You hear you talk your bullshit for years <laughs> now. The top, sit your old ass down. Yep. <laughs> you know what I mean? What did Putin say? He said, anybody who get involved, we won't go to war with you. Yeah. Right. Yep. And look, look, we got enough troops to do it. You yep. know what I'm saying? <laughs> it's like somebody beating somebody up. And he, right in the middle of beat up, he look at you and step in if you want to. I know, right? <laughs> yeah. You want some? Yep. You want some? Yep. Yeah. Oh, some old Debo yeah. shit. Yeah. Remember Debo did that shit? Yeah. Yeah. Remember Debo did that shit? You want some? Right. I beat you up too. You want some? <laughs> I beat you up too. Here go America tucking their chain in. Yeah. Hell no. <laughs> no, 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 no. 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 I beat him down, I beat you down. I beat him down, I beat you down. <laughs> no. <laughs> Get in the car. Get in the car. Right, right. St. Matthew 24 6 the NLT. It says, You will hear of wars and threats of wars, mm -hmm. but don't panic. Hey. He said, but don't panic. Because people are panicking right, right now, man. I'm like, damn, I didn't want to. I just signed up an army to get this hell cat. Right. <laughs> hell yeah. <laughs> I just wanted to help you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I just wanted to tell you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I just wanted to be with you. Yeah, yeah. Nah, man, you better yeah. go to war, bro. Yeah. Right. You better get sent yeah. over there, man. <laughs> Damn. That's what they do, though. A lot of them got a Hellcat, yeah. the Chargers, yeah. right. the Mustang, the um, Camaro. Yeah. Right. Yeah, all that. You man. know? Yeah. And, then get a, and then they get a knock on the door. <laughs> you haven't been drafted. You haven't been selected for the draft. Yeah. See what I'm saying? Huh? I just want, I just want to rock my fridges. Your ass going to war. Yeah, yeah. Well, look, and, ma and matter of fact, you're going right now. Get your little bag. Yep. Look, the Jeep is outside. It yep. ain't no, I come back and get you tomorrow because they already know Jake Jake going to be gone. Jake going to be out of town. Yep. No, the Jeep, is, the Jeep is out there right now. It's outside. You open the damn door, you know what I'm saying? You got some fucking big ass military dude at yep. the damn door and shit. You yep. open the door. You, th you think it's some of your, uh, your bruise. You think it's some of your bruise and shit, right? You know what I'm saying? Some of your bruise, you know what I'm saying, coming into the door so I can make another um, rap album. You know what I'm saying? That's, yeah, right? That's how you know you open the damn door, you know what I'm saying? Because the Lord said, Look, you, I'm gonna mock when your fear comes. What's over sort of a man so that she also yeah, read? You know what I'm saying? That's how you know you got one on one side, one on the other side. Uh -huh. And look, and they, they know that's you. Yep. The one such and such. That's talking, yeah. Right? They're like, Your such and such here? So I was like, oh, I don't know. Let me see if he's in the back room. They know it's you, man. Right. You know what I'm saying? You got a bitch at you, man. Hell yeah. Like, um, and look, and you try to go, they, they ain't gonna let you shut the door. Hell no. Once you open the door, you're not shutting the door back. Yeah, you try to shut the door, put the foot in it. Right. Yeah. Like, hey, they all big and brolic <laughs> already, too. Jake in for a root. You bruised out there, you know what I'm saying? You, um, you bruised. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? What do they say, the bruise stump? Yeah. It ain't the bruise walking no more. The bruise stump? Oh, yeah, the bruise hop. You know what I'm saying? You're gonna, you gonna hop your ass in that damn vehicle, you know what I'm saying? And go to basic training right there. Yeah. 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 You got it, bro. Losing reserves. Right, right. Yep. It yep. says, um, St. Matthew. They might just drop your ass off, you know what I'm saying, in Iraq. Yeah, you know what I'm yeah. saying? Or drop your ass off in, um, who knows? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Drop your ass off in Kabul somewhere, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, right. Or just the gun that you ain't never shot before. But they said it, um, uh, Biden is sending troops over to, uh, I think, I can't remember which. One of those European countries, England or something like that? Poland. Poland, yeah. That's on the border. 7,000 of them? Yeah. Yeah. Y'all see that video with the new troops that got dead and got deleted and was on fire and shit burning? Burning, yo. And they were going over there taking their rations, taking their ammo and all that. You ain't gonna use it, you burning already. You ain't gonna need it. Taking their ammo, everything, man. Taking their little rations, their little food and shits, man. Taking their book bags. All that. Go ahead, bro. And breeze on. Oh, yeah, they were taking their boots and shit. They're taking their boots, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> and they, oh, yeah, they were taking their, uh, their bulletproof vest, too. You got it, man. Yeah. So they can survive. Man. Yep. It's going to be a dog eat dog world, man. You know? It's going to be serious times that we're living in, man. So yep. if you don't want to get right with the Lord, he's going to have you out there. Somewhere out there in the wilderness over there in, in Poland somewhere. Yeah, hell yeah. In the, in the damn cold. Hell yeah. And stuff. Yeah. Whatever, you know, because it snows heavy over there. Yeah. So, you know, out there in the trenches, you know, yeah. crawling and everything, right. looking Trying back in the because yeah. you're hearing bullets. Not know. knowing what the hell nobody's saying because yeah. you don't speak the language. Over there looking through. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Right. <laughs>
You got it. You got it, Ron. St. Matthew 24 and 6, the NLT, reading on. It said, yes, these things must take place. It said, yes, these things that we've seen must right. take place, man. That's in a bag, man. Um, the Bosch, um, cover the cameras. Uh, it reads on, but the end won't follow immediately. He said, but the end won't follow immediately. The end won't follow immediately. So these things are happening, but the end is not going to follow immediately. Things, but guess what? The end is not gonna follow me. There's some things that gotta happen, brothers. Yeah, there's some things that has to happen in between, and we're gonna see those things with the insurrection of uh, uh, Milwaukee, uh, uh, second uh, 15, 14. Watch out. And we're about to read what's gonna be the in between things that's gonna happen. Verse 7 NLT Nation will go to war against nation, the nation will go to war against nation, Lord. And kingdom against kingdom, uh -huh. there will be famines and earthquakes in many parts of the world. Uh, in what many parts of the world? In, in parts of the world that you've never seen earthquakes before. Yeah. That's what it says, verse eight. <clears throat> but all this is only the first of the birth pains, with more to come. Okay. The birth pains, what back to back to back. These are the very first birth pains, man. They might seem. You know, not as harsh, but as the birth pains keep on going, it's going to get worse and worse. Uh -huh. Worse and worse. Okay. The weatherman don't know shit either. The weatherman said it won't be no more rain today. Here, Here we, we go. go. Oh. It's going to rain tomorrow, right? Yeah, yeah. I'm about to put up the stuff and get a little bit harder. Yeah. Can't go the sword to get going on, right? Yeah. What did you want right quick? Yeah, 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 Woe to the world and them that dwell therein. That's right. Right when the other brother. The great. The Lord. It says, um, matter of fact, I'm going to read 12, then I'll jump down. Second right, yeah. Ezra chapter 15, verse 12, and it reads, Egypt shall mourn, mm -hmm. and the foundation of it shall be smitten with the plague. And this place is Egypt all over again. It's going to mourn. It's going to be in a, a mournful state, because right now everybody partying in the bush. It's in, a, it's in a party last yeah, of the day. Yeah. Then we got no other umbrellas over there? Yeah. We're about to say this to the car. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. shit. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Stop putting stuff in the car and we, uh, we'll finish it in the, in the vehicle. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? We all brothers' vehicles in. Yeah. Um, yeah, they might have to get in the car with you or either with Kapasha. You're going to get in with us. Okay. Uh, we your big head, bro. Brothers gonna have to get in your vehicle then. Okay. And y'all brothers can go with him. Okay. Just listen um, from the uh, thing. If it stopped raining, we got, a, we got an hour left too. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? But we ain't got no umbrellas to cover our stuff, so we're just hopping in the vehicle. Um, y'all brothers just tune in, you know what I'm saying? From the, um, from the, yeah, from the phone or whatever. Um, uh, Kapasha, you can just keep that over there. We just start putting our book bags up first, yeah, yeah. right? Um, yeah, on the back of that. And you wanna keep it running, bro? Yeah, yeah, we we'll keep, we'll keep it. Right. Um, bear, bear with us right quick. I can. Starting to rain, we want to put our stuff up. Bear with us. Oh, shit, all this shit fucked up. Yeah. So bear with us. Yeah. 
Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Ye
you know, thermonuclear destruction, w weapons of war, you know, now uh, they were more uh, excelling in, you know, arc, you know arc, uh, what's the word called, um, agriculture, you know, farm tools, things of that nature. They was focusing on, you know, their farmland and, you know, preparing, uh, building up in that sense. Now, they have allocated their resources more towards war materials, i.e., you know, uh, ICBM missiles, you know, weapons of war. Okay, so they're not lagging anymore like they were because the U.S. was the only one that really had the, the weapons of wars, you know, particularly ICBM missiles. Okay, but it says, and your pruning hooks into spears, let the weak say I am strong. So these other nations are now on a level, okay, where they are, uh, you know, uh, ICBM ready. You know, they got their missiles that they could shoot over here to America, a.k.a. Babylon the Great. They got their uh, a strong, mighty army and their military that's uh, been, you know, increasing and, and building up, getting stronger, you know, getting more uh, uh, prepared for war. So they're on a whole nother level. So now they, they went from a nation that was weak to now nations that are strong. That's why you see that Cold War spirit on the, uh, the Gog and Magog, which is known as uh, Russia. Um, let me read on. Not a precept I want to bring out. All right, brother, what you got so I can get for you, brother? Uh, I was reading Joel 3 and 10. Now we can move on uh, to another precept. You can give me a. Uh, <clears throat> let me get uh, Jeremiah, the 50th chapter. Because as a result, what's going to end up happening is what? Babylon the Great, which is AKA America, will be destroyed by thermonuclear destruction. Jeremiah 50 and 9, Stand. if you will. Stand. I got it for you, brother. Yep. This is a book of Jeremiah, chapter 50. Do you want your bag in here? Is it because oh, I... Is it oh, that's fine. That's fine. Yeah, that's fine. Yep. Yep. This is uh, the book of... You said 50, uh, 50 right? Yep. 50 and 9. 50 and 9, yep. It's the book of uh, Jeremiah, chapter 50, verse 9. And it reads, it says, For lo, I will raise and cause to come up against Babylon. You got enough light back there, bro? Kind of, yep. Turn that oh, light yeah, on back there, y'all. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, there we go. I can give you some light. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm going to read it again. It says, this is uh, Jeremiah chapter 50, verse 9. For lo, I will raise and cause to come up against Babylon mm -hmm. an assembly this your phone right of great yep. nations mm -hmm. from the north country. Yep, and that Babylon is America. Okay, Babylon the Great. It says assembly of great nations. It says from the north. It says from the north country. Yeah, and that's Russia. You know, Russia is the leading one. Uh, who, who's uh, going to be a guard to these, you know, some of these other nations? That's right. Okay, and and they're they're, you know, if you see someone that you look up to who's pretty mighty, uh, step up on your behalf, you what you get behind them. That's, right. that's, that, mm -hmm. that's basically what these other nations are, are doing. That's right. Iran is one of them. You know, you know, China already on the whole le uh, another level. You was talking about how they got what you know a billion foot soldiers. That's right. Okay, but. This is this is the beginning stages of these things getting ready to happen in, in this beginning of sorrows that we're in. That's right. It says, and they shall set themselves in array against her. A formation against her. Who's that her? Babylon the Great. America. That whore that sits upon the beast. That's right. You got it. Uh, I got a definition of the word array. Uh huh. This is from array from the entomons, a verb. It says, in martial troops. Woo, you got it. You know, Marshall going to warlike. Mm. You know, warlike troops, it says, arrange in armies for battle. Mm -hmm. It says, put things in order, arrange to get someone ready or prepared to Ooh. be equipped. Right. So, yeah, that, that North Country, you just said, brother, I'll read it again for you. It mm -hmm. says, from the North Country, and they shall set themselves in array mm -hmm. against her. So, in battle, in battle readiness. Right. You know, uh, ready for battle and set themselves in order mm -hmm. and make sure they're equipped for the battle. You know? There you go. It says, um, as they shall set themselves in array against her, from hence she shall be taken. Their arrows shall be as of a mighty expert man. When it's talking about arrows, what is, what is that referring to? It's referring to the, uh, the missiles, okay. those ICBM missiles. Remember, you know, Russia is is heavy. I think Russia is behind America in uh, its uh, nuclear capability. 
okay? Russia has always been a threat to America much more now. Yeah. And these other nations as well. You know, the, the Lord gave uh, the spirit of these Temanites, the Germans, yeah. okay, the so-called Germans, to be able to precisely build these missiles, get better over time, mm -hmm. you know? So there, these other nations were saying they were, they were weak at one point, but now they're strong. You know, you got it. Yeah, some of those Temanites um, came to America. Some of mm -hmm. them went to Russia. It seemed like the ones that went to Russia are more intelligent. <laughs> right. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> right. You know, R Russia on a whole nother level, man, when it comes uh -huh. to nuclear weapons, man. Mm -hmm. I think, and then they um, create down this hypersonic. Missile. Yeah, hypersonic, yep. You know what I'm saying? They can get over here in like 15 minutes. Yep. What is America going to do with that, yo? Yep. 15 minutes, man. Mm -hmm. What the hell are you going to do in 15 minutes, bro? Right. Besides kiss your ass goodbye. You know what I mean? Right. You ain't even 15 minutes, you can't even call nobody. You know what I'm saying? Uh, hands all nervous, you know what I'm saying? You just dialing wrong, numb and all. You know what I mean? Right. What can you, we can really though, real talk, what can you do in 15 minutes? You know what I'm saying? Yep. Nothing, man. Mm. Brother, I, I just looked this up in the spirit. Spirit told me to look it up. And I typed in in Google, who has the most nuclear weapons? And the uh, the answer came up, says Russia. Damn. Damn. Has the largest stockpile of nuclear weapons wow. in the world. Wow. I guess so. It says, though the exact number of nuclear warheads is a state secret. So it was worth a Google, right? Yep. That's right. It says, it is thought that Russia owes more than half of the world's nuclear weapons. Yep. More than half. Damn. There you go. And so you don't think Putin don't know that? You right. Know, you don't think the Lord made pr him privy of that? This man knows his power. He's been studying his enemies, you know? So this is what we're seeing is the beginning stages of that. And they can very well use this Russia situation to make it a reason why the economy collapses here. You know? And they know the majority of the Americans are weak. Yep. Because the only thing they do is TikTok videos, mm -hmm. Facebook videos, club all day, yep. party all day. Now the <laughs> Russians, they might have their little fun or whatever, mm -hmm. but the mind state over there, it, look, we can't compare it to it over here, you know yep. what I'm saying? They mind stay mainly because them other uh, countries over there, man, they they, they um war um war minded. You war minded, and, and they don't even not to cut you off. Not they good. don't even let certain um songs get played there right. that that threatens um the the women, their right. their, their women's uh morals. femininity morals. Yep. They don't even let certain things be aired in their in their country because right. it gives off a, a vibration as we know. That's right. And weakens that society. I got a precept. Huh. Would you read something? Somebody was reading something. Uh, no, oh, yeah. Uh, Jeremiah 59. You fin oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah finish it, yeah. You finish that, bro? Somebody can get um, you know, um, Isaiah 9 and 5, too. Right. This is um, Isaiah chapter 54, verse 16. Behold, I have, create, I have created the smith that blew up the coals in the fire. Those missiles. The Lord created that. This is who we're going to give credit to and who's the, uh, behind all this. Yep. Using men to create this, this uh, weapons of indignation, man. That's right, brother. You know, the Lord created that. He's the one that gave the mentality and the spirit, the knowledge, the intelligence to these Temanites to build these weapons. Yep. Yeah, these scientists. Yep, the scientists. You know what I'm saying? Yep. The missile was created in the lab. The atom got mm -hmm. split. Yep. You, know what I'm you see how big them shits is, yeah, man? They're huge. And you know, a whole yeah. lot of um, scientists, you know what I'm saying, A.K. Smith, you know what I'm saying, died. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? They don't yep, really go yep. into all the reports of these I men dying and all that, you know yep. what I'm saying? Fucking exploding. Yep. Whole buildings exploding and mm -hmm. shit. You know what I'm saying? It took years, you know what I'm saying? But now the Lord has perfected the weapon. Yep. Which the scriptures getting ready to go into. Behold, I have created the smith that blew up the coals in the fire and that bringeth forth an instrument for his work. Mm -hmm. And I have created the waster to destroy. Yeah, the Lord created the waster to destroy. You no, know, to, to bring forth his will, which is to destroy Babylon the Great, mm -hmm. a.k.a. America. That's right. This is how the land of America will be laid desolate through yep. the thermonuclear destruction the Lord is bringing, the great waster. So, of course... He's going to make sure that it's perfected, and he's going to do it through men. So then when the brother read Jeremiah 59, uh, none shall return in vain, meaning none of the nuclear missiles are going to miss their mark. Right. They're not going to um, explode in the atmosphere. They're not going to uh, barely get off or, or not get off in the silos. They're going to shoot off in the silos, make its way through the atmosphere, and land exactly, hit their marker here. Yeah. Yeah, the scriptures tell you that, you know what I'm saying? I'm a flame burning behind it. Mm, you know what I'm yeah, saying? That's yeah. what's propelling yep. it. Yep. It says, um, and behind, it says, it says, before these missiles hit, America was like a paradise Eden. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Remember? It says, before yep. the missiles hit, this place was as the yep. Garden of Eden. Eden yep. Which is where Eden means paradise. Yep. You know what I'm saying? It says, but behind it, after the missiles hit, a desolate wilderness. Damn. And, that, and that's what's coming. Look, look. Yep. But not yet, though. Not yet. But not yet, though. Yep. 
a couple more prophecies got to pop off, and yep. then the, the Lord, the Lord is, is strategic. You know, what I'm saying yep. setting up his moves, man. Yep. Plus, Ukraine, you know, what I'm saying is not the, um, the house of Jehoshaphat. You know, what I'm saying. Facts. You know, Facts. what I'm saying. Facts. You know, all the all the troops are not going to be gathered in in Ukraine. Mm -hmm. You know, what I'm saying. Yep. Scriptures tell you where all the troops are going to be gathered mm -hmm. at, according to the Bible, and it's not Ukraine. They right. got war skirmishes and shit like that. You know, what I'm saying pop off, but nah, man. It's yep. not the Middle East. It's not the Middle East. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Wait, the house of Jehoshaphat. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. It's a lot. You got it, brother. And, and you made a beautiful point because when we read St. Matthew 24th chapter, when, reading all the things that are happening, wars, rumors of wars, pestilence, evil, nation against nation, we're seeing that we're in the beginning of sorrows. Like the brother said, we can't, we, we got more stuff to happen. More things yep. got to happen, you know? If, if um, uh, Revelation 13, 16 got to happen yep. first. You know what I'm saying? Revelation 13, 16, the M-A-R-K, the M-O to the T-T-T-B-B-B, -B -B, that got to happen first, man. Mm -hmm. You know, so yeah, we're excited. We see this nation going at this nation, so forth and so on. But hey, look, man, you know, mm -hmm. this is part of the prophecies. That's all. That's right. And, and, uh, speaking of that, can we get Revelation 3 and 10? If brother don't have a precept, we can bring the brother Kibosh, up. you can get it. Yeah, Revelation 3 and 10. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Who is that one I always bring? Is that um is that in Isaiah or Ezekiel? The one I just quoted. The land is as a garden of Eden. I don't know that one. Is bro. that Ezekiel, bro? I, I always know. go to that too, man. For some reason I can't remember it right now. I get it right quick. You ready for that Revelation 3 and 10? Yeah, yep. Revelation 3 and 10 reads, Because thou hast kept the word of my patience, mm -hmm. I also would keep thee from the hour of temptation. Yep, the hour of temptation is going to be that Revelation 13 and 16, verse 17. That karagma that's going to be mandated, all right, that uh, they're going to use as a new form of currency. So that must happen before the thermonuclear destruction takes place, before these nations shoot their missiles on America. Mm -hmm. And and how do you know that? Well, when you read Revelation 14th chapter, it tells you, first and foremost, all, all end-time prophecies when it's appointed time must come to pass before this land is completely desolate. In Revelation, the 14th chapter, it says, that basically, if you took that, that nine. karagma, verse 9, if you take that karagma, you know, that's going to justify the Lord destroying you. Right. You know, and it's going to be a witness before Yahweh Shai and the angels. Right. Okay? So that's how you know that, that, that this hour of temptation, the MOTB, BMA mandated, has to come to pass first. Mm -hmm. Read that one more time. Okay. Revelation 3 and 10 read, because thou hast kept the word of my patience, I also will keep thee from the hour of temptation. Yep, the hour of temptation. So, you know, we're excited about these times, those who are occupied in prophecy, but we're also um, preparing for war spiritually, getting ourselves built up, building up our faith, being prepared, trusting the Lord, and getting our houses, our house in order. You know, because the, the temptation that's getting ready to come is going to be tempt. It's going to be something that the Lord is going to use to tempt the whole earth. Everyone's going to be tempted with this. Okay, so we're being prepared for this. You know, even though we see this ha this war happening, we know other things has has to come. And if you can get me Micah two and ten, once you're done with that. Okay, I have a little more. Yep. Which shall come upon all the world? All the world, the, everyone on the face of the earth. But the Lord said he because you have kept. Uh, my patience because you had faith in me and you uh, kept suffering and you kept yep. remaining with integrity. You didn't sell out. Lord said, I'm going to keep you from the hour of temptation. You've been uh, suffering through these persecutions, all these things, but you remained. I'm going to make sure you don't take it. Again, going back to the Lord is the one. This is the Lord. The Lord controls this whole movie we're in. Yep. You know? Yep. To try them that dwell upon the earth. To try them that dwell upon the earth. And we know that test is really for the Israelites, the so-called Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans, children of Israel, okay? But, but um, again, those of the elect will not take it. The Lord's going to make sure that the elect doesn't take it. And what is the, the elect going to be doing? The elect is going to be locked in in these times, preparing for, you know, the final of these end-time prophecies, preparing for Yahweh Shai's return. Yeah, the Lord said he have care for his elect. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, of course, the elect of the nation of Israel is not going to take that M-A-R-K. Yeah. To the M or to the T to the B B B. Right. Lord willing, we of that number, man. That's right. 
Cause that fire and brimstone, man, this shit gonna be hot. That's right. You know what I'm saying? So it's, it's the same um, temperature as the sun. Damn. Plus the Lord said he gonna have his spirit in it, man. Yup. Look at this numb that driving off fast. Uh uh. A deal doing here. Ain't no parking spaces. No patience. Ain't nothing left. Uh -huh. Ain't nothing left. You too late. Johnny come late, this right? Uh huh. You got it, bro. You ready for that, Micah 2 and 10? Yep. Micah 2 and 10 reads Arise ye and depart. Yep. For this is not your rest. Yeah, and so now you got a little small amount of people who are asking questions. They're getting scared. They're realizing something major is happening. Mm -hmm. When the scripture told us to rise and depart, meaning mentally and spiritually. You should already had in your mind this place is getting ready to go out if, if you are really seeking the Lord. Right. Okay? The Lord said it's not our rest. This world is getting ready to pass away. It's getting ready to perish forever. Okay? And we brought out uh, reasons why and what's going to be the instrument the Lord's going to use to do that. Right. And give us a reason why not. I know, right? <laughs> give you how about Shemiah Osha a reason why he shouldn't delete this place, man. Right. Know what I'm saying? That's right. Cause we can give you a million reasons why he should. should yeah, exactly. <laughs> right. You know what yep. I'm saying? Well, look, what I ain't thinking about. What are you thinking? Because it is polluted. Mm -hmm. It it's... shall destroy you, even with a sore destruction. Yeah, this place is full of wickedness. Okay, and if you get caught up in the ways of America, then you're gonna be destroyed. You're gonna uh, be drunk off the wine of this place. You're gonna be into feminism. You're gonna be into uh, um, doing drugs and game banging, living a corrupt life, stealing. You're gonna be into li living the unruly lifestyle. That's right. Mm -hmm. If you get caught up in the ways of America, you know. So you should be. Our mindset should be. We should be looking forward to all these things. That's mm -hmm. why our brothers are rejoicing when when the Lord put on Putin to, to start, you know, shooting. <laughs> Putin shooting start Putin. shooting. Shooting Putin. <laughs> Okay. You know, remember we read earlier Proverbs 21 and 1. Mm -hmm. The king's heart is in the, the hand, hand of the, the Lord. Lord. Right. So the Lord is controlling all the minds yep. of everything, every living soul on this earth. Remember, yep. he's called the father of spirits. That's yep. right. Controlling everybody's mind. And it, look, look, man. Look, man, we can't even fathom how much power we serve, yeah, man. Bro. We're serving a true and living power, bro. That's right. That's right. So he's controlling everybody's mind. That's right. All every right. thought, everything. What's that, bro? All at once. All, all at once, once man. Ain't nobody walking around here doing their own thing. Like, like all of a sudden the missiles got shooting Putin, shot some missiles, and the Lord don't know about it. The Lord, like, damn, I ain't know he was gonna do that. Come on, man. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, like that, um, that, um, what I say, the pole to the, um, to the, um, oh, yeah, skull. The, yeah. Like, mm -hmm. look, damn, ain't no, you know what I mean? God, I ain't, damn, I ain't know that was gonna happen right there. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> that just came out of nowhere, right? <laughs> Shit. I made a mistake on that part of the story. <laughs> right. Nah, man. And the, 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 all the ways of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh are perfect. Yep. And the Lord, you know, saying, look, this is chess, not checkers. Yep. That's right. The Lord making making chess moves right now, yep. man. Mm -hmm. Setting up mm -hmm. the pawns, man. Yep. That's right. You know, drawing people into certain situations they weren't ready for. You know what I mm -hmm. mean? Because it says, it says the kings of the earth shall be afraid. Yep. Remember? Oh, yeah. Um, woe uh, is me, woe is me. me. Who, Who would deliver me in those, those days? days? And I hold that on. Yep. Did you read that yeah. earlier? Nope. That, that's a good one right yeah, there. Mm -hmm. And then somebody could possibly hold um, second edge of the 14th chapter, yep. verse uh, 16. Come on, and can you finish? Can can, can finish out here? Yeah. And yeah, then, yeah, um, yeah. and I know you're holding Ezekiel too, and then we'll get Kazat by his precept. You want him to read it again? Uh, well, he he got to you got to finish it out, right? I did finish. Oh, you did? Okay, okay, come on. Then we can go, we can go to um, Kazat by his precept. Come on, come on. It's the second edge of 15 and 8. It says, I will hold my tongue. No more uh -huh. touching their wickedness. Yep, and the Lord's not holding it. He, he, he been sending his prophets out. Lean in a little bit, because uh, I'm about to be on camera. Okay, okay. Yeah. Yep. It says, um, Gotta get the brother on camera, man. Uh -huh. It says, Second Ezra is 15 and 8. I will hold my tongue no more as touching their wickedness. Yep, the, hey, hey, calling their wickedness out, calling out corruption. The Lord is calling, was is doing all that through his prophets. That's right. Since Elder Abba Bivens hit the scene. Mm hmm. Okay, and then you, from, from that, you had, uh, uh, it says, scripts say, um, a good tree bringing forth uh, good fruit. Yep. You had fruit come from that. Yep. Men who was preaching and prophesying the things to come, de uh, declaring the downfall of this wicked, sinful kingdom. That's the Lord speaking right there. Here we are in these times, our teachers, our apostles and elders, us, you know. When this tree was basically like a small mustard seed. Mm -hmm. That grew. You know what I'm saying? When nobody truly didn't believe. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm yep. saying? It wasn't no internet back then. Right. You know what I'm saying? Video right. cassette tapes and things of that nature. Maybe a camcorder or something mm -hmm. like that, you know what I'm saying? To when yep. this, this word won't throughout the four corners of the earth, man. Yep. That's faith right there, man. Yep. That's right. You know? Mm -hmm. 
that's some real faith right there, man. Real talk. And now look, by, by being faithful over something small, yep. you know what I'm saying? I'm going to make you rulers over something yep. big. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? Right. Now look. Right. From them, by them staying faithful to you, how about you now? Look all that fruit that came out of mm -hmm. it, man. Fruit everywhere, bro. Facts. Good fruit. Mm -hmm. right. it's, it's beautiful, man. I, I'm, I'm still at awe. Me too. I'm still in awe. Yep. This whole process, yep. man. Yep. I'm still yep. in awe, man. Every of Yahweh by Shimei man. Yep. This word, you know what I'm saying, has blossomed from the four quarters of the bro. earth. This word is in places that we ain't never heard of, man. Yep. Mm -hmm. Names that we can't even pronounce. This mm -hmm. truth is there, man. That's right. Yep. You see? I was going to say, you saw? <laughs> um, something like the brother in uh, Barbados. You saw? <laughs> you know what I mean? But yeah, though, man, this word is like everywhere. The Lord made good on his word. The Lord is making good on his word. Yep. Look, why not trust? That's right. Why, why not trust in a word that is faithful and true? You see everything coming to pass. Why would you leave? It's just it's getting good. Now. The meal getting real good now. The meal starting to taste extra good now. Right. The Lord added some more salt to the uh -huh. meal. That's right. Yeah. You got it, bro. I just want to say that through the spirit, uh -huh. man. This is Second Exodus fifteen and eight. I will hold my tongue no more as touching the wickedness. And then the thing about it, bro, this ain't in the climax. I know, right? Mm. You know what I'm saying? This is just one of them stages, you know what I'm saying? It's like almost it's build up. up to it. Yeah, yep. it's the build up, mm. you know what I'm saying? Yep. We haven't seen nothing yet, yet, man. You know what I'm saying? It's going to be a, a so-called alien invasion. Oh, yeah. Soon yep. come, man, a.k.a. the chairs, the yep. angels, man. So-called alien man. invasion. You know what I'm saying? Mm. The, look, the um, greater truth is going to be over here on this land. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying, bro? It's going to be buck wild, lawless city, man. Screams, mm -hmm. hollerings, man. You name it, man. Yep. Right. People going to be stealing fucking cat buses and everything, man. Yep. Just driving them like, on, like Method Man then when they was on that mm -hmm. Wu-Tang video. Driving down the street with that damn bus. I know y'all remember that, right? Mm -hmm. They was riding down the street with that damn bus and they took over the bus and shit. And everybody on the bus was just wild and doing whatever. Riding through the city. That's how you're going to have it soon come, man. Yep. It's gonna be a lawless land. They shall not regard their kings, man. Princes, yeah. Nor princes. The course of their actions shall stand in their, their power, power, man. We ain't seen nothing yet. Yeah. It's a beautiful thing to be actually in the movie and looking at it. Mm -hmm. See mm -hmm. what I'm saying? These people are in the movie, but they're not looking at yep. it. They're just in the movie. They don't know what the hell going on. We in the movie and the Lord actually got us looking at it. Yep. That's right. Yep. In the movie. You're in the movie, you're looking at the movie. Yep. And you got a role to play in that yeah. movie. There's people who are literally waiting. Like, I can't wait till the mall lights shut out. Right. I would love to go in a uh, footlock and grab all, you know, or yeah, burn. You know, yeah. people are already meditating on things they would do if society collapses. Yep. Well, they can really have their, their opportunity. Mm-hmm. You know? You know? How much more the spirit's creative event is I know, bro. You know what I'm saying? The average person thinking about stealing shoes. I know, right? And shit like that. All hell breaking loose. Only thing Jake thinking about a 60-inch screen TV. And you ain't going to have no damn power. No power. You know what I'm saying? You look crazy running down the street, like uh, like when this first uh, pandemic <laughs> popped off or whatever, mm -hmm. and people uh, were going through the cities looting and all that mm -hmm. shit. I was watching the news, you know what I'm saying? It was like 2020. Shit, it was Jake's coming out of the, um, the fucking uh, furniture stores with furniture. Damn. Running down the street with a couch, bro. You know what I'm saying? Some <laughs> shit off a movie for real, for real, right? Yeah. Y'all got to Jake go, Wild, man. man. Yeah. You say you wanted second Ezra's 14? Yeah, 16. You can hold that on deck. Did, did we finish out because our boss? No, no, just okay. it. It says, which they profanely commit, uh -huh. neither will I suffer them in the things which they wickedly exercise themselves. Yeah, the, all the things that Esau, the, the so-called white man, has been performing as wicked rulership, and the people who would follow suit behind this devil, who look up to him, these heathen nations, two-thirds of our people, the Lord said he ain't suffering it no more. Mm -hmm. That's why the scriptures say, um, it, shall, it shall no more tarry. Right. It's not going to tarry anymore. That's why the Lord said, my words shall no longer be prolonged. Right. When you see the Lord's prophets go out down the streets, the Lord's getting ready to bring something. Heavy. Yeah. You know? So now it's speeding up. And uh, as, as each day goes by, the Lord is speeding up time faster for his elect's sake. That's right. That's why the people back in the ancient time, when they seen um, Samuel come up on the scene, they ran up to him. You know what I'm yep. saying? Well, pretty much the elders yep. of the town. Yep. We have to send like yo. Are you yeah, here for we, good yeah, or bad? Bad, right? What, what, what you here for? That's, that lets you know right there. Our people don't know the Bible. Yep. When you see the prophets on the streets, if you've been reading the Bible, that's why the scripture says, "Blessed is he that reads." Yeah. You've been reading the Bible. You see the men on the streets teaching the Bible. Right. 
something. This happen. means something right here. Yep. That's right. That's you know what I'm saying? Because I just read First Samuel. Mm -hmm. When Samuel came into town, the, the elders of the town was scared and nervous. Mm -hmm. Like, what is the Lord getting ready to do? You know what I'm saying? Yep. Our people ain't inquiring about the Lord. The Lord says, seek me now. Yep. Our people ain't seeking the Lord, but you're going to wish you did, though. Yep. That's, That's right. the thing about it. You're going to wish you were seeking Yahweh by Shimei El Shai while the men were still on the streets, man. Because you already know when the men, well, we know, according to the Bible, when the men are, or the Lord are not on the streets anymore, <laughs> ball game. Yep. Okay. Ball game. Mm -hmm. You got it, bro. It says, finishing up, it says, which they wickedly exercise themselves. Behold, the innocent and righteous blood cried unto me. Mm -hmm. And the souls of the, the just, just complain, complain continually. continually. Yeah, the, the souls of the just complain continually. Look, we're complaining each day. Lord, you know, in our prayers, brothers, I'm sure brothers can testify. Lord, please bring this wicked, sinful, sinful kingdom down. Right. Please destroy our enemies. Right. Being amongst these these demons on a, a work day or coming to camp or whatever, having to be around these people, man, is vexing. You know what it's going to say? Uh, Lot was vexed with the filthy conversation. Okay, the Lord heard Lot uh, uh, Lot complaining. You know. So the Lord is, is hearing the, these things and he's getting ready to bring all these end time prophecies to pass right before our eyes. You got it? That's it, man. Time. This is on 2nd Ezra chapter 16. Did you want Kapashas first? Oh, it's, it's you, bro. 2nd um, Ezra chapter 16, verse 17. Woe is me. Mm -hmm. Woe is me. Who would deliver me in those days? Mm -hmm. And we know that, that there's a way out, right? Ezra just asked a beautiful question through the Spirit at that time, man. You know, we know that if we remain, the Lord's going to send forth angels who's going to uh, give charge over thee. You know, we're going to eat, you know, when there's a famine, all these things. So we know now, and then this is what comforts us. Mm -hmm. And the phone will chime in. Mm -hmm. It's like, about, yeah, 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 it's yeah. like get whole Psalms on 91. Yep, too. 91, yep. Day, yep. yep. It says, um, the beginning of sorrows. Mm -hmm. We're in the beginning of sorrows. We're in the beginning of more grief. More um, anxiety, yep. more death, destruction, all that. This, this, this is about to turn up, man. Mm -hmm. The year of turn up. That's right. The economy going to crash. The oh, stock market yeah. going to crash. Oh, yeah. There ain't nothing wrong with investing. Some mm -hmm. of us got a couple of dollars, no sense, shekels invested mm -hmm. in the stock market. But that's not our go-to, though. Not, that's right. yep. We're still trusting in Yahweh by Shimei Ain't nothing wrong with yeah. making money on the side. Mm -hmm. But we know eventually the stock is going to crash, man. Yep. The economy going to crash. What are you going to be left with, you know? Yeah, how about Shimei was shot? Because if we lose everything tonight, Salaki, so we still got the Lord. That's, That's right. right. We still got this truth. That's right. And this right. Is, this is what's going to keep us stable any day. That's right. right. You see? You look, because no matter how rich you are, we, we, we quote it all the time, and we also get it, Proverbs um, 11, 11 and 4. And four. Richest Rich prophet, prophet, not a day of wrath. That's right. So if you're sitting at home with some big-ass gold bars, you know what I'm saying, you got, like, stacks and racks on racks, you got money up under the um, bed and all that, it ain't going to mean nothing when all hell right. break loose. Only thing that's gonna matter when all hell break loose is you having the knowledge, wisdom, understanding the scriptures. This word, man. You see, nothing else is gonna comfort us in that day, man. Right. That's right. Nothing else gives us hope anyway, but this word. You see, it says the beginning of sorrows and great mourning. Mm -hmm. Great mourning. Great mourning. Yeah. Great. Uh, uh, you know, feelings of of death and seeing loved ones around you perish. Yeah. You know, it's gonna be a large amount of that. So much so that there's not gonna be any. Burial services, any time to lament. The scriptures say their bodies shall be as dung upon the ground. Right. Right. It says, um, and like somebody really care about some dung that's on the ground. At all. You know what I'm saying? Stepping over and you moving. Right. right. Avoiding it for real, for mm -hmm. real, right? right? That's right. Plus, by the time you see the body, it's going to be, um, fucking, um, decaying. decaying yep. Stinking. Yep. You know what I'm saying? People catching diseases mm -hmm. from it. Mm -hmm. You're going to get so used to seeing it, too. Right. You know? It's going to be a normal thing, just like cross seas. Yep. It's a normal thing. Yep. It ain't enough for them to come over here and bust a head. Hell yeah. You saw when they was just, when they was putting other troops out there, um, them vehicles? Man. There was nothing, mm. yo. It was like it's normal. All that is normal. Mm -hmm. It's going to be normal over here. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. that's, that, that's how it's going to mess a whole lot of people up because they ain't expecting it. Right. Now, it ain't, now, it ain't normal to us. Right. But we're expecting we're it, expecting though. It, that's yeah. right. So when it happened, you know what I'm saying? Shit, just, it, look, this is happening. Yep. But the people that don't think it's gonna happen, shit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like you got those Americans over there in Ukraine right about now, they try to get the hell out of there. Cause when they mm. first went over there, everything was all peaceful. Nothing hadn't happened in years since they've been yep. over there. Then all of a sudden, boom, 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 yep. boom, 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 boom. Yep. Only thing they could grab is their damn dog, man. And maybe a little purse or whatever, mm -hmm. get the hell out of Dodge, man. And that little shit, man. 
And who knows if they're going to let any planes or anything go out of there. You know what I mean? Mm. You don't want to be trapped over there, man. Oh, yeah, they stopped They stopped um, commercial traveling. Yeah, yeah see? Yeah, yeah. yeah, they said they was going to stop doing that. Yeah, hey, they did that before Putin made his uh, invasion. You got that, um, that Jake dude over there to play basketball over there, crying, talking about I just wanted to come over here and play basketball. Some days over, bro. You know what I'm saying? Tell them, tell them, I didn't know this was going to happen. I know. Because you ain't blessed. Yep. Blessed is he that reader. reader. That career shit going out the window, out the man. Window, Lord bro. wants us a fear, man. Yep. All that I want to be a rapper and all that, but then you still got ears like who's trying to be rappers, yep. bro. Shit going down, you still trying to. I, I gotta have my hell cat. You know what I'm saying? You know, you got you got Jake's. You know what I'm saying? Um, what does scripture say? Um, be be not unequally yoked, yoked together with, with non-believers. Believers. Jake actually um doing rap songs with gangbangers, trying to trying to keep that street cred. Yep. Just look, just in case this ain't the truth. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Just in case this yeah, ain't the true. truth. And meanwhile, the These dude's gone, bro. Yep. You got it. It's like it don't say. And meanwhile, the Lord is showing you this is right. true, but, but he blinded him. All the unfavorable shall die, die in their unfaithfulness, man. Straight up, man. Yep. The, look, the beginning of sorrows. Mm -hmm. It says, um, look, the begin they look, um, and great sorrow and great the beginning of sorrows and great mourning. Great mornings. We went into that, you know. People are gonna be mourning even more. He, he look, the scripture said, when the righteous in authority, the people rejoice. Yeah. But when the wicked bear rule, the people mourn. Well, the wicked is going to be revealing how much he has hatred towards you so-called Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans, and his own kind. So now that he's revealing it even more, the mornings are going to heighten to another level. Pretty much everybody that you never grew up with, everybody that you didn't ever know, mm -hmm. everybody that you didn't ever had a conversation with, all your damn friends that you ain't Enemies. never met on Facebook, gonna get deleted soon. Come yep. every last one of them. So just know that everybody that you didn't ever met on the side is gonna go straight mm -hmm. to the pit, man. Yep. Straight up, man. Be prepared for that. Straight up, man. Mm-hmm. You know. But, but oh yeah, everything it's all it's all about joking time, right? right. Tell me a joke, right? Tell right. me something good. Right. We just told you something good. Repent to the Lord. That's right. Or feel that heat, man. It says, um, the beginning of famine and mm -hmm. great death. Famine. Lack of food. Okay? No water. And what does that result in? Death, starvation. Mm -hmm. Cannibalism. Right. That's right. Remember, cannibalism is gonna be happening. People are gonna be looking like what would they say? I'm a snack. Get a number four bus right there. Gone, mercy. You know what I'm saying? Yep. For the hope for elect, Lord, we elect. elect number. That's right. Yep. You know, and all, all you women talking about you a snack. Yeah, Yo, you gonna be a snack yeah. in that day. Yep. You gonna be a snack, man. When this when this famine hit, you know, it's coming to a place that that pride is exalted above yeah. all these other nations, man. Mm -hmm. You know, not used to like the brother saying, you got a little uh, uh what do you call it, um, splinter? Yeah. Caught in your finger. Yeah. You crying. And, oh. Yeah. You know, yeah. Or, or oh. your order comes wrong. Chick fil A right. messes up your order. Hell and your your yeah. fries are not hot. And you flipping out over yep. that? You saw what that woman did. She climbed through the drive through yep. window and started twerking once she got a meal. She was getting ready to actually, you know what I'm saying? Take, did y'all see that video? Yeah. I that see. woman, you know what I'm saying? Jake woman hopped through the drive through. Yep. You know what I'm saying? And they, they, I guess they were taking too long with a meal. Oh, they give her sauce. I didn't think. Yeah. 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 And, she, and she was getting ready to take the grease, the hot grease, you know what I'm saying? Damn. And throw it in the people's face. You ain't see that part. I ain't see that she, part. She was like, you better get it. And they say, you know, the people, how the dude was like, ho, 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 ho. Yeah. yeah, you know what I'm saying? That's how you know they gave her her shit. You know what I'm saying? That's how you know. She, the dude was like, yo, how did she get in here? She ain't come through that window, did it? And that's how you know. He put the camera like this and shit. You know what I'm saying? That's how you know. She went, she went back through the window, right? Before, before, but before she went back through the window, she had to shake her funky ass, though, right? She had to twerk, right? She had to show how much of a deal do head she was right before she went through the window, right? Mm -hmm. Shaking her ass and everything, right? Yep. Pride will have you living unruly, disrespectful, being an idiot. This is why majority of these people need to be destroyed, man. This is right. this is a place of pure wickedness, man. Right. Pride. That's why this, that's why the Lord says the beginning of all these things. Mm -hmm. You know, and if, the, if and if this is the beginning of it, bro, Ooh. what the hell is the middle gonna look like? What the hell is the end of it gonna look like? If it, if this is just the beginning, <sighs> you know what I'm saying? Shit, the scripture say, you know what I'm saying? A great famine, just like in Samaria, it was a great famine. Yep. You know what I'm saying? They were eating their babies and everything, yep. cooking it, boiling it. You know what I'm saying? Man, just imagine that, bro. You gotta cut your own baby head off. You know what I'm saying? You just gotta eat it. You know what I'm saying, mm. bro? Just imagine that. But the Lord said, my service ain't gonna have to go yep. through that. My service is gonna eat. eat. You see? It's gonna be pretty much Daniel and the lion's den. Yep. You know what I'm saying? That's right. The Lord gonna have the angels, you know what I'm saying? Bring somebody from somewhere and mm. bring you food. Yep. 
And, look, and that's going to make you shed tears right there, too. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? You know. Yeah. The Lord, you know what I'm saying, thought upon you. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And ashes and dirt. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. The Lord, you know what I'm saying, had one of his angels bring you some food. I know, right? That's that tender mercy right there, man. Mm -hmm. the, we, we live in those miracles. Yeah. We're living in a time of miracles, man. Yeah, we're living in a time of death and destruction, but we also living in a time of miracles. Brothers can't lose hindsight of the miracles either. That's I know, right? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. This devil gonna come in with great rap, yeah. but the Lord mm -hmm. gonna come in with the miracles, though. Yeah. For his, for his elect, Lord, when we're part of that number, man. It's been faithful the whole time. Power. The whole world shitted on us, man, because mm -hmm. of our belief, man. Mm -hmm. You know? Uh, remember, the Lord said, um, bless are those when everybody separate yep. themselves from you. Come, That's right. right. Remember that. You sit somewhere all alone, the majority of the time, mm -hmm. Lord said, you blessed. blessed. Don't feel bad. Nope. Because the majority of us are like that. Yep. yep. Pretty much throughout the oh, week, yeah. yo. We're loners. alone, loners. bro. Loners, loners, yep. We're alone, but we ain't lonely. Yep. You know what I'm saying? We're alone, but we're not yeah, lonely. lonely. That's, right. That's right. Let's finish it off, though. The beginning of sorrows and great mourning, the beginning of famine and great death. Yep. That's what we're getting ready to see, man. More of that year to turn up. The beginning of wars. Mm -hmm. Wars. Wars. St. Matthew 24. Chapter. Right. We just read that. You know? So everybody going to be getting it in. You know what I'm saying? Everybody going to be, you know what I'm saying, using their artillery. Yep. You know what I mean? Yep. You know, it's going to be more cars being ran over mm -hmm. by army tanks. Yep. You see, it's going to be more apartment buildings being blasted yep. down by, by rocket fire. Mm -hmm. We're just telling you the truth, man. Just telling you the truth. Why everybody else singing about burgers and fringes? You see? <laughs> and like we like we um, read earlier, you know what I'm saying? It was one of them chapters. It was one of them books we read earlier. The Lord's going to bring the elect from among those false groups. Oh, yeah, yep. We was going yeah. in earlier, yeah, though, bro. Yeah, Lord had us going in. We were going in there, but we was going in earlier, yeah, though. Yeah, that's right. what scripture that you was. Know, yeah. That's why, that's why um, when the Lord take brothers from among those false Israelite groups, mm -hmm. thank the Lord thank for, the Lord for, for real, that. man. That's right. Yep. Lord could have left your ass there. Yep. Lord could have yeah, left right. your ass there, man. Yep, amongst those weirdos, man. Taking all your damn money. Yep. You know what I'm saying? And, and, you, and leading you down the path of death and destruction. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Then the Lord stretched out his hand, you know what I'm saying? You grab it, you know what I'm saying? And the Lord pull you to safety, man. Mm -hmm. All of us need to thank the Lord even more, right. man. That's right. Straight right. up, man. That's right. That's right. It says, um, the beginning of wars and the power shall stand in fear. Yeah, these elites. They stand, they're going to stand in fear because they're going to be seeing the things that are happening are abnormal. Yeah. See, they, they so prideful. They think they're running shit. Man. Yeah. Excuse my language. You ain't running nothing, man. Right. The Lord's going to make it known that you're not. Right. He's going to be, bring fear upon the whole earth. That's right. Yeah, say, the scriptures say, um... Rain fear upon these nations that they may mm, know, men. yeah, yep. and not gods. Yeah, yep. Psalms. Yep. It says, um, the beginning of evils, mm, beginnings of bad times. Okay, more homicides, more violence. Yep. Uh, more evictions. That video about that um that dude, you know what I'm saying? The pole. Well, I say oh, yeah, the, yeah, the, the yeah, pole yeah, in the, the, pole, the, yeah, skull, the pole in the head. You know what I'm saying? This pole in the skull. That's gonna be something normal, bro. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? That's gonna be like. And you'll keep on moving. Yep. You ain't gonna say nothing. Right now, you're saying something mm -hmm. about it. Cause it, it really ain't that yep. normal. You know what I'm saying? Because a B dub. You yep. know what I'm saying? And the B dub is supposed to be protected. Yep. You know what I'm saying, bro? You're, you're Protect supposed to, you're supposed, yeah, you're supposed to keep running to her defense, bro. Right. Look, look. F what she did. Right. You know what I'm saying? F what she's doing. Mm -hmm. Protect her at all, all costs. Cost. That shit going right. out the window. That shit going out the window, man. Mm -hmm. right. And it went out the window already. No facts. Facts. Was all the Captain Saver H's H to the Izzo's, you know what I'm saying, yesterday? Mm. Who they at, bro? Right. A lot of them passed by, right? Where they at? Where you at? You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Didn't try to do nothing. You bitched up, didn't it, bro? Yep. Shit mm. got real. Because mm -hmm. what that's the thing about it, the Lord said for every hard rock, I got somebody even yep. harder than that. Always. And, and that, that dude right there, he was more than a hard rock. Mm. He was a spirit creative of vengeance, man. That's right. Mm. You know. The Lord said, um, and the power shall stand in the fear of the beginning of evils. What shall I do when these evils shall come? Yep. Hey, as we see that vision, man, it was a very fearful vision. Mm -hmm. We getting ready to live that. We getting ready to live that moment, man. Very right. soon. Yep. So, you know, the scriptures say, um, arm yourselves with this word. Right. You know, get yourself prepared and build up, store up treasures in heaven. Build that relationship with Yahweh Shem Yahweh Yep. Before it's too late. Because the only way out, the only way to be protected, the only way to eat, only way to be guided, only way to be around those who are like minded is through Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Yep. That's right. I got a precept real fast. Mm hmm. There's a book of, um, because uh, the brother quoted, there's a book of uh, Psalms mm -hmm. 9 and 20. It says, 
put them in fear, O oh, Yahweh, mm -hmm. that the nations may know themselves to be but men. Yep, put them in fear. How's the Lord going to put them through uh, in fear? Through judgments, miracles, wars. wars. All these things the Lord is going to do because it's going to put more fear on the earth to what? Give more glory to Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai. All of this is about giving glory to the real, true, and living power Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai. Because mm -hmm. you got to think now, when the Lord was bringing all them plagues on ancient Egypt, Pharaoh was shook like, mm -hmm. like, yeah. Yeah, real talk. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. He was shook to death, but mm -hmm. the Lord kept hardening that man's mind. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. This devil's shaking, man, but the Lord keep hardening this devil's mind, man. Pharaoh was shook to death, man. Yep. The Lord had Moses turn all the water to blood. Yep. You know what I'm saying? You can't drink that. You can't <laughs> drink that, man. You know what I'm saying? And this thing no had all flies, frogs, and all. <laughs> Come on, man. All your damn animals dying yep. at a drop of a you that, that terrifies a man. Yep. Mm -hmm. Care how, how mighty you are. Mm -hmm. Care how strong you are. You a man, you fear some. Mm -hmm. Every man fears some. And the Lord knows what man fear. He created you, man. Your creator knows what you fear. Yep. You walk around town acting hard all you want to, man. It's a whole lot that we fear. Mm -hmm. right. But but before all that other stuff that we fear, you have about shimmy out shot first and foremost. Yep. Like some brother might be scared of snakes, spiders, or whatever have mm -hmm. you. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, whatever. But before all that, Yahweh Bashim Yahushai comes first. Mm -hmm. the, the, the creator yep. That's right. is to be feared first um, mm -hmm. above his creations. That's right. You know what I'm saying? Because right. shit, because if that was the case, you know what I'm saying, we wouldn't even be out here week in and week out. Facts. If we feared the Lord's creations, we Lord, would never come yep. out here. That's yep. right. You know what I'm saying? Real talk. We fear the creator. That's why we, That's mm -hmm. why, why you think we out here? Black asses, light-skinned asses, red asses, tan asses, whatever. <laughs> Pale asses, whatever, man. We out here because we fear the Lord. That's right. That's right. <clears throat> and if I could say, too, the powers are standing in fear now. Yeah. Because, I mean, you know, the story of the black Jesus, I said it's going to be, y'all want to get rid of me? It's going to be more of, yeah. of, of them like me yeah. that's going to come. And you know that story's been passed down to you know between the elites and their kids, plus the chariot sightings. Like you heard what JFK said, mm. you know what I'm saying? What if we go to heaven, you know what I'm saying? And the God of the Bible is black, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. and, and, then, and we got to think about, you know what I'm saying, what we did to his people that was down mm -hmm. there. That yep. shit haunts them at nights, yep. man. Yep. They're having nightmares at night. They wake mm -hmm. up in cold sweats. The shirt wet. Their mm -hmm. fucking drawers wet. The pajamas wet. Yep. His feet wet as hell. Yep. Cover. Bed yep. destroyed, you know what I'm saying? Waking up in cold sweats, nervous as hell, you know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? Having nightmares, man. Yep. Man, but come on, especially the elites. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Come on, true. man. Mm -hmm. This word has become has has became a terror unto them, man. <laughs> hell yeah. Remember the scripture say, oh, my words are fire. Yep. And these people would. Yep. And it shall devour them. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So these people ain't sleeping right at night, man. We get some good sleep. Oh, hell yeah. The, the Lord said we're going to get some good sleep, some good rest. That's right. And I'd and be forgetting with that, that scripture. That, remember I brought that out that time through the Spirit of the Lord? Oh, yeah. About us getting yeah, some good rest. Yeah, yeah. I got to find that. Lord, I'm going to find that one day this week, Lord's will. Yeah. We'll find that scripture. The men is teaching us where we get good sleep at night. That's yep. right. You know what I'm saying? That's Lord, right. make sure that. Yeah. I slept good as hell last night. Yeah, me too. And Lord, will it'll, it'll be some good sleep tonight, man. That's right. Can we, can we comfort it through the Spirit of Yahweh by Shemar Shai? These wicked people got something to worry about, not us. Well, and we know all our righteousness is as filthy rags. rags. Yep. But the Lord loves us trying down here. That's you right. know what I'm saying? And these defiled ass bodies. These, you better do something. It says, Behold, famine and plague, mm -hmm. tribulation and anguish are set as scourges for a minute. Yeah, scourges represents weapons. You know, weapons for change. So when the Lord brought, you know, that, that one nine, you know, the Lord was yeah. really whipping, whipping his people. But, you know, you, you, you know, you can't. There, there's certain rebellious children that weapons don't even don't even work for. Seems like they got worse. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yep. It seems like when Yahweh about Shem Yahushua, y'all notice that though, man. They got more Ever since um, like 2020 popped off and that, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? Yep. yep. It seemed like right after we came mm -hmm. back from Atlanta, right? Yep. Then we go to Atlanta in 2020. Yep, we did right before yeah. right before it popped yeah. off. Yeah. See, see how the Lord works. Yeah. It seemed like you no know saying soon we got back. Well, yep. well, around the midst of that time, you no know yep. saying everything. Everybody started getting worse. Yep. Yep, cause, cause look, they, they said, they, look, we tired of being inside. When they yeah. came out, they just went wild. Yeah. We outside now. They was using their checks that that Biden or whoever was giving them yeah. to go to Puerto Rico. Dang. They was going all over, man, traveling all, all over on, on on without a job, man. Then they I was getting them PPP loans. Yep, PPP loans, buying Maybacks and all different types of cars and stuff, man. Looking down on the, the working man, mm -hmm. that working man. That's right. Until Esau said, yep, you're going to jail today. 
The Lord said, I'm, I'm, the Lord said, I'm, man, we got, man, there's so much coming down the pipeline. The Lord said, I'm going to give my men, the men that was um, put to shame out there, mm -hmm. for teaching my word, I'm going to give them fame in a place that they was put, put to shame. shame. Yo. Hey, man. This shit's going to be outrageous, yo. For the men of the Lord that stood so stiffly for the name of Yahweh by Shemel Shah, man. You see, the Lord going to turn up. This is your turn up. The Lord right. about to turn everything up, man. Mm -hmm. right. The Lord about to have all kind of people looking out for us, man. Right. Which, which, which they doing that now. That's right. You got different sisters, you know what I'm saying? Look, mm -hmm. um, making garments. You got brothers making necklaces and mm -hmm. things of that nature. You know what I'm saying? Brothers helping out with um funds and things of that nature. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. right. Being brotherly shit, you know what I mean? Yep. Incense. Whatever they can contribute, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. all, all credit to your how about Shemel Shah, man. You know, it ain't all bad. Mm -hmm. Lord had me say that all the time. It ain't all bad, man. Right. Jay walk around like it's all bad every right. day. It ain't bad every day. Lord, that, 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 that's not um, balance, man. It is when you don't have the wisdom. Oh, yeah. Wisdom, you yeah. said miserable are they who don't yeah, have yeah, wisdom. You're right, you're right, you're right. You know what I'm saying? Right. You ain't got wisdom, shit. Hell, yeah. I think somebody put that scripture up on, the, on, on there, too. But uh, It says, um, uh, 2021, 2nd Ezra uh, 16, 21, Behold, victuals, food, mm -hmm. shall be so good, cheap upon earth, mm -hmm. that they shall think themselves to be in, in a good case. And in a good case. Yep, and they still think they in a good case. They, they they see all this popping off, you know, they making jokes about it, all that, because they, they're still comfortable enough to go to the yeah. grocery store and get some food. They still, it, 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 it hadn't really hit them yet. Yeah. Gas prices are going up, but food's still cheap. Reality giving a kick in. Though. Reality get, See, we live in reality. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? The majority of our people, they live in fantasy. Yep. But reality is, is going to override fantasy. Mm -hmm. you, you, soon or later, I mean, you can't run from reality. Right. You can try to run. You can try to job. But eventually, reality catches up to you, man. Hell yeah. And then what you going to do? Especially when reality catches up to you and it doesn't go away. It's just there to stay. You know what I'm saying? Yep. And that's what our people going to be faced with. But right about now, you can go on the internet. You can mm -hmm. order food. You know what I'm yep. saying? Bring it to your crib for a cheap price. Yep. You can still get, you get these dollar stores. Certain stores, you can still get uh, some meat. You know what I'm saying? The packs of chicken and shit for a good mm -hmm. little price or whatever. Because you know these people balling. Yep. You know what I'm saying? They balling right but They got all these good jobs. So spend a couple extra dollars, extra $10 for some wings. You know what I'm saying? Look, it's all good. We got that. You know what I mean? Yep. So they think they step in a good case right about now, man. Mm -hmm. You know, it's, it's over there across the sea. It ain't happening to us. It, look, we, we're in America. Nobody ain't going to touch America. So, all right. Yep. All right. It says, um, Behold, victuals shall be so good cheap upon earth that they shall think themselves to be in good case. Mm -hmm. And even then shall evils grow upon earth. Meanwhile, evils is just continuing to grow. While you think you're in a good case, you think things are going to get better, the Lord is brewing up more and more. Gurgur Truth getting ready to invade this place. Mm -hmm. they, the, the dollar is getting ready to collapse. I think he um, he put, uh, the brother put uh, the pr uh, precept he was looking for, too. Yeah, yeah like the brother put on the comment mm -hmm. board, these Americans mm -hmm. are proud, you no know saying, for no damn reason. No Just reason. because, you know what I'm yep. saying? Yep. It says, um, uh, what was I at? Oh, yeah, yeah. That they shall think themselves to be in good case, mm -hmm. and even then shall evils grow upon the earth, mm -hmm. sword, yep, sword, famine, mm -hmm. and great confusion. Yeah, all the plagues the Lord is bringing. You know, many uh, accounts of that, Second Ezra 15, chapter, verse 49. Okay, famine, plague, evils, and what was the other sword. one? Sword. Sword, destruction. So while these people think them, themselves to be in good case, the Lord is stacking up more and more heavier, intensifying the plagues. Yeah. Okay? This is for many of them that dwell upon the earth. We'll bring out like three more scriptures. Cause about you got anything, bro? Um, I got this one too. We'll bring out like three more after I read this, and then we're gonna wrap it up. It's already time. Oh. It says, um, let me see. It says, for many of them that dwell upon earth mm -hmm. shall perish of famine. Paris goes in a die, man. Yep. You know they're going to die right from famine. No food, which is one of the worst ways to die. Right. The worst way to die is better to die by a D.I.E. by the way of sword. Right. You know? Then to So that to, woman was better off than a whole mm -hmm. lot of people, man. When it got her head, yeah. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, the, um, yeah. the pole to yep. the skull. Pole to the skull. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know, you're not a tube, yep. You know yep. what I'm saying? They don't want you to get graphic, but it's getting ready to get graphic. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Uh, uh, they they um, violated our community guidelines. The Lord is getting ready to violate you, period, man. Yep. 
You see, the Lord is going to violate your system, man. Yep. You see? That's right. It says, um, and the other that escaped the hunger shall the sword destroy. Yeah, if you were able to flee from a bear, hey, you're going to be met with a lion, so to speak. Amos 5 and 18. From one plague to another. You, you got through, you happened to get some food, you ran up on somebody's crib or whatever you did, then you're going to D.I.E. by way of what? Sword, destruction, you know? Whether you get caught up in the race riot, it's getting ready to happen, or or you get sent over there in the war. Okay. I want to finish off with this Joel. Yeah. Other brothers finish what they got. Uh, uh, the, uh, if I could just bring um, the this is the precept you might be looking for. Yeah. Um, the brother humble put Proverbs three and twenty four through twenty six. Is it Proverbs three and twenty four? Yeah. Proverbs three and twenty four through twenty six. I'll just read verse twenty four. It says, "When thou liest down, thou shalt not be afraid. Yeah, thou shalt lie down." And thy sleep shall be sweet. Is that a win? Yep, yep, yep. Mm -hmm. Thy sleep shall be sweet, man. Because mm -hmm. we trust in you, how about Shemiah you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I mean, because whatever's going to happen is going to happen, right? Yep. I'm saying, I'm, we're not going to be up all night looking out the damn window. You know what I'm saying, bro? Right. You ain't went to sleep, you're just looking out the window, scared. You know what I'm saying? Nah. Right. Nah, nah, man. We're getting good sleep. What's that again, bro? Yep, it says Proverbs 3 and 24. When thou liest down, when we lay down, when we go to sleep, sleeping in our bed, go ahead. Thou shalt not be afraid. Ain't no need to be afraid. Mm -hmm. Scripture say, fear not thy worm, Jacob. I'm going to help you. I'm going to save you. I'm going to mm -hmm. deliver you. We're serving the Lord, brothers. You know what I'm right. saying? We're yeah. serving the entity that created everything mm -hmm. and everybody. And, and look, the same entity that controls the minds of these people. That's who we serve. So why be afraid? That's right. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. It reads on, yeah, thou shalt lie down, and thy sleep shall be sweet. Yeah, get some good rest, man. Don't brother be sleeping good, yep. though, man. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Brother be sleeping good, man. Mm -hmm. I did, I, the Israelites, you know what I'm saying, that took them 501c3 charters oh, yeah. or made a covenant with the heathens, they're not sleeping good at oh. night. Shit, shit, these different entertainers say they got to take the mirrors out of yep. their house. Yep. Damn. They see them demons, you know what I'm saying, that they made a pattern. Mm -hmm. That's right. Yep. We sleep, we don't want to sleep good at night. Mm -hmm. You're serving Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai, the men and women, because the women serve the Lord by serving a man. Yep. You're sleeping good at night. Mm -hmm. If you ain't serving your husband, you know what I'm saying? You ain't sleeping good at night. That's right. Tossing and turning, being, your damn brain being played at night, you know what I'm saying? All kind of shit happening to you. But if you're doing what you got to do, you sleep good at night. Mm -hmm. I sleep good every night, man. Mm -hmm. I might have my little, I, I rarely have dreams. <laughs> I, I mainly see numbers. I think you brother be having them dreams, them yeah, visions. Kind of. I mainly see numbers, but you know, other than that, though, man, I, for the most part, though, I sleep good at night, man. That's right. Go ahead. Same here. That's it on that. That's it on that. Cool. Yeah. yeah Kapasha, did you have some, bro? Yeah, I got that second answer. The fourth chamber chapter. Yeah, read that right quick. Because yeah. I about then you read Jordan, I'll finish it off with this and we'll wrap it up. Okay. Second answer. The 14th chapter, the 16th verse reads, For yet greater evils. Then those which thou hast seen happen shall be done hereafter. Yep, greater evils. You know, nice. that's why scripture says the time that's coming on earth has never been since the earth was created. Mm -hmm. And think about it. We in uh Babylon the Great America, mm -hmm. the hub of where all this wickedness was pushed out. So you Hell know yeah. the Lord is gonna be honing in on Babylon the Great. He says it's gonna be worse than, than when he overthrew Sodom and Gomorrah. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? It's going to be worse for this place, man. Mm. All the multiple warheads are going to hit this bitch. Mm -hmm. And then on top of that, the chariots shooting the laser beams. Hell yeah. And then the Lord said he's going he gonna, to uh, put his spirit in the missiles. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And you know the Lord is a consuming fire. Mm -hmm. He's angry. He's coming with wrath. These people through, though, man. I'm you know, just going to get abroad, do what y'all mm -hmm. got to do. Just, just know, you know so y'all going to be like the people in Ukraine soon. Hell yeah. Screaming, hollering, All trying ass. to find an underground bunker. Mm -hmm. you, 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 the people ain't going to let your ass know that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Them, them um, places over there, they, they most definitely had underground bunkers. Mm -hmm. So you got apartment complexes and shit, you know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? Them underground bunkers over there. You know what I'm saying? Because mm -hmm. that's our um, war-torn um, country. Yep. So of course they're not going to build regular shits like this, man. You know what I'm right. saying? You know? Go ahead. There's one more. One more verse. Yeah. And verse 17, second answer, 14th chapter, the 17th verse reads, For look how much 
the world shall be weaker through age. Yeah, the world has been weaker through age because the wicked is ruling. Mm -hmm. No, they turn everything upside down. So that's when Earth needs a reset. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? It's about time for a reset, man. Mm -hmm. You see? The Earth tired, mm -hmm. man. Tired, bro. You know the Earth beat down. The Earth is a spirit too. Mm -hmm. Beat down, man. Yep. No land Sabbath. You got these M.O. just digging in. Oh yeah, just digging in it. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Constantly. Look at the water, man. Water. That's part of the earth. Animals. You know what I'm saying? The earth fighting back now, man. Mm -hmm. The earth tired, though, man. It's time for a reset now. Mm -hmm. People tired, man. You know, working two, three jobs. You ain't get no day off for a lot of these people. Look at them. Yeah, look Same at them ones from again. earlier. Yep. Yeah, so. You know what I'm saying? Look how she walking, bro. Like, doing the most. It cold or something? Mm -hmm. It was too much. Mm -hmm. We spent all that money on some damn food. Somebody got to pick you up. Get them feet her. hurt. She's going to drop her. She's going to drop her. My damn feet hurt. Yeah, watch her drop. Boom. Shouldn't have came outside like that anyway. Mm -hmm. Look at the Jake one. Just got to be in the midst of them. Everybody had to dress the same. I'm saying with the little slip little outfits. Them, <laughs> them damn heels, I'm saying, tore to her feet up. Hmm. A thong, man. <laughs> Go ahead, though, bro. Top of, of, of 17? Yes. Second uh, Ezra, 14th chapter, 17th verse read. For look how much the world shall be weaker mm -hmm. through age, mm -hmm. so much the more shall evils increase upon them that dwell hmm. therein. And having that happen, evils have been increased, man. Mm -hmm. Those who are able to live, you know, uh, longer life here, you know, brothers and brothers in their 30s, 40s, whatever. You see the difference between just the 80s, 90s, and, and early 2000s. Right. And to now, the, the greater evils. I mean, we're seeing women walking by half naked, literally yeah. showing their bodies, you yeah. know. Just, it wasn't like that in the in the early to, in, uh, 90s. Right. It wasn't like that, man. Disrespecting these kids to their parents and all these different things, the greater evils, because the wicked is ruling. Right. So this place needs to be destroyed. This place needs to go out, man. Do you see all them articles the Lord be having me bring out on them in the news? Mm -hmm. See all them deletions that be going know, on, bro, man? Bro. Every article be a deleted deletion, yep. man. Yep. You know what I'm saying? From the men, the women, and the children, yo. All them deletions going on, man. That's it of that, bro. That's all of Cause I'm about bring yours out, bro, and then I'm going to bring this, and then we'll wrap it up. Uh, this is, um, this is uh, again, in uh, Psalms 9, verse 4. Mm -hmm. Ten. It says, Yahweh by Shimon Shine is known by the judgment which he executed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And it says, The wicked is snared in the works of his own hands. <laughs> he getting cut off. Yeah, he's snared in the own works of his hands. You know, those, those, uh, the, his whole agenda that he's trying to push forward, don't realize he just, he just bringing forth prophecy to, to destroy them himself. Yeah. You know, he's basically fulfilling prophecy, but going back to um, the Lord is one controlling the, the king's hearts. You know, having these elites thinking that, you know, they're getting ready to implement this NWO agenda when it's not going to happen. And they're going to use a sword to destroy themselves. He that lived by the sword shall die by the sword. Mm -hmm. You know, but the Lord, but see, the Lord is going to be known by his judgments. He's going to get glory through all these things. Because you're going to consider, you're going to have no choice but to consider that all these things are happening is from a divine intervention. Not Esau, the so-called white man. No. He's in the base man. The Lord leveled him up to be, to fulfill prophecy, man. And we'll never have to hear that, that, that term, happy wife, happy life. Ever. Again. This shit going to burn here with America. That's right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah no, it's a happy life if the man is, ha is happy. That's right. right. You know what I'm saying? That's right. right. This shit going to burn here, man. All America lies, all his philosophies, all his false doctrines going to burn here, man. That's right. It's gonna be a beautiful day, man. You see? Yeah. That was it, bro? Yeah, that was it, bro. I'll read this and we'll close it out. Joel chapter 2, verse 1. Blow you the trumpet in Zion mm -hmm. and sound an alarm in my holy mountain. Mm -hmm. Let all the inhabitants of the land tremble, for the day of the Lord cometh, for it is nigh at hand. That's what, that's what we're doing, blowing the trumpet. This word through the power and spirit of Yahweh Shemel Shai. Warning our people and letting these other nations know what's about to go down. Everyone's going to tremble. Everyone's going to be afraid. And you're seeing the beginning of that with a lot of these people. So don't be surprised you get more uh, text messages or calls from people saying what's going on. 
Because as these things get worse, the men of the Lord are going to be more cold spirit, less interacting with people. And, and, and they're going to see the calmness on, a, on our spirit with some of those men. And they're going to come and try to ask us questions. People are going to be reaching out. Okay? But the Lord says he's bringing, he's bringing death and destruction. You know, let all the land, let all the inhabitants of the land tremble. You're supposed to be afraid. You're supposed to be fearing your house, man, with your ears and lights, man. That's right. A day, a day of dark, darkness, like a day of darkness and of gloominess. Yep, a day of darkness, uh, evil, evil times. Mm -hmm. No good times coming. That's right. Uh, you know, a famine. No, no food. But is that good times? No. Uh, violence. Somebody chasing your ass down. You got uh, lions mauling people. Is that good times? No, it's a day of darkness, gloominess. A day of, and it's going into the missiles, a day of darkness and of mm -hmm. gloominess, mm -hmm. a day of clouds and thick darkness, mm -hmm. as as the morning spread upon the mountains, mm -hmm. a great people, going into the, going into the, the missiles, missiles yep. a great people and a strong, there have not been ever the like, neither shall be any more after, after it, even to the years of many generations, because there ain't going to be no mm -hmm. need for war. Yep. This the this the end all be it all. You know yep. what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. The missiles gonna do the job. Mm -hmm. The Lord created them missiles to do the job, man. Yep. You see? Yep. Those missiles are compared to as an army. Yep. Uh, you know, an army itself. Yep. It is a fire devoureth before them, and behind them a flame burneth. That flame that's going uh, that's that's uh, pushing that missile out. Yeah. You know. It says um and behind them a flame burneth the land America Babylon the land of us. Uh, the land is as the Garden of Eden before mm -hmm. them. Yep. And behind, it was a paradise before. You know, it was a, it, this, this land was, uh, matter of fact, was this the land that King Solomon uh, sent forth, you yeah. know, the Navy to yep. get resources? Harabif. You know? I think that was Harabif, right? The dude, you know what I'm saying, that controlled, that knew the ships can't and remember. all that shit. One of his name, bro? Can't remember. Was Zogba? That, yeah, I, I can't remember his name either. Yeah. I know he was a Hamite, though. Yeah. Yeah, he was Hamite, yeah. He was, yep, yep. You know, so I think that was him. Mm -hmm. So America was, uh, was a big giant paradise before these yep. missiles hit. You see everybody having fun. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. All hell break loose. Everybody's still having fun. So this place is like a big paradise mm -hmm. compared to these other countries. Yeah, mm -hmm. all the nations you know want to visit here. Mm -hmm. You still got some nice places in, in um, America, mm -hmm. man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Greenery and shit, lakes mountains. and shit, great lakes, mountains and shit. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? It says, um, and behind them a desolate wilderness. Yea, and nothing shall escape. Yep, we got it, bro. With the missiles here, ain't nothing escaping. Mm -hmm. Know what I'm saying? So get your party on. It's a paradise for the majority of these people right about now. But when no missiles here, it's going to be a desolate wilderness, man. Only thing that's going to dwell here when it's all said and done is desert creatures. That's right. Yep. That's right. Anybody in the closing comments? Uh, hey, just turn back to y'all bust your mouth shut as quickly as possible, man. Mm -hmm. You know, while you still can. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. so, uh, you know that all these prophecies are coming to pass and judgment is on the way. Mm -hmm. you know? That's yep. all I have. Time. Hey, the time is here. This is it, man. The Lord's going to really shut this thing down and, and increase it even more. And uh, it's going to be too late at some point in time you know, for, for you to see the Lord if you haven't. Mm -hmm. So get right or get left. That's right. Oh, yeah, the scripture says, man, no, it's not his time. Mm -hmm. Don't get caught in the snare. Don't get caught in the trap, man. You got it, man. Hey, so with that being said, before we close out, we want to give all praises to the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son. Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rekakwadash. Double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone for teaching us the 100% truth according to the Bible and who will well. Double Shalom to all you Akim and you Akwa, those of the hopeful elect that are seeking for salvation. Shalom. Shalom. And DTA, Abab, Abal, soon and very soon. Shalom. Shalom. My mind won't turn off for some reason.